Guys, we're going to be starting in just about a minute or two, and you'll soon be hearing my theme song. Welcome to Fish Friday. Folks, this is going to be a very special Friday for everybody. <clears throat> and uh, I'm going to be reviewing fast food restaurants, fast food fish, starting with uh, Jack in the Box. It was delivered earlier today. Uh, and I had a little... Perry, I'm sorry. Can you get that dining room light off? Oh, wait. Do I got to turn on a light? Yeah, Perry, I'm sorry to interrupt your intro, but I keep telling you, I, I told you before we started to turn that dining room light off. Can you please do it now? Oh, oops. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Hey, don't mind me. Finish your intro. Oh, shit. And uh, we'll talk about Perry's new chair in a little while. You'll, you'll, you'll understand where he got that. But no! Everything's so close to me and falling over, so forgive me. Shit. God damn it. I'll pick that up in a moment. Let me let me finish my intro. So folks, I wanna introduce my fish Friday. I just dropped a, a can of a monster and a, another bottle of water over there. So okay, so this evening's show is called Fish Friday, and it's because we have, excuse me for belching, but we have all the fast food restaurants that we're going to be reviewing, McDonald's, Jack in the Box, uh, uh, Wendy's, but we're, what we're reviewing is fish sandwiches specifically, the best fast food restaurant it has fish sandwiches. You know, uh, Jack in the Box sent me, or somebody sent me some fish from Jack in the Box earlier today, uh, and that's uh, going to be going to be eaten, of course, in just a moment. Um, then there'll be, but I got to get to what happened on Tuesday. And Tuesday, please, 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 all my friends and fans on on the stream, please forgive me. For being such a jerk last Tuesday, I uh, that that raw fish that came to my house was like the devil just came into my home and put an evil evil uh, wicked spell on me and turned me into one hell of a demon that made me just go ballistic. I, I am so 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 sorry, so sorry for last Tuesday's. Sorry to my followers, my subscribers, to everybody out there. I, I, I and of course, especially to my my uh, my boss Tom Brennan, my my director, my publicist. Um, it it's it's just very sad that I had to become what I became last Tuesday. I was I can only remember myself being that angry and that possessed one other time, and that was. Uh, if I can remember correctly, I believe that was one time in Palm Springs uh, right after my auto accident when I wanted to use the car and to see a girlfriend late at night and my mom wouldn't let me use it and I just went fucking AWOL Ugh, and attacked my mom and it was just af right after my auto accident. But uh, that, that that's a long time ago, so I don't need to get into that story. <clears throat> but anyhow... Last Tuesday's behavior, I pray to God, will never, ever, ever happen again. I, I, I don't ever want to have last Tuesday's behavior to ever happen to me again. Um, let, let's 
that raw that raw fish literally possessed me and made me fucking ballistic. And that and that was the reason. I'm going to kindly ask you folks, please do not send me any raw fish tonight. Please, because I don't want to fucking lose my mind again. I do not want to lose my mind again. <sighs> Okay, Perry, uh, that's a very nice intro, and um, excuse me for jumping in, but I'm going to tell you straight up, there's a very good possibility that somebody will send you raw fish based on your behavior on Tuesday, and you're just going to have to uh, suck it up. I'm going to have to suck it up. Let me let me get what just fell off my... Uh, uh, my are you already table. losing concentration? You, you, you're, no, you're I'm not, not listening to me at all, are you? I, I just don't want to... Uh, first... I want to fuck up. With less than 10 minutes into the stream and he gets up for the first time. I just don't want to fuck up what I was trying to... Okay. Okay. Listen. Listen to me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Not only are you going to get fish... I'm assuming you're going to get offers in to do things with the fish that you're not going to like. Right? Yeah. Okay. So uh, Perry and I discussed this uh, at length. Uh, in fact, if you're on Perry's uh, Patreon, uh, you can listen to that discussion. Uh, I think we put that up yesterday. But I have uh, veto power over certain offers that you'll say no to. Nothing crazy. Well, we'll see. How. I'm not going to, again, have you do anything you know, lewd, but uh, there, there, there's got to be some kind of payback tonight. You know, not just for me, but for, for the subscribers, for the followers. For all, a lot of people we right. heard from were disgusted after uh, your behavior on Tuesday. So we got a, you got a lot of making up to do. Yes, sir. Can I also mention how uh, honored and thankful I am to what happened to me yesterday? Uh, if you want to get into that now, you can get into that. Yes. All right. All right. So, so, so real quick, yesterday, uh, a gentleman knocked on my door from Twitch and gave me an award. Let me, sh let me show this. I'm moving that over there and pull this out over here. The, the chair that I'm sitting in, he gave me this chair. Let me show you folks this chair. He pulled myself out of here. Give me the, that he didn't give me, but the chair he gave me. Give me a brand new, uh, like, like like a Kingsman chair for uh, sitting at a computer. I use this this back thing for my bad back, my bad low back. But it's a streaming chair for people like myself that, that are always on the internet uh, for their job and stuff. So um, it's an honor to get this brand new streaming chair. Oh my God! And 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 then he handed me this uh, little trophy. Oh, well, wrong way. This this uh, uh, ch ch turn. There we go. This trophy. Uh, it's it says Twitch 2020 best new channel Perry Caravello live. Wish I could hold it better. Uh, no. I am I am honored beyond belief on how amazing this is. I, I now now the, the, he gave me this he gave me some cash. Um, it, it's incredible, and I am so honored and so thankful for what this gentleman did for me from uh, Twitch. Um, it. it, it I, and, he got me this chair because they don't like me getting up and down so much and it's an honor and I'm so grateful and thankful for this uh, this lovable gift. Oh my god and I it, this 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 really taught me a lesson and snapped me back into reality because man my 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 uh disobedience and uh unforgiving uh sarcasm last Tuesday <clears throat> was was just way out there and I acted way too way too unprofessional and way too much like an asshole to everybody on the stream uh, especially my my uh, my my moderators and my boss 
on the stream. I mean, I mean, I just went way overboard, way overboard. And this channel is only five months old, and I won the best new channel in 2020. That's that meant two months out of 2020. Let's use this, these two. Two months in the in the year 2020 that I won best. It's because I started in November, so it was the month of November, December, and then and then you know January, February, March, and bam, I get Twitch 2020 award best best new channel Perry Caravella Live. For the year 2020. In freaking credible. And, and guess who used to sit and own this chair before me? Dark Side Phil. It was Dark Side Phil's chair. And now it's my chair. So this chair goes to the streamer of the year. And I guess Dark Side Phil was the streamer last year. Now it's my chair for this year. <clears throat> for 2021. And I plan to keep it for the next 10 years. So. <laughs> so when Darkside Phil. <laughs> when Darkside Phil lost this chair. He started crying like a bitch. Because he lost this chair. All because of my streaming. And, and my stream became so popular. And so famous. But now I'm the streamer of the year, so Dark Side Phil can, uh, I can say he can kiss my ass. I'm not going to be rude and say he can kiss my ass. But uh, then again, what the hell? Dark Side Phil, kiss my ass! Yeah, piece of shit, you disrespectful piece of garbage. It's mine now, because I'm the, I'm the award winner this year, my friend. Thank you. This year, this chair is like the Stanley Cup. It only goes to the best. And myself and my team are the best. Thank you. And I thank all of my uh, subscribers as well as all of my uh, friends and family that are watching my uh, stream right now. I love you all and I thank you all for coming on to the stream to, uh, to uh, check this out. And also... What do you guys think of this uh, T-shirt that uh, that I got here? You like this shirt? It's uh, this shirt is for today for uh, Fish Friday. This is the Fish Friday shirt for Fish Friday, and today is Fish Friday, and uh, there's there's a few things that are going to be happening this evening. And and folks, I am definitely going to be making up for my behavior for last Tuesday. Don't you people worry about it. I was a real jerk and a real disrespectful prick last Tuesday, so I definitely plan on making up for it to all of you. Please. It's from the water from over here. And that's, Perry, that's very good. And I will say uh, last night was kind of unexpected when he was visited by the uh, Twitch representative with the chair, with the award, with the cash, and uh, you'll be able to see – uh, you know, it's a little too long to put on uh, the stream here, but uh, you'll be able to see that on uh, Perry's Patreon, uh, if not tomorrow, the next day. The whole thing w was filmed, uh, Perry getting the new chair, getting presented with the award, and uh, a lot of other stuff at uh, patreon.com slash Perry Caravella. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Well, let's see. Uh, so before... I want all my fans to look forward to checking that out. Uh, if not tomorrow, the next day. But uh, before the delivery start rolling in, let's see what the people are saying. And uh, let's, uh, you ready to go, Perry? Let's see it. Yes, sir. Let's end with some love. Keep fighting the good fight, Perry. That's a very polite and lovable remark. Thank you. Thank you. 12, 12, 21, the son will die and the father will rise again. Blessed be cookie by divine homosexual virtue, he will return to suck off sailors. Amen. What the fuck are you talking about? How dare you make a despicable, demented, demonic remark like that? Yeah, 12, 12, 12 was when my father died. Now you want to reverse 12, 12, 12, make it 12, 12, 
21? How fucking demented are you, sons of bitches out there? Fuck all of you, you fucks that, that agree with that stupid uh, comment. Fucking evil bastard. I don't want that to fall out of my ear, so I'm sorry. Would you like a 75 to 100 pound pallet of fresh wild card halibut to be delivered to your address? What is a square foot no. of the terrace? No fucking way. No fucking way. But did, did you fucking hear what I said? No raw fish any longer. God damn it. And excuse me for saying god damn it. I just... Excuse me again. Harry, a reminder that you do these streams to get funds to pay your bills. Please remember later when you are threatening to quit. Big fan. I had a big reminder about that this week, Curtis. Thank you. Tom, if this two stairs go into total mode tonight, no one will blame you if you drop them like a plastic ear piece. Hashtag tips for tomb. Thank you, Curtis. And uh, I will definitely keep that in mind. We're going to hope to keep toddler mode to a minimum tonight. Right, Perry? I plan on it. Yes. Yes. To a minimum. Hey, sweetie pea, when you last made love to Linda Johnson in 2009, what kind of strap-on did she use on you? Was it thick and black like myself? Linda never used a strap-on. Linda never needed to use any, any stupid devices to try to make it look like she was getting turned on by something uh, other than myself. She loved me. She cared about me. Uh, and, and I gave her everything she wanted back in 2009, all the way up until I drove her to the airport for her to go home to Florida. Yes. Hey, Perry, can I it's ask you a question? Did you, Lyndon did you, Johnson. Okay, can I talk for a second? Did you open the blinds or something? There's a, there's a ton of light coming in from your terrace there. Is there a way to minimize that, Nothing, or is that just the time? It's, 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 it's closed to the... To the closing. I mean, there's no opening. I mean, I got it shut all the way. Okay. Well, this it's just the time of day. I mean, right? it's we'll because have... it's this time of day. the The sun is going down, and uh, okay, it's this time of day when we'll this with it. happens. We'll live with it. Give it about an hour or so. Cause it's five twenty-five right now, and uh, in, in about fish an hour. Fish is on your menu, but not fried fish. How am I going to tell other athletes that I'm your trainer when you look like a whale who can't kickflip? What the? That kickflip I saw. Uh, first off, Simone, uh, I don't have the strength in this right arm and in the right side of my body to be able to do backflips. So uh, don't even think that I'm going to be, be able to do that, that sort of thing. After my third neck surgery, that, all that went away. Read my username out loud. Ivana, Ivana, cock to eat. I can't read because of my eyes. Hey, T-shirt Tucker motherfucker. Don't apologize for stuff that you will immediately do again. It's disingenuous even for a lying douche like you. Thank you. Thank you. I, I uh, don't plan on uh, wigging out over getting raw fish at my door like I had... But I don't want it here, and if it comes, I'm afraid if it comes, uh, I'm going to have to deal with it and understand that uh, this is because of what happened last Tuesday. So it's it's uh, payback time, 
and I'll have to, and I'll have to, I'll, I'll have to put up with it. Please, please, please don't send it to me because, uh, I don't want that to ever happen again. But, uh, what can I do? If it comes to me, it, it, Can you do me a favor, my love, and send me some topless photos of Stacy Peralta when you get a chance? She had the best double D's in the biz. You're sick. Stacy Peralta. God almighty, you're sick, dude. Stacy Peralta is a guy, okay? He's he's a pro skateboarder from the olden days. Meaning meaning from 1977 and beyond. Alright? He's the one that started the Bones Brigade. He's the one that started the act, the, uh, the 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 Paul Peralta um, team for the for the X Games, uh, all that good stuff. Okay, he's not he he's not a she. All right, so stop saying she. Stacy is a man and always was a man. He's a very nice guy too. New fans, don't forget to include hashtag tips for Tomb after every tip comment to show our appreciation for Tomb Be Mobile Bless. Hashtag tips for Tomb. Well, thank you for being kind to Tom, but I don't know why you're being kind to Mole. What, what, what did Mole do? Mole's not a part of this stream. Mole's only a part of Windy City Heat and the Big Three podcast. Perry, we're getting ready to send over our turtle sandwich for tonight. Do you like medium or well-done turtle? It's technically a fish. Belushi. Oh, boy. I've never eaten turtle before. So if it's if it's in a sandwich, then I'll then I'll eat it. But if it's if it's if it's uh, a dare for me to like eat the turtle with the turtle shell and, you know, something crazy. No, no way am I doing that. No way. Gar, are ye the scurvy land lubber asking for carp? Me crew your tales of a chest in ye apartment filled with fish and fabrics. It be ours. I don't want any carp or any fish like that sent into my apartment at all. At all. Perry, I'm willing to give you another shot, but I need to know something. Why did you say you would only date the black actress from WCH and not marry her? I'd marry her too. She was she was another beautiful actress. They were all beautiful. Please. Perry Happy Fish Friday. Now do us all a favor and smash the shit out of that microwave. Two hundred dollars to smash that old piece of shit. Don't be a pussy. <laughs> Clint Eastwood, if you're the real Clint Eastwood, no way in hell am I smashing a brand new microwave that's only, what, about six eight to maybe eight months old? Please. It's a freaking brand new microwave, you dumbass. Thanks for doing another stream while I'm at work. Can you make the stream eight hours so I can watch the end of it? You're the best. <clears throat> well, we'll see how long it goes tonight. I don't know. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for subscribing. Scaremaster, how many fingers did Randy slip into your ass when you guys blew each other in 1992? Also, did he use lube on you or go in dry? Cats? You're disgusting, you sick fucking pervert. Oh, my God. 
He didn't slip any fingers in my ass, you fucking perv. God damn, this guy's fucking sick. Congratulations. You are formally invited to Credenza Fest 2021 on June <clears throat> 9th. Bring your favorite Credenza and Ender to win $500,000. Not interested. Fucking knucklehead. How, how, how in the fuck am I going to bring a fucking Credenza? You know how fucking big it is to move that damn thing? I don't have the strength to move that any longer after my third neck surgery. Quit streaming, you quitter. I can't wait to see you homeless as I drive past in my new Bugatti and throw a bag of raw fish at you. Go fuck yourself, you pile of dog shit. Well, I can't wait to see you go to hell, you fuck. Piece of fucking loser fucking shit. Hey, Perry, can Robin, you please install a toilet cam in your apartment? No, no, no toilet cameras in, in my apartment at all. At all. I'll lose my channel if I install a toilet camera. Also, for every fish you eat, we will donate a fish for you to keep as a pet. We will send a tank to, is the address still 7722 Reseda Boulevard? Oh, God. Yes, it's 7722. Everybody in the whole fucking world knows where I live. Perry, it's Wes Most. My kid is doing a paper about you for school. Can you tell the RSC story but leave the part out when you swallowed him whole? I never swallowed him whole. Never. Okay. And I'm not telling the story again. I've been telling it for fucking, what is it, since 1992? So fuck you. You don't need to hear the goddamn story again. Hey, Perry, yeah. sorry, to, sorry to interrupt, but um, it is Friday. It, it, I know it's Fish Friday, but traditionally on Friday, Friday we also do mailbag. And I know that you had a box specifically to be opened on Fish Friday. So why don't we get to that? Because didn't that have Fish Friday on it? Yeah. So what, right what, there. Yeah, let's 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 tear that open and see what we got. All right. I don't want to do that. I might. Uh, I might slice myself. There you go. person to pack this did a good job all right to Perry read first okay let's read the envelope first Some young guy. A visa, visa gift card fell out. That's what it says here. Visa gift card. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. A fifty dollar gift card is very nice. Thank you, Perry. Uh, in my in my homeland of Sweden, these are some of the finest. Uh, Lights. I need to see something here. I can't. I can barely read. In my homeland of Sweden, these are some of our finest delicacies. I'm sure you've heard of Swedish fish, but uh, surstamming sur, surstamming is best enjoyed on crackers. Uh, pop the can and enjoy. I love your stream. <clears throat> I love your biggest fan, Susan. Susan, dear. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so, so much. And here again is the gift card. 
Right, here's crackers. Mini Swedish fish, mini. And a can opener. Oh Jesus! And the and the can is is spoiled because of the way it's 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 ballooned. This is spoiled fish right there. So uh, because of it being ballooned, and if they want me to the oh shit, I I personally because of being a grocery clerk. And working in the grocery stores, I personally know this canned fish is spoiled fish because of the can being ballooned. That it's it's no good to eat. It's actually dangerous to eat, and very deadly to eat. Let me so is, let me ask you a question, Perry. Is that can opened? No. Let me see the can again. Oh, brother! It's it's. I don't know. About, I don't know about this one. Yeah, it's it's no good. The bottom's even. Com- well, I'll know, tell you what. Blown up. Why don't you Why don't you open it a little bit? But obviously, you're not going to eat it because I don't want you eating spoiled food. But let's let's yes. crack and open it just a little bit. All right, let's see how this works here. What's the matter? What's the matter? I, I, I just, I just, I just popped the, the, the can and it's, it's like fucking hell. Okay. Open, Holy open smokes. it up. Just, let's just open it and show it and then we'll get, you can dispose of it as you wish. This can opener is not good either. It won't, it won't open it. Give it your best shot. It won't even it won't even go around the can because of how, how fucked up this thing is. Yeah, it, it won't even go around the can. It stinks like fucking hell. Well, how much of it did you actually open? Shit. Let me let me let me go grab a fucking paper towel. What is it leaking? Yes, everywhere. Okay, why don't you just try to? Yeah. Uh, Perry, no way will I taste the this. back of the no back way. of the chair. The back of the chair facing the camera is not working for me. So why don't you just try to open it a little bit more? We we want to see what's inside, and then you can get rid of it. Jesus Christ! You're fu- you're you're fucking insane. It won't even open, you know, because of the way the. We'll give it an old college try. Really, you'd be aggressive with it. Won't even 
don't even turn anymore. It just fucking, it, it, it's just, it's just, it stinks like fucking hell. It's it's just ugh. here's 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 what it is. Okay. Okay. Here's what. Uh, it well, is. let me let me see where you open it at least. Oh oh okay. That, oh, it's that, spilling. Yeah yeah no. Okay. Let's let's get rid of it. Let's get rid of it. Oh, it's falling. It's now it's fucking up the fucking printer. Oh yeah, Jesus. Let's, let's toss it. Jesus. People are asking you to drink the juice, but I'm not going to let you do that. Are you serious? That's disgusting. I, you sick I, fucking losers. Drink I'm not, the juice. I, yeah, I'm not, I'm not going me. to ask you to do that. You fucking assholes. Let's get rid of it. I'm getting rid of it You're right going to start now. getting your fish delivery soon. So let's, uh, let's move I'll it along. It in, I'll, put it in, I'll actually put it in the, in the trash can and put the trash can outside. Ugh. I'm calling you back. I think you hung up on me. Hello. Yeah, so let, let's just get rid of it. It goes in this trash can. The trash can will go outside. Yeah, not right now, though. No. The trash can's going to sit here. Okay. Gonna... Let's, get, let's get back. Let's get back. Oh, you know, while you're up, Perry, why don't, why don't you check your door to see if you got any deliveries? And turn that chair around. It's blocking the camera. Everybody's still in the community so far. Let's go outside. Hold on. Hold on. Let me get out of there. Let me get out there. Okay. I got something from Del Taco. I got door still open. I sent this over here. Okay. Wow, it looks like Fish Friday has officially begun. Yes. Uh, you also got that um, Carl's Jr. bag back by the table that came earlier. Why don't you grab that, too? Carl's Jr. didn't come earlier. It was Jack in the Box that came Jack earlier. in the Box. I'm sorry. Grab the Jack in the Box. How many bags did you get? Did you just get everything at once? I don't know right now. Did anybody knock at the door? I didn't hear any knocks. Did you? Nobody knocked at the door. They, okay. just, they just set it down right outside my door. All right. Well, let's set everything up. <sighs> that fucking can of fish, that spoiled, rotten can of fish is was fucking poison. And it was a delicacy, the fucking poison fish. Disgusting fucking bastards. This whole fucking place stinks like fucking hell now. Okay, we'll take care of that. Let's just, let's, let's focus on the like fish sandwiches fucking... now. It'll be a nice aroma now, wait to a me. Second. I, I don't even know where the hell the goddamn... Oh, there they are. It's on your dining room table. I see it. It's on your dining room table. The bag oh, goes. You don't know what's on my dining room table. Oh, that, that uh, Jack in the Box. The Jack in the Box, yeah. So... Put the bags down, put those down, grab the jack in the box, and let's put everything, let's sit down, and let's get all the sandwiches lined up. Jack in the box was a nice item. Does that need to be heated up in the microwave at all? Nothing's going to get heated up in the microwave, even, even though it's... Uh, 
few hours later. Oh, I because of the don't stench, know about that. The, the night is because young. of the stench in this apartment from from all this raw shit. From all the poison that was just mailed to me. Delivered to me. And I call it poison because of the way uh, they they allowed shit to fucking explode. Hey, is there a way you can move that table to your right rather than right there? That table? Because it's like the chat box this? is kind of obscuring. Yeah, that table. Let's just move it to your right because the uh, the chat box is right over it. Uh, I don't mean to confuse you. Just move it over to your right side. I can't put it down there. I'll leave it right there. Okay, hold on a second here. The bag... And we got to move it along. So uh, if we can get this done quickly. Yeah, well, getting this done quickly is not going to be an easy task. Yeah, make it an easy task. I'm For trying. Me. You owe, You owe me one. Okay. Whew. Now. Right, the table. The, ta- the whole point was to move the table over to your right side. So just take that table. Move it over here? Yes. Impossible. Yes. No, it's Impossible. not. The fucking the bag is here. Loaded the bag. with a ton of shit. Move the bag. Move the bag. Because this doesn't work for me. Because if you're going to have all the fish sandwiches on the table, the chat window covers uh, the thing. So we can't see it. So, yeah, move the bag. And see, not, see, not impossible at all. You just move the bag. Put it on the couch or something. Yeah, there you go. Put it back. Put it back there. No, no, no. It can't go back there. Fucking food is there. Okay, Fuck! so put it, some- put it somewhere where there's not food. Just move it a little bit away. There you go. See? This is what happens on this channel. We make the impossible possible. Uh, we have other issues now on this side, but I think we can work through them. Can you just move the ch- table back a little bit? Yeah, that's good. Back a little bit. Yeah, fix the windscreen. Yeah, there you go. Now let's get all the sandwiches on the table. Let's just get them all out. Let's see what we got. I see Arby's. I see Jack in the Box. I see Wendy's. There's no fish fucking sandwiches to them. Yes, there is. What a crock. What are you talking about, what a crock? Domino's doesn't have fish sandwiches. Well, what is in there? Here's Jack in the Box's lunch. Okay. I don't want the onion rings. I just want the sandwich out. Okay, so just get the sandwich out. Okay, that's Jack in the Box. All right, Here's Jack in the Box. Onion rings. I see, Ar- I see Arby's. I see Wendy's. Let's get those out, too. Wendy's. Arby's is important. I'm, 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 I feel like I'm in Newport Beach at the beach. Why do you say that? Because of the way my apartment smells, like the beach, on the water, Sounds with lovely. fish. It smells like the fish. It smells like the uh, the uh, um. What do you call it? I don't know. What? Why is it taking you so long? I know it takes you a long time to open packages. Why is it taking you a long time to open fast food bags that are already open? They're not open. What are you talking about? They're fucking sealed, stooge. Oh, come on. You know what I mean. That bag you're in right now is open. The bag. 
Leave it at the door. I'll get it in a moment. Thank you. Christ. Somebody who ordered me Arby's gave me two sandwiches from Arby's. Arby's, I believe, has two sandwiches. That's so. exactly what I said. No, I'm right, but they're two, they're two different sandwiches. One's a traditional fish sandwich, and there's a, a Hawaiian fish sandwich that Arby's offers as well. So oh. it's one of each. Let's, uh, want, so can, you get, can, you get to, can you get to your door easily? No, not easily, but I'll get there. Everything right now, you know, this place is just getting more and more fucking crowded. I don't have my mask. Uh, Hello? Hey, Perry, it's Trevor. Trevor. You got it. I mean, come on. I don't know what you're doing. Oh, yeah, I got to get this out of here. Whatever your viewers are doing, man. All right. <laughs> they're killing me. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. No yeah, worries, man. It'll go in the trash as soon as I finish the stream. I hear you. All right. I'm just going to stay here, though. Yeah. Thank you. That was just my next door neighbor, Trevor. Yeah, it's my next door neighbor. Shit. That's your neighbor that watches the stream. That's one on one. Doing laundry right now. Oh. But he's he's disgusted over the smell of the of the fucking raw fish from oh, the so, box so, that I so laid outside. You can't leave the box outside. You can't leave it in your hallway, Perry. You no, it's got it. I can't leave it in my apartment or outside. I got to dump it out, out to do, the... Do, then do that right now. Do that right now. Do it right now. We'll wait. Do it right now. Dump it out right now. You can't You can't. Do, you can't leave it in the hallway. Thank That's going to drive yeah, people crazy. I can't crazy. leave it in the hall. No. No. Thank you. So, so do it right now, but make it quick. Just to just grab it and throw it away. Get get it out in the dumpster. Yeah, yeah. Your neighbors are gonna hate you if you leave that. Yeah, my neighbors not liking that at all. Yeah, of course not. Of and, course not. And, uh, and and you're and you're and you're lucky. Right you're lucky that he's a the fan of the right stream. Love it. It's absolutely disgusting. And this shit is gonna make you get thrown out of here. Okay. Uh, watch yourself. Watch yourself. Watch yourself. Yeah, people already uh, not loving that smell. Oh boy. This is hell. Fucking hell. What's going on? You threw it away, right? Uh, no, I'm not done. I got it's, the hallway smells like a fucking dead body. <laughs> Why did you put it in the hallway? You should have put it on the terrace. The fucking fish I can't open up right there. So what are you doing? You're cleaning up the hallway floor? All right, we'll uh, we'll wait till he comes back. Thanks to whoever sent that. It's a great uh, great way to open Fish Friday. Okay, 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 okay. I believe you have another delivery at the door. Another one? Unfucking believable. Believe this shit. Hello, uh, John. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm sorry for all the bullshit. No, I'm sorry for the smell as well. Have a good night. I don't know what's going on. Another Arby's. Why do I need another Arby's? I don't know. Stop Why not? Let's shit. Let's get Stop back to what the night is. Let's get back to what the night is all about. 
I got a ton of Arby's there. And Arby's in front of me that was just sent. Stop double sending me stuff. Because I'm going to just say fuck it and throw it in the garbage can. No, you're not going to do that, Perry. I think people just wanted to make yeah, sure. Yeah, I will. Arby's. Yes, I will. No, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. So, okay, let's, let's get back to where we were and uh, open up the uh, sandwiches. Come on, open up the sandwiches. Remove that. I'm opening. Fuck. No, you're not. You're staring. All right, now. Would you shut your fucking mouth? God, you're a fucking asshole to me. Ain't it? Ain't it? Ain't it? Ain't it? Hey, this is, what did, uh, hey, Perry, hey, Perry, what did we talk about your attitude towards me? What did we talk about? Yeah, my, my attitude is hell right now. No, okay? no, no. Well, that's because not. That's, of the I'm not. I'm not putting up with that tonight. So let's just get to the fish reviews. You can move the keyboard aside. You don't need the keyboard. Yeah, that goes over there. The towels go there. Okay. The, okay. Now, this is an Arby's uh, fish. And, uh, I think it's a regular fish. Uh, th this one's the regular Arby's fish. Big, big piece of cod. Okay, Inside. let's get let's get them let's get them all open. Let's put them all on the table and get them all all open. Move There's the bag. There's no fucking room to open them all, you stupid motherfucker! It's one at a time. Hey, what did we talk about, Perry? You don't scream at me, and 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 if I tell you to do something, you're gonna do it. I want them all. This is a tasting test. No, don't eat it now. We're gonna get them all open. Look, I have one fucking little fucking space. That's no, no bigger than where the keyboard is. You got, excuse me, excuse me, Perry. You got a table. That's why we got the table. The table aren't to, the table isn't to hold all the bags. The table is to hold all the sandwiches. That's what the table is for, okay? And be very careful how you talk to me tonight. And scoot over to your right so you're more centered. There's no fucking room here! God damn you! Perry, we talked about this. We talked about this. Calm down and open up all the sandwiches and put them on the table, please. Thank you very much. I can go in the trash because I don't want it. Fish. Is that Burger From King? Burger King. Okay, that's the big fish. Burger King. Doesn't say Burger King there, but it should. There it is. Trash. That's on the floor. Wendy's. Wendy's. This is... Where is this from? Arby's, I think. Yeah, that looks like an Arby's... Wrapping. I believe that's Arby's. Yeah, I think that doesn't say Arby's, but it's, that looks like Arby's myself. Yeah, it's Arby's. Got Arby's, Arby's. Yeah, these are two Arby wrappings. Okay, so the first taste is Arby's. Okay? Okay, where's Jack in the Box? I got Jack in the box right here, and as well as right in front of me, right here. Now, where's McDonald's, the king? Uh, the king is over there. The king is actually the queen because they're on the floor. All right, well, let's get them all on the table. They'll, they'll, they'll come up eventually. All right, but we, you know, McDonald's is the champion. McDonald's champions, is so. the last one because McDonald's is like the 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 general. Yeah, well, you're familiar. Okay, well, let's get started and and give a rating for each one. Yeah. Okay. I'm not eating them all fully. I'm taking a bite out of each one and making my 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 a hearty general... bite. A hearty bite. Yeah, of course. Okay, so this is the uh, I think this is the Hawaiian of the. Uh, of the is it on uh, a Hawaiian Arby's. roll? Can I see? It? Can we show it? You got to show it. Here's here's the roll. I don't know. Yeah, if that's that is the Hawaiian, the Hawaiian roll. Yeah, that's the Hawaiian roll. Okay. Because the other one's got sesame seeds on top. Got okay. it. Well, that looks good to me. It looks like we're off to a great start for Fish Friday. Yeah. So how is it? 
It's it's uh we because it's been sitting around a little bit. It's a little cold, of course. Um, it's tasty. It's it's uh it's got the Arby's taste to it, meaning meaning it's um it's it's grilled. It's uh Arby's grilled. You know what I'm saying? If you eat Arby's uh, roast beef sandwiches and Arby's fish sandwiches. Can you scoot over to your um, right a little bit? Using your uh, rating system, how would you rate this? About a five or a six. It's it's mediocre. It's not it's not the best. Okay. Can you be a little more specific than just saying five or a six? Yeah, well, two or three star, five or five two star, maybe a five three star. It's it's in the middle of the of the. Uh, okay, so well, well let's set, let's settle let's settle on one. Did you say five three star? Two or three, or well, two well, and let's a half. Give a, let's give a definitive one. You got to give a definitive ranking. Then five two. Okay. So five two star, five two star for the five Hawaiian Arby's. The Hawaiian. Okay. Uh, what can I set you so I can have you later? Um, now the regular Harbies with uh, the sesame seed bun and the the regular lettuce, uh, lettuce and and uh, tartar sauce. Let's have a bite of this. I prefer that sandwich over the Hawaiian. Yeah. Why? I. It's got it's got more of a taste. Um. It. it, it I don't know why the Hawaiian the Hawaiian didn't uh, like me so much. But uh, I don't know why this fish has a better taste flavor. Than the Hawaiian does, but I mean, one bite made me made me like this fish better than the Hawaiian fish, uh, and they're both from Arby's. So um, I, I I don't know uh, why why this fish gave me a better flavor, but uh, but the 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 average uh, Arby's gave me a better flavor. Okay, I'll set that off to the side for another for another time to finish this off. Okay. Well, no, you got to give it a rating now. I just, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, a number rating. <coughs> I'll give, I'll give the uh, second Arby's sandwich a, uh, a, a six or a, <coughs> a, um, a three star. <coughs> <clears throat> a three star, three out of five, and um, the star is 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 uh, a three, okay? Because I go a uh, five only five star, so it's a three star, meaning it's a little better than than average mediocre, and yeah, it's a six three star, okay? Six three star. Now Jack in the crack. You got a very complicated ranking system. Well, check in the box. Uh, when it came earlier today, I was a little hungry, so I took two bites out of it uh, when I when I when it first came to the door. But this sandwich is lifted. I mean, lifted meaning it's got two pieces of fish on it. It's got cheese, tartar sauce, tomato, onion, and lettuce. It's freaking loaded. So here, here's here's my bite from this sandwich. This sandwich is definitely, I don't even need to say it's good. It's definitely good because of everything that's on here. Mm. I can't believe you ate a sandwich before you started the stream. That's so. I was hungry. Yeah. Well, what's Again, different about this sandwich to, to in relation to the Arby's? Like, what's on it? You know, how is it different? Again, this sandwich is is loaded. It's got 
tomato, lettuce, tartar sauce. It's loaded. It's loaded. And it's got uh, cheese as well. It's got uh, it's got uh, cheddar cheese as well as Swiss cheese on there. It's freaking loaded. I mean, I'm not gonna finish it now. I'm gonna I'm doing the taste test thing, so I'm gonna go around and, and taste them all, and then and then eat them later. Okay. So, but you got to again, you got to give your rating of the what is this one? Jack in the box. This is this is Jack in the crack. Jack in the crack. Jack in the box. What, I mean. what is your rating? Uh, three star, three, uh, yeah, three or four star. Okay, the number first is a, is a six or a seven, and and uh, uh, I'll, I'll give it a three star. Say seven, three star for Jack you in the can't, Box. You can't say six, seven. It's got to be definitive. I just said seven, three star. Seven, three star. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I set aside... These two I set aside. Those are, those are Arby's. 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 Check in the box. I, sh I said already. I didn't do Wendy's. Wendy's has got a... Uh, <clears throat> Wendy's is is got a, a a piece of meat cut in a square, cheddar cheese. It's got and there's pickles. Thanks, you fuckers. You can remove the pickles. Thank you. Fuck with me. There's fucking pickles on there. Dirty bastards. All right. Fuck it. It's okay. Just scoop them off. Yes, sir. Okay. Now, Wendy's is good. Lo and behold. I mean, yeah, it's a little cold right now because of because of the uh, uh, it's sitting around and stuff. But Wendy's. I'll give it a, a three plus and then a, and, a, and a six or a seven. Okay, wait, so if I'm translating, it's a six, it's it's a six or a seven three star? Yeah. I don't want to okay, say what, four or five right away, because I wanna I wanna get these. So, do you, if you say four six star, or seven, it. do you four. do you it's mean a four? It's a four. Okay. So is it six point five? Is it six point five then? Because six or seven doesn't work. Yeah, no, it's 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 a six. It's a six. It's a six, it's a six, four, six four star. Six four star. That's Wendy's. the defense. Okay. Wendy's is good. Wendy's fish is really good. All right. And this comes from where? What made it good for just just? Uh, I have no idea what made it good. Um, Wendy's. I get. I, I would like to say, right? But, but but over the what previous is it the fish juicy? Is it the, the cheese? Is it the uh, sauce? It, the bun? It's. I get. I, it's. It's because of the way it was cooked. I would say, and okay. because it wasn't cold, maybe. Okay. And it, and, and Wendy's is uh, is uh, normally fish from Wendy's comes from Alaska. Yeah, it's right here. It's uh. Wild, wild cut uh, Alaskan fish. So it's it's Alaskan uh, fish. Okay, that might Wendy's. make the difference. So we know. So what, are we, what are we it's, moving uh, on fresh... to now? What? What oh, are we moving this on? This one to? looks like Burger King. Okay, that's the big yeah, fish. Um, okay, let's get into that. Uh, no, uh, and Burger King's also uh, uh, Alaskan. Uh, somebody's knocking at my door. Let me get the door. Okay. I thought I was done with this. Do 
Just get whatever's there and come back. Thank you. Hi, I am Mr. Kyle. What? Kyle? Kyle sent it. I'm Barry. <laughs> What did you get? What? Well, she she looked at me and she goes, Kyle? And then she laughed and then I says, uh, I said, Kyle sent it. And she laughed and then I said, thank you. And then she left. Okay. That doesn't look like fast food fish, so we can put that to the side for now. Uh, yeah, this this one. This one was more on the dining room table. Right, but we'll get back to that. We're going to respect the queue. We're, we'll get back to that. Right. The other one looks like that could be fast food related, so let's check that out. That's, uh, uh... Okay, that'll sit there with that. How is the smell in the hallway doing, by the way? Uh, sad. What do you mean? I gotta, I gotta clean. Desperately. Do you have a spray that you could spray out there? No, I got to get out there with bleach and clean that. Bleach? Bleach. Okay, well, you can do that after the stream. What's in the uh, bag? This bag says Earl of Sandwich. The name of the place... Is Earl of Sandwich out of Granada Hills? Alrighty. Earl of Sandwich from Granada Hills. Let's open this up. And it's cut this. I think it's a fish as well. Yes, it is. Okay, show it to the camera, please. Earl of Sandwich from Granada Hills. Oh, is that just okay. straight tuna fish? That looks like tuna fish to me. All right, take a bite. We're not going to count this in the uh, overall ranking. No. We'll take a bite anyway. Yeah, it's very good. Five star, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Very good. And very tasty. I'll give that an eight and a five. Okay, that's unofficial, though. We're, we're, we're going to move on to that's the regular the fish, fish sandwiches. Yeah. yeah, you can finish that later. This will go on the dining room table. Just put it aside right now. We don't have to go all the way over there right now. Okay, I'll, I'll set it in the bag. The Great Britain bag. You stay there. No. All right now, this one is this. Uh, Where's this fish from? Burger King. Okay, that's a fart. Excuse me. Yes, Burger King. Okay, Burger King. It's loaded sure. with tartar sauce, let's see, let's which I do the, not uh, like. Let's see the uh, thing. Yeah, yeah that's, what, that's what Burger King is known for. They load they their burgers. They load their sandwich with tartar sauce. Or mayonnaise that is not on a good burgers. Thing. Yeah, they're, they're, big, they're known for that. I, I can't stand Burger King, really. That's, that, that's the sad part. Now let's taste this. Oh, fuck. Dirty motherfuckers! Is it that bad? Yeah. Loaded with pickles. Oh, take the you can take the pickles off. It sucks. Burger King sucks. I agree with you. All right, so if you're gonna give the uh, Burger King Big Fish a rating, what do we give it? A one. 
A one star. Motherfuckers. Oh, I hate getting up. Now I'm getting pissed. So did you say two one star? No, it's a one one star. Wait, that's a one one star? One one star. It's the worst sandwich I've ever tasted. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Burger King. Yeah, it's Burger King shit. It's absolute shit. Absolute shit. Don't ever want to go to Burger King for a fucking fish sandwich. Maybe a Whopper. Maybe uh, a Whopper. You know, I got to be honest with you. This is a this is a different conversation, but I think Burger King is trash. It's just garbage. I, th- I yeah, think everything I, I don't at like Burger I, th- King. I don't think anything at Burger King is good. I don't understand people that go to Burger King. Uh, they're dirty. I used to eat Burger King when I was a kid. Not me. Uh, I, uh, good God, I would never. I, I mean, you get a Whopper there. It's just like drowning in mayonnaise and stuff. I mean, I can't think of a single thing that I've ever had at Burger King, and I haven't been at Burger King in a long time. Real quick, I'm an extremely picky eater, so yeah. with me, it's it's burger, cheese, maybe ketchup. Now I'm allowing cheese, lettuce, ketchup, and an onion or tomato instead of ketchup. Okay. Um, and there used to be a Burger King over by my my aunt and mom's place when they were alive, which is now my cousin's place. Right. Uh, and and that mother that fucking joint just it's now a McDonald's, and and oh, really? that place yeah it's now a McDonald's. Um, that place is just, oh my God. The, the kind of people that like Whoppers are the kind of people that like deep dish pizza, like, like a- absolute morons. Like, I, I don't, why would you get a Whopper you know when you can, get a, you know you can what? get a Big Mac? The remark that you just made is the most moronic remark ever. The kind of people that like Whoppers or the kind of people that like deep dish pizza yeah, weirdos. Weirdos. You're, you're fucking... No, no. The kind of people that like Whoppers from Burger King are the kind of people that are homeless. <laughs> well, I mean, that, that might be, that, my, that might be true as well. The, to, the, to the left of me, or to, yeah, to my left, looks like he's almost homeless. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so... Uh, anyway, we can do a whole um, fast food ranking another night, uh, but we both, we, we both agree... Um, Burger King is trash, but let's move on. Okay. This sandwich... And to be honest, I've never had their fish sandwich, so I, I'll well. trust your judgment. That's Burger King as well, so that goes in the garbage immediately. I don't need to taste that again. Did we try Wendy's? No, Not yet. I thought you did, but you could take another... Okay, if you have another then, one, then, you then, can then take Wendy's is set aside. Okay, I'm I sorry. I think you did. You think you Wendy's. did Wendy's, yeah. We're moving on now. Let's get okay. to McDonald's. Let's get to the uh, the Big Daddy. All right, let me let me move these out of my way here, so I got room to move the McDonald's up. And I did Arby's, correct? I did Arby's. I did Wendy's. I did Jack. Did you get Popeyes by any chance? No. Really? Okay. That's supposed to be coming. Okay. Well, let's let's move on to McDonald's. Move this over here because that's... Uh, yeah, I don't know why you're going all the way back there. The McDonald's isn't back there. The McDonald's is over here. Right. So that's where you got to get. And what else is there? Is there anything else right there? Arby's. Again? Another Arby's, which is... All right. Well, let's see what's in there. Drinks. Come on. I got two drink. fucking drinks, and I have no room over there for fucking drinks. But, but where's the McDonald's? Over there as well. So let's go. Don't go in your kitchen. Let's get. The, you're in the middle of a fish review. This is drinks. Drinks. What about Car- and- you're supposed to have Carl's Jr. too, so maybe that's late, running late. This looks like McDonald's. Was that the only thing in the McDonald's bag? 
This and a drink, and I'm not going to grab the drink. It doesn't look like is that 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 doesn't look like a fillet of fish. That's not a fish with fillet of fish packaging. That's a fucking roll for breakfast. Okay. Stupid asses. See see what else is in the bag. Stupid motherfuckers. God. Welcome to people that fucking eat at McDonald's. Hey. Breakfast. A breakfast roll with, with French fries. Uh, filet of fish. Yes, that's what we want. We want the filet of fish. From the cold fries, which one is enough? This is for oh. breakfast. That's it's here. Yep, you can have that tomorrow morning, but let's get to the filet of fish. Looks like this is the last fish that we're And I said, this, I said this the other day. Before you get into this, Perry, can you open it up and show it? Because it's on your shirt. And I, I really want right. to articulate this well. Can you get the fi filet of fish out and just show it to it before you take the bite? This sandwich is the sandwich of all champions sandwiches. I agree. <laughs> I, 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 I'm, 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 I know people have an attitude about McDonald's, okay? And everybody says McDonald's is like the bottom of the list for, for all fast food and stuff. But it's the bottom of the list because it was the first. It was the first real. Uh, um, it was the first real fast food franchise that got started in the late fifties, early sixties. Well, it's the first. Uh, it's the first fish sandwich that was offered, you know, during Lent. But I will. Uh, my point was a different entirely. This sandwich is the mascot sandwich of Perry Caravella Live because on your very right. first stream back uh, early November right before we were even on Twitch, the whole right thing of you getting delivery started with a filet of fish. So it is really the honorary sandwich of this channel. And when you celebrate uh, of the filet of fish, you're really celebrating Perry Caravella Live. So give this a good, good And I was bite. never a fish eater. I was never a fish eater. It was always... Uh, Quarter pounders or, or double quarter pounders at McDonald's always with me. And apparently, Perry, you do have Popeyes in there somewhere. We'll get that after this. But but fi finish McDonald's that first. That sandwich finish is the best out of them all. Surprise! Surprise! Well, give it a give. give this tell us why. Is, is tell, a five tell us star why. Because it's tasty. The cheese, the 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 um, the tartar sauce. They don't have a lot of stuff on it. It's 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 fish sandwich. It's tartar sauce. It's it's. Wrong. It's a ten five star. It's a fucking tasty sandwich. Wow. It's top notch, even though it's cold. Even though it's cold and it feels like it's been in my apartment for three hours. This is a 10 5 star. Fuck yeah. Hey, you know, I, I know a guy that went to McDonald's yesterday and spent $22 and who says who says he doesn't go to McDonald's normally. Is that me? Yeah, that would be you. What did you get yesterday that, that cost $22? God, I forgot. Um, it's kind of hard to spend 22 bucks at McDonald's as a, as a solo person. A couple of uh, quarter pounders, uh, uh, the, a large fry, and, and a drink. So for the guy who says he hates McDonald's, you kind of love McDonald's. McDonald's is my is my hometown uh, fast food restaurant to me because I thought I never knew about the McDonald's in Downey that was the original McDonald's. Okay, I never knew about that place. Okay, I'm looking right at outside. Perry. I'm looking I'm looking right at the Popeyes bag. So come on, you got another sandwich to do. Okay. Popeyes, Popeyes, Popeyes. Where? 
when you, right when you come back, you'll see. Yeah, there it is. This Popeye's okay. And this is the last of them all. I hope. Well, well, you tell me. I mean, out of all the shit that was delivered here. Let's see what we got here. Okay. There's some mashed potatoes over there. And this is warm. Oh, wow. So this is, this is new. I think this is new for this season, wow. Popeyes. That's a big... Wow, whoa, whoa. Take look at a that look at sandwich. That. Wow. A, show, it to, show it off to the camera. That's Open a it sandwich. Up. Oh, a just take a bite. Just go, go right into it. Go right into it. Don't eat the earpiece. That would not be good. How is it? It looks good. Delicious. Popeyes gets a 10 be way better than, than McDonald's. Really? So, well, McDonald's, wait. McDonald's is now rated a 7. This oh, is yeah. a fucking 10 beyond belief. I gotta start eating at Popeyes, Mom, mommy. I've never eaten it. I, I've only eaten at Popeyes like one or two times when I was a young kid. When I used to skateboard over here, when when uh, Skater Cross was around the corner. Wait, so yeah, okay. Why is it I good? Mean, yeah, Talk there's pickles. Talk about why it's so good. It's tasty. It's 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 flavorful. It's it's moist. It's it's not dry. It's not you know. It doesn't have that shitty. Uh, Burger King flavor. I mean, God Almighty, this is delicious. Don't fall out. So, is there anything on there? Is it, is it tartar sauce or can we see it? We, we can't see it. We can't see here. it at all. Well, yeah. Okay. Okay. There we go. Okay. 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 Tartar sauce. Yeah, I, I, one thing I noticed about Popeyes from from their chicken sandwiches, they're very light on the sauce it, it, in comparison to Burger King that drowns you it and everything. Need, you don't need a ton of sauce to make the sandwich good. Right. I mean, my God, if you if you have the the right mixture in the sauce, the, the sandwich will be great. Mm -hmm. if, if you're going to be a, a moron and fucking uh, pour a ton of sauce on the sandwich, is going to be going to be fucking skanky and, and and disgusting okay so let's let's be let's be real here um what is the deal so what what rating are you giving the popeyes 10 10 10, what, 10, 10, 10, 10 5 star 10 5 star 10 5 star I, so are popeyes you retroactively 10 popeyes is extremely tasty it's delicious <sighs> excuse me for snorting it's tasty it's delicious it's a place that I should be eating at, which I don't. Um, oh my God! It's 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 like uh, they they just caught the fish and just started cooking it. It's so one of those. Are you giving this a tie with McDonald's, or are you retroactively downgrading your previous McDonald's score? McDonald's is a fucking five. What are you talking about? You just said that McDonald's was a ten five star moments ago. Oh, I'm sorry. Excuse me. Because of all the other sandwiches that taste like garbage. Right. Um, yeah. Yeah, McDonald's, yeah, I'll I'll this is better than McDonald's. McDonald's is downgraded to an eight. An eight what? An eight an eight what an eight, star? An eight an eight three or four star four star. An eight four. Eight four star. Okay, so this is a ten and you hung up on five me. star. And you hung up I, on I think me. I think we just disconnected. I gotta call you real quick. Call me back. Hello. Yeah. So just so we wrap this up, Popeyes is a 10 five star. McDonald's is now officially an eight four star. An eight four. Yes. Yes. So what do we have left? I believe there's still Carl. There was Carl. There was supposed to be a Carl's Jr. Carl's Jr. is not here. I'm sorry.
Carl Jr.'s not and here. Did you get a did you get a Buffalo Wild Wings? No. No Buffalo Wild Wings. Oh, well, let me put this back here. I got another bag on the floor. Hang on a second. And check check the other Arby's just to see if there's a different sandwich in there. The trash in this bag. Trash. Yeah, it's another sandwich. Let's see what it is. Another regular sandwich. Oh, it's a regular fish sandwich. Okay, well, let's just confirm your... Send me a ton of fucking food. I don't need all this food. Well, obviously, this is something different, Perry. It's Fish Friday. You're sampling. That's why there's a lot of food. Okay, that's Popeyes. And this is Popeyes. Yeah. Okay, well, if Carl, what, what was the other thing you got? Maybe that was Carl. Let's, let's see the other sandwich you got that's back on your dining room table. Let's grab that. Right there on the floor. No, I'm right there on the floor. There's another. Yeah, but there's also one on your dining room it's table. The table is, is, a, is a meal of something. Hold on. Let's check it out. This is Del Taco. Okay, let's bring that into the foray, and uh, I don't think, I don't know if they did a fish sandwich, but let's get, let's get the thing on your dining room table, too. Let's just get it all. Hang on. This is a fish taco. Yep. Oh, nice. Okay, well, let's let's. Fish taco. We we won't add this. We won't add this to the sandwich ratings because that's not fair. But let's let's take a bite and see what it is. It's a fish taco with a little lemon. You see that? It's actually a, a soft taco. It looks Here's good. I love. I I am a Del Taco fan, so let's. Uh... Yeah, I, I'm a definite Del Taco fan myself, as well. Del Taco, I like to eat at is over here off of Balboa and Satakoy. I stop there on the way home from the comedy store every night because <clears throat> they're 24 hours. They're a 24 hour restaurant. Thank God it did not fall in the drink or in the. Uh, and that where's just paper towels. What are you looking for? Paper towels. Where did I put them? I just had There's them over here. There's got to be napkins in those bags. There were. Here we go. Napkins. While you're up, grab the thing from your dining room table, please. Now I'm disgusted. This says. Don't worry about what it says. Just bring it over. Because I can't read because of my eyes. Just, just cut it open and open it up. Hold on a moment. Somebody's at my door. Get it. Oh shit. Moment, please. Thank you. I hope that's our Carl's Jr. No. From 
some Sebastians. A whole Which fish with curry paste. Oh boy. Okay, well let's put that aside for now. All right, we'll deal with it. Let's just put it aside for now. This will sit over no, here. No, 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 Perry. Where'd your fedora go? I don't know. Oh, over there. Because I had to put the mask on. Wait. Come on back. This is this 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 is over here. Right so here. I guess we're not getting Carl's Jr., but oh, that's fine. Okay. Let me let's, keep let's a mask the, on more than one ear. No, 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 no mask on. You, you don't need a mask. Turn. Why, why would you put a mask on right now? Why would you put a mask on right now? No, uh, that's a serious question. Why would you put a mask on right now? I just, because they're thinking people are just going to start showing up at my door. Yeah, so you, I'm like you know you're doing a stream, it. right? You know you're doing a stream. I know, I know, I know. Okay, okay so, so let's, here's let's, Del Taco. Let's figure out the, you finished the Del Taco. Del Taco. Uh, you, you, did you like Del Taco? What rating would you I give it? I'm not Taco. counting it. You're not counting it, but I'm just going to rate it anyway. Go ahead. Um, uh, this, this taco, this fish taco, gets an eight, four star. That's very good. Okay? Bad. Very good. Yeah, it gets an eight, four star. Okay, let's and move on to the, this bag. other bag here. And Del Taco's bag... And you want me to open this up? Yeah, this is uh, me, me who sushi. Well, Perry, we don't cheat and look at receipts. We just open bags. No, I'm looking yeah. at the name of the place. I'm not looking. I don't give a fuck what the what it costs. I just want the name of the place. But I just want to see what it is. And you, can you do this on camera, please, for a change? I'm well. Here's what we're doing off camera: opening the bag. Here's what we're doing on camera, showing what it is. Okay, let's open it up. Take this, put, put the, the the chopsticks there, put the... the that, yeah, yeah, we don't need to see the condiments, we just want to see what's inside. Right, okay, condiments down. Now inside, yeah, I see it. inside I got all of this. Oh, that looks like sashimi, that looks beautiful. Yeah, it looks delicious. Okay. Okay. All right, you can so save that, that for later. later. That'll that'll be good in a couple of days. What? A couple of hours, or forget it. Did you? Are there any other uh, any other bags that you have un unattended? Can you take it? Let's let's just make sure. Yeah, and Perry, people are talking about the the, the now that the lighting is. I know, changed a I know bit. the snorting and the snorting. Forgive me, please. Not the snorting, please. Perry. The the uh, the lighting has changed. So let's get the uh, back. Oh no, no, Perry, Perry. The one behind you, not the one to the side of you. That one. There we go. All right. All right. So this one comes off. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now that, okay, I can have a sip of this. But I feel like there's another bag there. From where? I don't know. Del Taco. You got that. Popeyes. One, oh, the bags you open, why don't you just th throw away everything that you've opened? Well, I mean, you're going to keep the sandwiches, of course, but move them out of the side. Move them to the side. In the slowest manner possible. Okay, napkins. I can use those. Set yeah, it's very important to talk Kleenex. about napkins right now. Somebody's knocking at my door again. Fuck. Well, since you're up, you might as well get it. Exactly. Right there, sir. Hope this is Carl's Jr. Thank you. Good day. Yeah. Is this Carl's Jr.? No, it's not Carl's Jr. Chinese food. And... 
Where are you? What's taking so long? I went to the door. I dropped. I lost the earpiece, and now I got the earpiece back. At the door again. Ah! Wait, why are you going back to the door? Because I don't understand. I gotta put my mask on. Yeah, over I just don't my understand. Head. I don't get why it has to come Please off. Over to the door. Fuck it. Please go to the door. Stop doing that. Uh, how many times are you going to... Perry, you know, Perry. We, that new chair was delivered to you so you'd stop getting up and down as much. It doesn't okay. seem to be working. Got nothing to do with the chair. Absolutely nothing to do with the chair. It's got to do with all the all right, give a good give a good look around. Is there any other bags besides what you just got? Is there any other bags around you that you have not gotten to yet? Because I feel like you, you brought in a lot. This? Hey, yeah, let's see what that is. Dominoes. Let's see what it is. I didn't think, I don't know Domino's did a fish sandwich. Camera. In frame. Domino's. Oh, what is it? See what that is. Sure. It looks like that a fish sandwich. Let's see it. The burnt fish sandwich. Disgusting. Open it up. Oh. Open it up. Somebody's at the door again. Wait, they can wait. And you know what it is? It's it's fucking uh um well, well, what do you put on fucking uh uh goddamn pizza um pepperoni? No, that's not fish. Well, take a bite. You got to take a bite and rank it. What's the fucking fish that you put on fucking uh pizza? Anchovies. Thank you. Okay, take a they bite. Put a, a butter, they put a fucking bun on it. I hate anchovies. All right, we won't count this in the overall ranking, but you still got to take a bite. I got to take a bite of this shit? Ow! Just a bite. Poison! How is it? If you had to give it a ranking, what would you give it? Thing. If you had to give it a ranking. A negative 10. It's fucking poison. I hate it. Tastes like a fucking jar of salt. Like anchovies normally taste like. Fucking saltier than shit. Yuck. Damn you. So I think that's all the uh, fish sandwiches then, right? Is that everything? I mean, we didn't get... Uh, oh. It doesn't seem like we got Carl's Jr., but that we got everything else. Yeah. Okay. So I'm, I'm going to do the final tallies, and we'll, uh, we'll declare a winner. And then we got... I got... Um, uh, Miho Sushi. Dinner. Miho Sushi sent me, oh yeah, all that, all that, uh, all that sushi in there. I'll put you back in here so I can eat you later. The, my favorite out of all these uh, fish places for, for having uh, fish would be Wendy's or uh, McDonald's. Or no, wait, you're, mista no, you're, you're mistaken, my friend. I am? Which one was my best? 
Well, I'm going to give you the list, okay? There was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven that you did, okay? Coming in dead last. Now, pay attention. These are the final rankings, so pay attention. And move over to the right a little bit. Let's get in frame. Okay. Coming in at number seven, in dead last place, was the Burger King Big Fish, which ranked a one, Correct. one star. The lowest rating Correct. I think you've ever given to anything. Correct. Uh, now, in sixth place, uh, and it's, it's hard to rank these based on your system here, but okay. Sixth place, the Arby's Hawaiian Fish Sandwich with a five, two star. You had some issues with that one. Yeah. Yeah, both Arby's sandwiches weren't that great. Okay. I like Arby's roast beef, but not their fish. Right. Uh-uh. So coming in right behind that in number f- in fifth place is the Arby is the Arby's classic fish sandwich, which ranked a six three star. So the regular fish sandwich slightly better than the Hawaiian fish sandwich, but still right. not great. And right. what was it? What was your complaint? Was it dry? Dry. It was just, just the flavoring. I, I didn't like the flavor. I didn't like the bun. <sighs> okay. Coming yeah. in fourth place, and here's where they get good. Okay. The Wendy's Alaskan Fish Sandwich, you gave a 6 4 star. Average. The Wendy's? Slightly, slightly above average. Yeah. Wendy's was actually a good sandwich. Right. Wendy's was definitely a good sandwich. And that was so, – okay, so now we get into the top three. And the top three really uh, – the third, third place surprised me actually. Third place goes to <coughs> the Jack in the Box Alaskan Pollock sandwich, which you gave a seven three star. What did you like about Jack in the Box? It had flavor. There was flavor to it. It had, it had cheese. It had lettuce. It had tomato. Uh, it had flavor. And they didn't – Throw a zillion gallons of tartar sauce on it like Burger King does. Right. And that was the one we will say that you cheated on. You took a couple of bites before the stream started. Right. I took a couple of bites uh, earlier from that sandwich. Right. So I, I got to put an asterisk next to that one. Okay. Now we get into the top two. Number two, surprise me. Number two. Leave it at the door, please. Thank you. Number two. Num- number two, McDonald's filet of fish with a 7, well, originally a 10 five-star, retroactively downgraded to a 7 four-star. Now, the McDonald's filet of fish you were saying really is the king of fish sandwiches. It's the mascot right. of our channel. You're it's, wearing it's it on mascot. your shirt. It's the mascot. It's it's the sandwich on my shirt. It's the mascot of, uh, of why Perry this... Car- uh, Perry Carville Alive. Perry Carville Alive uh, fish challenge was even created. That's right. Okay. And number one with a bullet coming in with a astounding 10 five star is the Popeye's fish sandwich, which is, you said extraordinary. I am, I am so shocked and I'm going to use the word embarrassed because I don't even go to Popeye's. I don't get chicken at Popeye's. I don't get, I don't get fish sandwiches at Popeye's. The Popeyes over here on Van Owen, uh, actually, it's, it's like Etiwanda to Van Owen, all right, behind me. Right. That Popeyes has been there since my skateboarding days when Skater Cross was off of Van Owen and Reseda. Uh, and, and we used to go to Popeyes and hang out afterwards late at night, but I never really ate there when I was a little kid. I just, just hung out with uh, some friends and stuff. But uh, you know, because of money and whatnot, maybe I did have some some uh, uh, chicken sandwiches back when I was a little kid. I don't remember, but I had a girlfriend that lived down the block. Well, not, not to interrupt you, but the win- clearly the winner of Perry Caravillo's Carav- Perry Caravillo Lives Fish Friday 2021 <laughs> is the Popeyes fish Popeyes. sandwich. You give it your seal of approval. You recommend it. Popeyes is the rock and roller. Popeyes is. Freaking Ted Nugent doing lead guitar jam or or, or, or Nikki Sixx doing a lead 
jam, whatever. I okay. mean, it was just a rocker. So why don't you uh, just get what you have at the door. We'll come back and we'll get to the comments. Let's not let's skip the mask process. You don't need a mask to answer your door. No. Why did I get more McDonald's? Show it to the ring camera. This is a fucking waste. And it's all drinks. It's all drinks inside. All right, let's bring it inside. Bring it inside. A little late to the uh, party. Let's bring it inside. Drink on, on the ring. Orange. Orange drink. Oh, orange drink. This, this is ridiculous. This is going to Spending the money for all these orange drinks is throwing money away. Large orange drinks. Who in the fuck? All right, well, come, come back, come back inside, Perry. Come back inside. Nobody can hear you. Well, I don't want to make any more noise out in the hallway either. It's embarrassing. Oh, Because you're going right well, in the kitchen. It is what we do. It is what we do. We should show that. You, you don't have to. Sh if they're all the same, you, you need to come and show one. I'll show one. I'll show one when I get them all inside. There's multiple bags? Five bags. Five bags. Yeah, I know. How is the, how is the smell out there? Like a fish? Got the majority of How dare you say this chair is nasty? It's a strange chair of the year. Ugh. Ugh. Oh my god. How about that? Bring, bring, how about just bring one bag over to the camera? One bag. Okay. How is the smell out there? Did it go away? Is it, no, it didn't go away. One bag of all of this. What is this? Orange. Take a sip of the orange soda and let's give that a rating too. Well, since we're rating things, just take a sip and let's give God it a rating. Damn. Bitch. What would you give that a rating? I can't stand orange soda. Okay. That three. aside. Three what? Three star? I don't know. And a three rating? I'm not a I'm not a orange soda drinker. Can't stand it. Or crap to put him inside Perry's apartment. So, All right, so why don't we? I, I think the I think the only thing we have to wrap with is the sushi you got. You can try a little bit of that, and then we're uh, we're done, and we're gonna move along. This? Well, I can't see it, but I'm assuming it's still on your desk. Here, I, I have seen you, though, have the orange energy drink that I've sent to you. You do like that, and that's technically orange Yeah, soda. I'll, I'll accept that. Okay. But I can't stand orange soda from fucking McDonald's. Okay. That's disgusting. Just, ugh. Where are you going now? No, 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 don't, don't get up. Don't I get up. No. this fucking garbage! God you have a garbage to the side there. of you. Shut you have up. a garbage to the side of you. Sit Shut down. Up. Sit down. No, we talked about this. Sit down. You're not getting up to I throw a little... Well, then you can put it on your desk and throw it away later. You don't get up to throw chopsticks, uh, a wrapping of chopsticks in the garbage. Now sit down and stay seated. We talked about this. If you guys want to see the video of his Twitch rep that came uh, yesterday, he even said about Perry getting up and down. Perry, let's go. You can do this at the desk. Oh, fuck this! Stop. 
Stop. You're in baby mode now. You're in baby mode. We talked about this. Look at your award. Look at your reward. Look at your award. I know. I know. Okay. Remember what you do this for. I'm I'm honored. Honored. Thankful and honored. Good. So let's try this and we're going to move along. And we still got some uh, mailbag to do. Okay. This is going to be I uh, hope you guys are in for a long evening. You got to be fucking kidding me. I've got a ton of shit to throw in the trash. Oh, we, no, we talked about this, Perry. The trash comes after the stream is over, and we're not going to be consumed with your trash. We, we had this conversation okay. earlier. Okay. How long is it going to take you to get this uh, sushi? Uh, Shut the fuck up! That's how long! No, you don't talk to me like that, Perry. That's unacceptable. We talked about that, too. Wow. Wow good, wow bad. Wow good. Wow incredibly uh, good. I'm going to officially retire this earpiece. I'm going to get you a new one. Yeah, yeah, this earpiece is a pain in my ass. I need the hook around my ear. All right, we're not going to worry about that now. So we're going to we're going to get back to some uh, comments, okay? So can you pay attention and move over to your right? Yeah, some some Perry, do, do you have some other curry, curry fish, there? fish? Curry fish, yeah. In the can? No, that you already can, No, that was that was that was that wasn't it, but you got him curry fish? It's like a whole Oh, the fish. No, the fish. Yeah, the fish you got. You actually got a fish. You put it aside. Can we just see it, please? You got to at least open it. Where? You put it back, I think, this? on that other chair. No, uh, maybe, maybe. I don't know. Open it up. This is more Chinese food. No, no, not the Chinese food. Not the Chinese food. You brought in a fish, and I think you put it back on that other chair there. Behind you. That's Arby's. Del Taco. More Arby's. Check on, the dining, check on the dining room table, for Christ's sake. I can't believe you got to get up again. <sighs> Sebastian D. Yeah, that's it. Bring it yeah, back. Yeah, curry fish. Bring it back. <laughs> now, Perry, I'm going to warn you. You can't go into, you can't get, you can't allow this fish to possess you. Yes, sir. Okay, let's open it up. Like, like gentlemen. Yeah. This is a thing of uh, probably rice. Oh, so it's not an actual fish. I thought it was an actual fish. This I would assume would be rice. All right, we don't need to see the rice. Okay, that's rice. And the curry fish. Oh, so this one actually might be cooked. I thought I thought it was actually a fish. All right, so just sample this and let's move on with our evening. Yeah. Damn it. Do you actually use chopsticks? No, often, but I do. Just when you're on the stream. All right.
How long is this going to take? Let's see. Here it Let's is. Let's see it. Let's see it. It's all in hole. It's not even cut up. Well, let's see it. I can't see it. Hang on. You're, Hang you're on. supposed to be a presenter. How, what am I hanging on for? Okay, let's just, just try a bite of it. Try a bite of it. If you want to eat the whole thing, you can eat the whole thing. If I could fucking find a way to cut into it to where I can grab some... Man, damn, I don't even know. I'm oh, shit. That's all I can have right now. Okay. Okay, and do you have a um, a bag from the Adamine Adamine Rotisserie Cafe? No, not that I saw. Oh, somebody was saying that they sent that. No, I didn't see anything from Adamine Rotisserie Cafe. Yeah. All right, let's move on. Jesus. Oh, Christ. Yes, sir. Perry is Heidi, the first Hi. desk worker from Total Eclipse Productions. Mike Johnson that told I... me about you being a streamer. Great to see you, love. Thank you, Heidi. It's an honor to see you again. Yeah, she was a sweetheart. I liked her. She was a real sweetheart. Perry, I gave up music for Lind. Could you celebrate the end with me by singing your favorite Hall & Oates song? Or any song that is not G-A-Y-C slash D-C? I'm not... I don't have a Hall & Oates song that I'm... that I favor. Um, God. Excuse me for snorting. Sorry. It's all this. Hold on. New fans. Subsequently, hashtag fish for Perry. The end of a tip comment will result in Perry having a fresh fish delivered. Hashtag fish no. for Perry. No. No. Absolutely not. Perry, you are making things happen. So proud of you, brother. You look great, my man. Happy Fish Friday, my friend. Douglas for life. Thank you. Thank you. Remember when the homies and I used to call you with cap because you always had the head covered any time we needed it? I miss that sloppy baby. Stop calling me your baby. I'm not your baby. Get out get it out of your head, dude. Again, forgive me for snorting. It's a fucking habit of mine. Yeah, that's unacceptable, Perry. Just blow your nose if you have to blow your nose. You can't snort constantly while you're doing a live stream. No one wants to hear that. Oh, excuse me for a moment, please. Oh. Oh. Nuke enthusiast here. Prove to Tom how powerful your microwave is and nuke your birth certificate for 10 minutes. That should show him. You're, you're psychotic. Fuck you. 
Dance monkey. Dance for my pocket change. Dance monkey? I haven't danced in a while, so this dance monkey is out of practice for dancing, okay? Thanks for agreeing to go to Credenza Fest 2021. Note, there is a $300 part fee to push your credenza around while admiring others' credenzas. Not gonna happen, sorry, idiot. Is your perfect day? Don looks you in the eyes. While Mola blows a C T smoke up your nose. While Randy has sex with your mouth. Hashtag a CT dude. Neither anything you are saying is true. It's disgusting. We have received tons of orders for you tonight, but we don't have enough stock. So instead, we will deliver a fish sandwich to our home every day in 2021. No, no, I don't want that to happen. Do not do that. For... Tonight is the last time I, I expect you to be delivering stuff to me, please. Okay? This is the last night for fish of any kind for quite a while. Quite a while. Hey, Perry, give that fish sandwich a good stare. Just like the time you have Donna stare into those blue beauties and kiss him. Don't blink. Oh, God. Yeah, no, I didn't kiss him. He force kissed me, you son of a bitch. Last stream, you acted like a twat and made a fake apology. Give you $100 for you to punch your tiny cock, then I will accept her apology or turn microwave. I apologize for being a prick, but that's not happening. You must have a ton of free time now that Don turned your worthless skateboard company into a gay porn site. And why luck on finding a new boyfriend? Absolutely not. Uh, my 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 skateboarding business was not a porn site, and if Don Barris turned it into a gay porn site, he's just a punk and has no right to even steal my, my company, the dirty bastard. But you know what? I don't need it anymore. I got Perry Caravelle alive. That's my business. Oh, Lopez Cottage and got it today. I see a Kia Cadenza. Did you strike a Man deal with English, sponsor? I feel fuck. entitled to some of that ad money. Hashtag tip for tomb. Hey, bitch boy! Fucking pay me for the truck that you fucking totaled, you cocksucker! Hey, t-shirt tucker motherfucker. $200 if you can bring someone on the stream that you are smarter than. Hashtag dumbass, hashtag moron, hashtag dress better, hashtag tips for a tomb. There's no one that I'm smarter than, okay? Thank you. Next. Hope you plan on being professional and appreciate the position Don Mole Tomb and fans have put you in. Please keep it together. Don't argue with Tomb. Don and Mole hasn't done shit for me. In almost 30 fucking years, they haven't done squat for me. One movie. One fucking movie. M new fans have, and Tom has. Not Don and Mole. What, you call the Big Three podcast a fucking something great? No. You guys, I thank, and Tom Brennan, I thank overwhelmingly. He's helped me with everything. Perry, you might be the greatest Italian to ever live. Right up there with Rocky Balboa. A true champion amongst men. Happy Fish Friday, buddy. That is an amazing and beautiful, lovable comment. Thank you so much. Thank you so, so much. Well appreciated. Thank you. Thank you. 
Percy as a punishment for Tuesday you will eat one pickle after each fish sandwich bite. No. Please no. I had a pickle earlier. So forget about it. Mole in charge. Mole's not in charge. Did you use to sit guys down on your mom's credenza and blow them as a teen and that's why you hold the credenza so dear to your heart? Do jokes. Let's not try I don't to talk want to over that the... question because okay. he's such a demon. But you also talked over it, so let's let's try not to talk over it. I, you don't sit on that. That's a freaking dresser. A lovable, a lovable dresser that my mom had. Pierre Bear, you never admitted to having a roll cage in 1979. This would have saved taxpayers bigly from you fake disability scam. Bones. Dog bless. I never had a roll cage, jackass. My mom's 1970 Cutlass didn't have a roll cage in it. It was a 1970 Cutlass. Thank you for subscribing. Oh, I'm in the zone. Sorry, I haven't been around much, Perry. Someone sent me a picture of your manager, Tom Brennan, and it's all I've been able to focus on. Sweet swoo oh. Oh, so you're in love with Tom Brennan now. Oh, well. Now I'm losing out on uh, Scarlett Johansson. I, I apologize beyond belief for Tuesday. Tuesday, sweetie, was one night that I just fucking exploded like, like a raging maniac. And I am so sorry about last Tuesday. So sorry. Last Tuesday made me freaking nuts because of that raw fish. Can I uh, jump in here, Perry? Annette, uh, I'm flattered, by the way, but um, uh, I have an offer here from the Faster Blade. What's the offer? $10 for every fish sandwich you can stack on your head. It's not enough money. Yes, it is. No, it is not, because it'll make a fucking humongous mess in no, my well, apartment. You're just putting it on your head. You're just putting it on your head for ten dollars. So if you, so, so here's the deal: you put one on your head, that's ten. You put another, that's twenty. Not now, not now, Perry. Not now, not now, Perry. Not now. Stop looking all over the place. Where? What are you looking at? I'm trying to find where all the fish sandwiches are. Okay, I'm just saying it's something to think about. Maybe for later. We're not gonna do it right now, but something for later we could think about. God. We got a lot of comments to get through, but. Something to think about. I don't think it's I, that's easy money. So I think we're going to do that faster blade. If you want to uh, confirm your uh, commitment to that, I think you can get at least five. Dude, on your head. I'm throwing everything out of this house. Everything in this apartment, including pictures, is going in the trash. I'm just so fucking fed nope, up. No, nope. no, you're in, in baby apartment. mode. And you're in baby mode. We're not doing this, Perry. Look at your trophy. Look at your trophy that you got last night. Oh! Calm down. No, we're not doing this. Okay, because I will veto you if I have to. Hey, Perry, you have recovered from that smelly fish incident. Lord knows you probably smell of dead fish all the time. What are you hiding? I don't even know why I opened this. I'm not hiding anything. I am not hiding anything. I smell dead fish all the time. No, I, I don't smell dead fish all the time. My my apartment smells like a fucking marina of dead fish. Okay, and it's just disgusting the way my apartment smells right now. Ugh. Why is Perry like a fish? They both hate the net. How is Perry's an ex-wife similar to his fish sandwich? They were both battered. Whatever. Whatever. Okay. <sighs> Kindly leave it at the door. Thank you. Do you want me to get the door? You might as well. Make it quick. 
And uh, apparently you have a, a delivery at the gate. If you want to get the, the, just run to the gate real quick. And come back. So, beside what you have at the door, just quickly run to the gate and check. And that'll be the last gate check for the evening. Oh, 666 viewers right now. I don't know what that means. So get that and then just make a quick trip to the gate. I don't know why your ring keeps crashing. Looks like, looks like a, it's you might have to try. You might. Okay, but. Um, I will be back. I'm going to bring the cake over here. Yeah, I, I don't know why you had to come back in. I said quickly go to the gate and come back. I'm sorry. God, I'm sorry. Can you do, can you do anything succinctly and in a no. succinct menu, a succinct manner? Oh, I'm sorry. Forgive me. Forgive me. Come on, let's go. Quick gate check and come back. There we go. Okay. Yeah. All right, that's the last gate trip for the evening. So anybody else sending anything, if you don't have the gate code, don't send anything. Uh, Come on back. Uh, I'm real good, Buckshot. Okay. Hey, how are you? Uh, oh, fuck. Let's uh, see what we got. You got a cake, I see? So raw fish. What is it? Well, I can't see in the bag. Can you shoot? No, no, take it out of the bag. I am going to as soon as I can get to it. Here's raw oh. fish. Wow, that looks like salmon. Raw that fish like, there. That looks like cut fish. And raw fish right there. Whoa. All right, let's keep the demons away. Let's keep the demons away. Put it back in the bag. Oh. Goes back in the bag. And you can just put it on, put it behind you. Put it behind you. Don't put it outside. Do not put it in the hallway. Put it, put it on the chair behind you for now. Okay. Right, let's just get through this. And let's check out that cake. Let's check out that cake next. This. Or what, whatever that is. Has... Oh, I open this. Oh. As slow as possible, please. Well, let me show you how it how this cake is. Yeah, yeah, it looks good. Was that like a cheesecake? Take it out. Why don't you take it out of the box? Yeah. That looks fancy. Very fancy. Okay, so how 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 do we get you to take? Where are you going? You can take it out of the box right there. God. Fucking a nut. Oh shit. What do you? What is taking so long? Because of this. Where are you going? Where are you going? Throwing that away in a bag. Just take a bite. Just take a bite. You can take it right there. What? Do you, what? Do you... It's a great angle for us. Well, at least you got me in the corner. I'll see because... Here's the piece of cake. Yep, just let's take the bite and sit down. All I'm gonna do. All right, now sit down, please. That is it. 
sit down. I, I, I've had enough food samplings for the night. In fact, I'm going to kindly ask the viewing audience to not send any more food tonight. No more, please. We are done. Yes, yeah, so please sit down. We are done. How would you rate that cake? Um, I didn't like it that much. It's it's not it's not a real tasty cake. I'm sorry to be rude. It's not rude. It's no, it's not opinion. tasty. No, it's just it's just my opinion. I I didn't like that cake. I just didn't like it. Fair enough. Okay. We're going to get back to it, so pay attention. Perry, can you tell us how wide your patio door is? Due to your severe weight gain, I'm getting worried about you fitting through your front door. I don't know how wide my patio door is. My weight gain is not big. It's actually I'm losing weight. I'm down to 207 today. I'm 209. Yes, what was it? The day before yesterday or something like that? Because I haven't been eating much. Well, that's not true. You ate twenty-two dollars worth of McDonald's yesterday. I'm still losing weight. Okay. McDonald's is expensive when you don't have any coupons. I was enjoying your streams, but since you can't start on time, I'll go find another cutie to watch on Twitch. Oh, Cindy, stop it! When are we going back home? Chicago home, babe. Mark my words, Scaremaster, you're either going to smash or fuck that microwave by the end of the night. You should move the microwave to the hallway. Go fuck yourself, loser. Smash a brand new microwave that's not even six months old. I was a man in our relationship and any time Perry got out of line, I bitch slapped him. So turn your microwave or you will get the hand love you. Go fuck yourself. Fucking no good piece of garbage. Maybe it's the sandwiches, but Therese, something fishy about you tonight. Can't put my finger on it. What are you hiding? We already know about the bones. <clears throat> I'm not hiding anything. Right now I have gas because of all the food around me. There's no way I can even sh I can even show all these gifts. No way, too much food. Yeah, I think so we'll table we'll table mailbag. Maybe we'll do some mailbag on Sunday. Mailbag mailbag on Sunday. Not not tonight. Well, gotta, uh, subscriber Sunday on Sunday. I'm thinking. Uh, I was actually just thinking that maybe we'll do mailbag to maybe we'll do mailbag Tuesday to make up for no mailbag tonight. So maybe t maybe instead of time travel Tuesday, maybe we'll be mailbag Tuesday. Thank you. Yeah, because tonight there's just way too much food around me, and I can't eat all this food. No way. Uh, you, weren't you weren't asked to eat ever. You, you sampled it, and you did a great job. You did a, you know. Thank I you. Mean, it was, it was great. You. I think it was a success. Okay. Howie Mandel. I noticed on the internet that your friend Wes most is dating your girl Whitney Cummings. Is this a cock thing? Do you prepare the bowl? If he's really dating my, my uh, Whitney Cummings, uh, what can I do? Uh, there's nothing I can do. I can't stop it. But I need to know the truth from Whitney. Can't believe you just admitted to killing your mom. I'm not sure I can support your streams anymore. I didn't kill my mom. I just accidentally, I look, I was sick. The medication I was on was the wrong medication, of course. And I choked my mom. And that was in Palm Springs. My mom and I lived in, in, uh, in Costa Mesa for four and a half years before moving back to uh, Tarzana. Okay? So I didn't kill my mom.
Okay, Perry, I'm going to break in with an offer. Now what? Um, you're going to need to consider this one. Cause, and now remember the conversation that we had yesterday about you had a lot of making up to do for the other night. Okay. With that in mind, the Faster Blade is offering $100 to microwave the fish for seven minutes and then put it under a couch cushion. Oh, fuck no. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I don't care if I don't care if he or anybody else offers a hundred billion dollars. Mm-hmm. No fucking way. Well, Perry, we had this conversation. Okay, we had this conversation. Dude, now seven minutes and then put it under my my, my, my couch cushion. First okay. off, I can't even get to my couch. There's too much shit in my apartment. Uh I gotta move half of my fucking b- uh, hey, <laughs> hang on. way. Hang on, hang on. This is where it's negotiations... Impossible. Excuse me. This is where negotiations come in, okay? You never accept your first offer. That's the first rule of business. Okay, now I don't, I don't think you accept this offer. I think we negotiate this... First of all, can you look at me? Pay attention. I think this... Well, I think this is a $200 offer, okay? And I think we downgrade the seven minutes to five minutes and i also think and i also think the fish needs to be put in plastic before it's put under a couch cushion just to protect it to protect it you don't want to put raw fish under your your furniture so exactly hell no so this is our counter offer that i'm going to you know and that i want you to accept i really don't want to have to use my veto power here but i say two hundred dollars Five minutes in the microwave for the fish, and then you put it back in the plastic and you put it under your couch cushion. At the end of the night, you throw it away. What's the big deal? Two hundred bucks because we we have to we 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 lost money the other night because okay, of all $200. the two hundred dollars. Let's see what he says. Okay, we'll leave it there. We'll leave it there. Perry's being reasonable. Thank you for apologizing, Perry. Last Tuesday, you were very unprofessional. But let's move on and move forward. I agree, and I admit it, and I and I'm very sorry about last Tuesday. <sighs> Just like uh, this present offer for me, microwaving a fish for seven minutes and then putting it under my under my my uh, my uh, couch cushion. <sighs> no way. Raw fish. Well, not seven minutes, five minutes, but uh, remember, we, you do have a lot to make if up for. From back in the bag, if it goes back in the bag, it's going to melt the bag. And no, it's no. going to stink up. To be clear, to be clear, the fish does not go in the bag in the microwave, okay? No, after, it even on, after, it, 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 okay. after it's heated up in the microwave, okay, it's going to well, melt I, the bag. I suggested it to put it to protect it, but if you want to put the fish as is under the cushion, that's what you do, but the fish has to go under the again, cushion. Again! You don't again! Again! No, we After don't talk. It's heated up in the microwave. When you put it in the bag, it's going to melt the fucking bag. Okay, so you let it cool down for a minute. Okay? What, however you want to handle the process of post-microwave into the couch is your business. I was giving you a suggestion. Where are you going? Don't go anywhere. Turn back around. <laughs> Turn back around, please. Turn back around. Well, th- we didn't get anything in, so we don't have to worry about it right now. Okay? Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for subscribing. Perry, it's Wes Most. Thanks for apologizing to me. Now you owe me a favor. Do you want to force kiss me, suck me off, or turn the microwave? Go, go, fuck yourself, motherfucker. There's the favor. Now I owe you a favor. I don't know you squat, douchebag. Apology accepted. When you got mad at your mom after your auto accident, did you get physical with her? Push her? Scream in her face? 
Hashtag bury his girls. And th- there's no reason for me to explain what happened. Look, I got into a little bit of a fight with my mom over wanting to go see a girlfriend. It was late at night. She told me no. She said, "There's no way I'm going to allow you to drive around at this hour. You got to be at, you got to be uh, ready for school tomorrow, you know." And I don't think her parents would allow it either. Blah 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 blah. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for subscribing. Don't blame Satan for earned professionalism. I dig that Satan guy and he didn't make you act like a baby. Embrace and holy strength only a devil can give. I take responsibility, but that fish made, it made me fucking lose my mind. So that fish possessed me. And all the stench in my apartment right now is making me sick. So let's end the stream so I can clean up in here. Well, this Barry, is... we're not ending anytime soon, and I will say you're doing very well. I'm, I'm proud. Oh, of you, you got to be kidding! We're not ending anytime soon. No, we're not, Perry, and you knew this. And you and I said you can throw the trash out when you're done. Okay, but let's get through this. Look, anytime you feel, let's get, let's get through this. Let's get through this. And, and one of the rules that Perry and I had in, in our conversation was you're not allowed to badmouth this stream or this channel. This channel does a lot for you, and you just won an channel award. So Jim, why rush a ton for me? Why want to end the thing and rush through the thing that provides for you? So we're not ending anytime soon. We're, we're, we're going with the flow of the stream as we do. Okay. Oh boy. So pay attention, please. Fish and firewood is on the way. Enjoy, Perry, you deserve oh, it. Oh, fuck. If we run out of wood, we can always burn the credenza. Oh, fuck you! Fuck you, motherfucker! You want to burn my beautiful piece of furniture because you're jealous! I want to burn your credenza. Because you're jealous! Hi, Perry. We are so glad to have found this stream. We are really into sexy food fun. Can we meet up pretty, please? We will provide the food. No need. I got enough food here. No more food tonight. No more food tonight. Can you move to your right a little bit? What? Move to my right just a little bit? Yes, just a little bit. How hard is that? Just a little bit. All right, I moved over just a little bit. Absolutely what? Absolutely not. Thank you for apologizing. If it wasn't for your publicist, we would have hired the faster blade. You really have the best in the business. That's very kind of you, and I'm very thankful you did not hire the faster blade. <sighs> wow. Wow, thank you so, so much. I was afraid I would, bl- I would have blown the Adult Swim project. Thank you so, so much. And I thank Tom Brennan as well. All hail, Perry, the new king of Twitch. Kingsman's cheers all around. My cock is super duper crazy hard right now. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Here's the trophy. I am honored and so thankful. So, wait, wait. If you want to see me getting this award from last night, join my Patreon. Okay, right there. Patreon.com forward slash Perry Caravello. Thank you. The, the, the Twitch rep was over here last night. We had some uh, champagne. It was, it was fantastic. I, I I I was in awe. I was in massive awe because I couldn't believe what I was getting. Could not believe what I was getting. I was in such awe and so thankful. So so thankful. <laughs> Thank you for subscribing. 
It's an honor. Thank you so, so much. Thank you for subscribing also. Thank you for subscribing. The peanut butter kid. Yeah, I was once known as the peanut butter kid. Everyone talks about Perry being gay, but Tom B is a sexual free cosmoid that drinks P and Mary Stutes. You know, stop stop talking like that, please. Stop going down that, that, that road. You don't know what Tom B you don't you don't know what Tom B is into. Okay. Are you, you changing your this? pieces? Are Hello? You changing, are you changing your pieces? Yes. Okay. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you fine. I can't. All right, can you stop just stop touching there we go. everything. Okay. There we go, there we go, there we go. No. Damn it. All right, Perry, I'm getting really sick of this earpiece thing. I mean, I'm getting real sick of it. Call me back. Call me back. Call me back. All right, let's go. Pay attention. I want to be with you. I want to kidnap small Mexican grandmothers with you and rub our balls on their back. I just want to feel alive, bro. I don't want you kidnapping me. Hello? Yeah, all right. Okay, can, good. Can we, can we cut the um, earpiece shenanigans for the rest of the stream, please? Say that again? But can we cut the, people are getting sick of the earpiece, and so am I. Can you just stop? That's why every I, two I changed earpieces. Okay, just stop touching it. Stop hanging out. It's I'm really I'm not going to be touching this one. I'm not going to be touching this one. It's got the hook around it, so it's in my ear now. Perry, congrats on your award and awesome chair. You deserve it. You. We also deserve I'm two things. Top popped off, microwave turned. Dark side, Phil sucks. I know nothing about dark side Phil, and I never sucked anybody. And I no, you don't understand your chair. Oh, 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 this this chair. I'm sorry. Yeah, uh, dark side Phil does suck, and that's why the chair is now in my house. So, ta-da! There it is. Dark side Phil thinks he can over uh, be funnier than me or be be a better streamer than me. Uh, he lost out on that that deal. So. There it is. Thank you for subscribing. Another one. Thank you. Congratulations on the chair and award. You two and mods Thank should you. be proud. We fans Thank sure you. are. Thank you for everything. 666 and 7722 keep Perry and Reseda. I want to thank all my moderators out there, as well as Tom B. He's, he's so awesome. And all my moderators, I want to thank everybody that works for me. Thank you so, so much, everyone. Everyone in all 50 states, everyone. Five viewers, five sub viewers, five subs. Thank you so, so much. That means the world to me, man. Perry, I want to cover my pee pee and peanut butter and take you to pound town. Does this make me gay? Yeah, but that's not going to ever happen. Celebratory Twitch chili cook off at Villa La Paloma Pool in honor of Perry, his new award and his 75th birthday. Hashtag ARP number 7,722. Well, my 75th birthday is a lot. This is going to be uh, another 20 some odd years or almost 20 years. So uh, thank you for wanting to come over here in about 18 years. Okay. Or longer. So. Hey, Perry, it's your pal, Dennis Wilson of the Beach Boys. All I have to say is hashtag turn the wave and y'all will be sitting on top of the world. 
Rock and roll, Dennis. Rock and roll. But I'm not turning around the microwave. No, thank you. That was Whitney. a professional and sexy apology. Love it, baby. When are you getting your vaccine so I can come over? Describe how we will have sex. I had one vaccine done Thursday. I'll get the next vaccine this coming Thursday. Of Okay, today's Friday. Yeah, I had a vaccine yesterday, and I'm getting the next vaccine next Thursday. Okay? When, when did you get your vaccines, if you've gotten them already? Let me know. All right? And then I will allow you to come over. Okay? And then thank you also for forgiving me about last Tuesday. Yeah, I was a real son of a bitch last Tuesday, and I'm sorry. Really sorry. How do you scare Cheryl. Put a fish in your diaper. Seven seven two two. No, 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 no. No fishes in my diaper, girl. Hi, party. It's Tim, your eight-year-old fan. I asked my dad why you have all those guys' pictures, and he said you like to kiss boys and is married to Don. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Major lie. Sorry. Dark Side Phil got 40K last time he won the award. He spent it all on sweaty men on the phone. Shout out to AN 1337. Because he's a loser. Because he's a loser. That's why I now have the chair. Thank you. Thank you for subscribing. Perry, so glad to talk to you again. We should meet up for some more ice cream. I had such a good time with you last time, honey. Oh, you remember that time in Palm Springs, huh? God, that's hilarious. Oh, my God. That is funny. He, he, he remembers the time. I'll tell you, it was back in like 79, I think. It was either 79. I don't believe it was after my car accident. I believe it was... I believe it was before my car accident. Um, as a matter of fact, I'm almost positive it was 1979 when I met up with Spacey when I was doing a, a, a complete freestyle show outside of Swenson's Ice Cream, downtown Palm Springs. It was putting on a massive freestyle show in front of uh, the ice cream place. There was like, I don't know, eight or 12 people surrounded in a big circle uh, watching me, you know, do click clacks and and kick flips and walk the dog and and uh, nose wheelie and a right, tail wheelie. We, you're and right, you're losing the audience. Six. You're losing the audience. We don't care about skateboarding. Yeah, okay. Sure. All right. Thank you for subscribing. Oh, boy. Thank you for subscribing. I just had a blackout today and flipped out the way Perry did in that raw fish stream. The police had to make sure I was okay. No more raw fish. Dude, if you were possessed like I felt last Tuesday, it was one hell of a scary thing. And I hope I never get like that again, because it was one hell of a scary night. I mean, a very scary night. I mean, I call myself Scary Perry. That name was given to me as a joke from a snow ski accident. But, dude, last Tuesday night was one scary evening for myself even. And uh, I, 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 I do not want to repeat it. I do not want another night like last Tuesday. What is the difference between an Italian grandmother and an elephant? About 50 pounds in a black dress. Only 50 pounds, huh? Thank you for subscribing. 
pair have you ever given or received a blumpkin? Dog bless. You're disgusting. You're disgusting. A blumpkin? What's a blumpkin? A blowjob and a pumpkin? No. I, I, I don't do those things. I'm. Hey, poopy pants. Why don't you strap on one of those diapers and drop a number two for us? No need for a number two. <sighs> Happy! I know you only eat what you like and I respect that. My question for tonight is how do you plan to make the fish taste like cock and balls? I don't. Fish is fish. Scarf Master, what is our favorite monster flavor? How many of those do you drink a day? What do Don's lips taste like when you mouth assaulted him? Monster Energy Blueberry. Uh, whatever, whatever energy drink comes in blueberry is my favorite uh, energy drink flavor. And uh, is it was it D three or C three that I picked up at um, at um, GNC Vitamins was my favorite uh, month's favorite energy drink flavor, but it. Thank you for the five subs, my friend. Thank you so so much. Another five subscribers. Thank you. Hey, baby girl, I love seeing you and Mikey Wave on camp. I ordered a whole fish to be delivered and let's heat it up in Mikey Wave while we bang it. You're disgusting. For $200. I'm Damien from AfricanCursedFish.com. Glad to see our cursed fish we send you worked. Rage is the first fish. The next cursed fish arrives soon. Cursed fish? I don't know who you are. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, so you're the one that sent that raw raw fish last Tuesday? Well, you know, it, 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 it was like it was a cursed fish. That fish was like a demon when it came into my apartment. And dude... Do not ever do that to me again, please. Do not ever do that to me again. It stunk. It was raw. It was it was disgusting, gross, uh, scary. I, I was just, I, I was just freaking out over all the for all that stench in my apartment. And right now, with what's in my apartment here now, uh, I want to get rid of it like ASAP because of all the stench that's in here. Nice trophy. Could you set up a Zoom call with you in the in the center screen while his fans masturbate in the smaller screen surrounding you? No. No way possible. It's good to see you in movies again. I saw you start in Guys Eating Cock Volume 12. Good for you. Glad you found more starring roles. That's a lie. The opening ceremony to Credenza Fest 2021 will commence with the traditional burning of an armoire, the enemy of the Credenza. Fuck on wires. Because it's a great, because it's a beautiful piece of furniture is why you're jealous of my mom, my late mother's Credenza. And that's why you all, you know how to do is talk about my credenza. It's a bedroom dresser. Nice one. Period. I wore dead man's clothes and a blood-drawn pentagram with candle corners. Satan said he had nothing to do with you being a baby and to own your shit. I don't know what you're talking about. If you know Satan personally, that's scary, isn't that's scary enough. Uh, and there's no reason for you to write me ever again. Thank you. Your microwave is a big piece of shit. Turn it around, you greasy bastard. 
you would never the real the real William the Refrigerator Perry would never talk to me like that. So you're not the fridge. Okay, you're not the fridge. You're just some punk. Hi, Peaches. Let's put that raw fish in microwave and heat it up while we heat each other up. Set no, the fish to potato you. and let Sifel tower this. No, thank you. If the microwave is so heavy that it can't be moved, how did it get in her apartment? Or was her apartment built around the microwave? Did Jay help? No, you don't understand. I had I had a, a neck surgery that pulled three vertebrae out of my neck. Church master, and, we've all heard uh, your guarantee of three loads any woman you have sex with. Why did you shortchange Randy with only one load of semen? What are you talking about? That was a guy. I never shortchanged Randy. I never had sex with Randy. I'm not interested in having sex with men. Period. Now, about carrying the microwave in, I had I was able to pick pick up uh, items as heavy as the microwave before my third neck surgery. When I had my third neck surgery, I, I can't lift stuff as heavy as my microwave. I can barely bench, uh, what is it, 45 or 65 pounds in my gym, in my, my apartment complex. It's like an embarrassing bench. But all we have is machines in there, and uh, and that's all I'm able to bench because of my third neck surgery, which pulled vertebrae that uh, pulled gave away that that actually gave up all my strength. Yo, everyone's in the city at fish and firewood. Let's make him homeless. December 12th, 2021, hashtag tips for tomb, hashtag tips for den, hashtag tips for fuck mill, hashtag you, homeless skinny. Fuck you, fuck you, big Mike. And if I know who you are personally, fuck you even more. You evil, demented bastard. Fuck you. Facts. What are facts? Perry, I'd like to buy your last words. I'll give you $10,000 if on your final stream on 12 12 21 your dying words are Jeff Bezos sucks hashtag tips for a tomb. Should I say that or should I not say that? It's not going to be my last stream because I'm not dying on 12 12 21. I better not be dying on 12 12 21. How was a set of Oklahoma's? Did you keep the white chaps? I never was on a set called Oklahoma's. That was just a stupid saying that went on after the. What was the name of that shoot that we were on? When they, when they, uh, the, the guy, oh, the guy, yeah, the, the guy thought that I was on a set called Oklahoma's because he, he was being a smart ass on that one film set. And I forgot the sh shit. What was the name of that shoot? Anyway, I don't even remember it. It's just a bunch of bullshit back in those days. Does the fish smell like Scarlett Johansson lady parts? I don't know. I hope she doesn't smell like fish. I, I don't believe she would because she's a clean woman. And I think she cleans herself down there. Perry offer always on the table. $30 to run 10 laps of your couch. There's plenty Hell of them no. that's good for you. Just no stopping. Belushi. Not enough money. And there's way too much shit in this house. I can't even walk around any of this until it's all thrown away. What kind of moron has two chairs in the same space? Get rid of that greasy piece of shit behind you. I don't ever want to see it again. Fuck you, you fuck. 
It's, it's a beautiful piece of furniture, you piece of garbage. People don't know what good furniture is. And thank you for making that comment. Ugh. Get rid of that piece of furniture? Thanks. I, I like a nice comment like that. Because it kind of shows that you are... You said you said something bad and your comment was blocked and Pablo's an asshole. Pablo was the one that rear-ended my truck and totaled it. Perry getting so much seafood 7722 is becoming a wet market over there. Is this how the HIV pandemic started? The, the HIV uh, uh, scam bullshit lie. I don't know how that got started. I'll tell you the God's honest truth. I never had HIV. I never got HIV. And I don't ever plan on catching HIV from anybody. So it was all a huge lie and a big fucking j smart ass joke. With all these fish delicacies around you and your apartment smelling like fish, does it remind you of your steamy night with Sheba? Hashtag ARP. Ugh. I don't even want to think of that night with Sheba. It was disgusting. Not only are we in funny guineas, we also love to hang out in front of schools and little teenage girls. Why the fuck aren't we best friends yet? We're not best friends because we don't see each other enough like we used to back in the late 90s, early 2000s. Are you back in Hollywood or are you still up in Lake Tahoe? This $5 is for Trevor. Sorry Perry thought it was smart to leave the fish in the hall. Perry will pass the five through the peephole we cut in her wall. That was my next door neighbor and... Uh... I'm sorry. I didn't realize that how bad it was smelling right right outside my front door. Something you guys don't know is that Perry used to shine shoes. He made them look like mirrors. Go home and get your fucking shine box, Perry. I haven't shined shoes. I was never a shoe shine boy. I mean my parents had a shoe shine box. Carson Daly would have taken bigger bites and wouldn't have yelled at his publicist. Hashtag tips for tomb. Hashtag apologize to tomb for screaming at him. Hashtag pool party 12, 12 21. Carson Daly's a punk. And no, there will never be a pool party. My apartment complex. Stop saying 12, 12, 21. 12, 12 is the anniversary of when my father passed on 12, 12, 12. But it's not. When I plan on dying, don't ever say a date that I'm going to be dying on. That's demented. That's disgusting. Demoralizing as well. Perry turned the microwave. You have a fake disability scam and drank car so you like a milkshake. 7722. Microwave so a fish for 10 minutes. Scar, fake scar, huh? So you call this tracheotomy scar a fake scar, huh? Yeah, stupid motherfucker. I was in a coma, which is what, where that scar came from. Jag off. I can't wait to make you my new vice president. You shoe nice and I will bring this country to glory. I am so proud of you, scare master. Pre uh, president Donald Trump, I'll work with you. I'll work with you. But I got to stay in California, though. I can't come to Washington, D.C. I got to stay in California because I got to keep skateboarding. We got to reopen them skate parks so I can skate, keep skateboarding. No, you're done with skateboarding, Perry. You're a streamer now. That's uh, I stream at night. I skateboard during the day. Oh, no, you don't. And let's let's cut the oh, I thought we agreed we're going to stop with the O oh thing. The O oh, O oh thing. I, I, no, I'm, I'm, get, I'm not I'm getting, an O -er. I'm uh, I'm just, I know. oh, because I'm just... I, I'm over it. I'm over it. And I think a lot of people are over it. Let's just... It's annoying. Okay, got it.
Perry used your shop vac to suck the smell out of the air in the hallway. Then eat the smell out of the vacuum because it's a delicacy. The Lucy. It's going to take a lot more than just my shop vac to clean the hallway smell. Uh, what's tomorrow? Saturday? I hope she's here Saturday. Shit. We are very interested in your rating system for our menu. Was our sushi a 7 3 star, a 6 2 star, a 5 3 star, a 4 8 star, a 4 6 star, or a 8? It was very good. The sushi was very, very good. You're like an 8 4 star. Yeah, the sushi was very good. Hi, tough guy, me and the nose are associates. He mentions you at Mob Poker Nights. Heard you act your family for a credenza. Want to join my crew? No, thank you. You've become a better food critic than myself. I really love hanging around your streams. You're the best. Thank you, Anthony. Thank you, my friend. $50 offer. Drop your hands, spin around, and start playing your cheeks like a set bongo drums to the tune of your Oh, Perry. so you want me to lose hashtag my stream, huh? Money, hashtag tips for a tune. Listen, idiot. There's no nudity on this stream. Thank you. $50, $5, $5,000, no nudity on this stream. I don't care how much money you offer. They won't, they, I'll lose the stream. And I think that's what you want to have happen. Because you're jealous! Perry, I'm glad you liked my tuna sandwich. Now will you please raw dog my wife? Your wife is hot, but you know what, Stooge? You need your wife for yourself. I'm not, I'm not going to uh, go against your, 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 your marriage... I'm not going against your married uh, uh, laws and have sex with your wife. So you can all of a sudden divorce your wife and say, oh, you had sex with Perry and you liked it. And then you'll sue me for, for having sex with your wife. No, no need. We were considering the multi-million dollar advertising campaign with Mr. Caravello. The statements made by both Perry and Chum have eliminated it. Because your food sucks. I would know. I would never do any campaign for Burger King. Your food sucks. You know, normally I I don't turn down a good business opportunity, but I agree with you there. Burger King does suck. <coughs> I want to end this stream, please, because of the smell in my apartment. Nope. Oh, thank you, motherfucker. Hey, don't call me motherfucker. You got you, you, this is your job. You can throw out the trash later. Perry, you're farting for free now. I'm offering you twenty five dollars to fart into the mic and scream fish fart Friday fuckers. Five dollars no, more no, fart on no sandwich. No farting coming out of my ass at this time. Sorry. I don't have any farts in me. How can you say that? I heard about three earlier. Just you try it. Try one right now. Was... Try one right now. Bill I don't have any farts it. in me. Try it. How do you try it when you have nothing? Do nothing I need to tell you how to try to fart? When you're not ready to take a shit, you don't know. You, you can't really fart. That's how. When you're about to take a dump is when you start farting. Okay? Are you pushing? Yeah. Okay, well, we'll try later. Yeah. Yeah, there's no farts. There's no farts possible. Watching you eat those fish sandwiches has me fantasizing about how you will eat me. 
Can you show me on a sandwich how you will go down on me? Whitney? Oh, boy. Oh. Hey, Perry, while you got the sandwich out, I think now's a good time yeah. to balance it on your head for the $10. Take your hat off and just put it on your head. I know uh, he's good for it. One sandwich? Yeah, for now. Just balance it on your head. Hands away. Let's do a countdown. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, four, five. What do you mean five? That was like four, three. Jesus. Three. Two. One. Well, your seconds are slower than shit. I like to go for accuracy. One. We're done. Thank you. That'll be ten dollars, please. Yeah. Okay. It's faster blade. He's good for it. All right, Fedora back on. Let's move on. Oh, man. I will not stand for this insolence, peasant. Take back all you have said about the sandwich. Or I sentence you and Chom to execution on December 12th, 2021. Your execution will be the food that you provide because your food is poison. Okay? Your food is going to be laced with cyanide poisoning. And I want no one to eat your food ever again. Starting from 12-12-21 forward. So your, your restaurants will be out of business starting on 12-12-21. Thank you. Burger King will be closed down starting on 12 12 21. Thank you very much. Thank you. Nice to hear that uh, Burger King's uh, announcing their shutdown. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for subscribing. Hi, Perry. I was going to visit you tonight as a surprise for your stream, but your apartment stunk like death, so I had to leave. Sorry, babe. Oh, baby, come back anytime. After t what? Were you here? Or were you actually here? And you actually smelt the shit outside my <laughs> the shit fish. Oh, uh, come back another time, sweetie. Thank you for subscribing. I'm so sorry also, Whitney. Leave it to an Italian to stink up the entire hallway. Your neighbors must be disgusted by living next to Greasy Gypsy. Keep this ape in line, Tom. I am in line. Uh, the, the smell in the hallway is due to the shit delivered to me a little earlier this evening. <clears throat> And I threw it out in the big bin outside, but the big bin is loaded with garbage. I'm going to have a problem throwing this shit outside there. Oh, my God. Just out of curiosity, what was the final destination of the uh, 
can that you opened that smelled so bad? What do you mean the Final Destination? The big like when, when you garbage, took it out, did... the, the garbage, the big garbage bin out by the street. Okay. It was, and the big garbage bin out by the street is loaded with trash. All that's out, that's outdoors, right? Yeah, of course. Okay. My next door neighbor, Trevor, is not too happy. Quick question. What rating and how many stars would you give the taste of Randy's semen when it's roped in your mouth? Hashtag pool party 772212221. Zero, 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 and more zeros that you could ever imagine. What would I rate Randy's semen? I would never have Randy in my mouth. Never. I don't care how you tie me down and gag or, and, and try to force me. Perry, what would you rate the Randy Callahan blowjob? Randy gave your hand. I never job gave Randy Callahan a blowjob. Nice work on the handy scare master. The one received, he was very good. Other than that, I never gave him a blowjob. He sucked me down like a fucking milkshake. He was like a nine four star, but that was a guy. I prefer women sucking my dick. Like Linda, like Linda was when she and I were together. Attention subscribers. Perry will tell everybody that you are dead and recite your eulogy at the comedy store and try to take all your money. No, I won't. I'm not reciting a fucking eulogy at the comedy store. And the comedy store is closed. Unless you're doing comedy in the fucking parking lot. Which which holds maybe, what, a half a dozen cars? Thank you for subscribing. Despite last event's deaths at Credenza Fest 2021 will continue the tradition of a blood orgy on the sacrificial Credenza as the finale. <sighs> There's no... Blood official on my late mother's credenza. So get the fuck out of here with your stupid comments about my late mother's credenza. You're jealous because it's a beautiful piece of wooden furniture that comes from way before I was even born. Okay? It's an awesome piece of furniture. And thank God I have it and it's still used by me. Remember when you punched him because you bought a cell phone you couldn't afford? It was a long time ago. It was a long time ago. And it had nothing to do with the phone that I was, uh, that I was barely able to afford. God. Perry, are your tits lactating? If so, can you bottle some of the sweet, sweet mood juice for me? Love you, babe. <laughs> I don't lactate like a woman, you fucking wacko. I'm not a chick. Nuke here. Man, I love that Costco brand microwave you got. How much to throw your Rockstar DVD in that bad boy for 20 minutes? Never gonna happen. Well, let's talk about that for a second. No, it's never gonna fucking happen. My rock star, my rock star DVD will melt, and I'm, and then it'll fucking, uh, yeah, it'll, it'll cause a fire. So no, no it'll it's cause not a fire. Fucking happen. I, I don't, th I don't think ten minutes. But what about? It's not gonna fucking happen. What about five minutes? Again, five seconds. Not going to happen. I don't know if you get a decent offer. I think you got to consider it. My microwave is not getting a fucking piece of plastic thrown in there to fucking melt. Are you stupid? Yeah, it sounds to me like you're fucking stupid. No, it's just, it, yeah, the, the DVD would probably be affected, but it would be, five it minutes. would definitely be so affected. So what? You don't need, who, who, who watches DVDs anymore? You don't even, you don't need it. You don't need the DVD. My TV doesn't work that way anymore. Somebody, no, you somebody... guys, you, you, you stream everything. So it, it, the, it's no loss. It's a lousy movie anyway. Yeah, I guess. Whatever. So if the right offer comes in, we consider it. 
Whatever. Perry, it's Wes Most. Don't forget to tell everyone about the Easter pool party and microwave spinning event this weekend. I'm in charge, fat fuck. Get the fuck out of here, fat fuck. You have no, you have no responsibility. Perry, or- Francesca Caraca Liflower. You give stupid people hope. Windy City Heat is number one in Micronesia. You are famous, you dumb cock slut. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's an honor. I appreciate it. Okay, so we are on course. The package will be on your porch on the 5th at midnight. Just run it up to me on the 6th to Donovan Prison in San Diego. You get out of prison on the 6th? I thought you were in prison for life, you murdering bastard. Even though you ate fish all night, I can still smell the garlic and marinara through the stream. Whatever. Whatever. I don't care anymore. What makes a silly Sicilian dick? Thoughts? Thoughts? Like yee-haw. 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 Hashtag Don Keenuts. Whatever. Absolutely crazy. Attention subscribers, if somebody dies near your apartment complex, Perry will tell the police that you're a murderer and try to get you arrested. That's a freaking lie, you bozo. <clears throat> Spanish flutey. Please quit, Perry, you know you want to. The day you quit and become homeless will be the greatest day of my life. Hashtag yeah, I know. To for a tomb. Never gonna happen. That'll never happen. I'm not gonna ever allow that to happen. I just, I just won an award, okay? Loser? Have you ever won an award like this, huh? Loser? Huh, scumbag? Have you ever won something like this? I don't think so. I don't think so. This Sunday is the Easter Bunny Pool Bash. Come throw eggs no, in the pool isn't. and eat fish sandwiches. Perry will be playing the Easter Bunny. No, I'm not. There's no pool party here Sunday. Pool's locked. Okay. Hey, Perry, uh, you did get an official offer to uh, microwave the DVD for $50. Do we want to do that now? That's not, I don't give a fuck. I don't bucks. give a fuck. There's no gonna, there's no gonna, there's no goddamn DVD that's going in my microwave, dumb fuck. Fuck you with that stupid offer. Well, I thought we'd entertain good offers. Fifty dollars. I don't give a fuck if it's a thousand dollars. So? It's a fucking microwave. It's a DVD. They don't mix. What's your counter offer? Hundred? They're not going together. It's not food. It's a DVD. It's plastic, though. It's not going to blow up. It's not like it's aluminum foil. It's not like it's metal. It's it's fine. It's plastic. Yeah, so it'll it has, get a... Yeah, it the has DVD. magnetic... It, it, the, 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 the bottom of the, mic, of the DVD has a magnetic film on it. No, it will, doesn't. Th- that will infect the microwave. I'm not no, doing it. It doesn't have anything metallic on it. It really doesn't. I'm not trusting it, so no. I don't give a shit what dollar amount you want to offer me that. Well, if we get a higher if we get a higher amount, you're gonna hear from me again. Oh god. I wanna do this fucking thing. Forty bucks if you stack the fish sandwiches on your head in a diaper, you cocksucker. What? I already did that earlier. Jesus. Hey, I'm just going to interrupt you because you're already breaking one of the rules subtly. When you say, I want to end this 
fucking thing. It's eight it's, fucking thirty, man. We Perry, got it. I don't. I don't. I don't care. Excuse me. Hours. I'm talking. When you say end this fucking thing, you're bad mouthing our channel. You're bad mouthing the brand. That's no, 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 against no, the rules. No, no, no. Excuse me. Excuse me. I didn't mean to say it like that. Okay. I meant end this fucking thing, meaning end this stream tonight. Not right. End this fucking thing like it, like it, like it's a okay. shit. Okay. Well, Perry, stream. when you say when you say end this fucking thing, it doesn't mean that my stream is a shitty stream. I mean, end this fucking oh, thing. Well, end tonight's stream. That's how it comes across. Because because it's three and a half hours we've been on. We started yeah, at so, five. Yeah, right. and it's eight thirty. Okay. What do you plan on doing? Going till midnight? No, I'm, like we're going with doing to me Perry all the time. Can I talk now? We go with the flow of the stream. Now, because it was Fish Friday, we got back. No, don't lean back like that. Sit up. Because it was Fish Friday, we, there was a long period of time where we couldn't run tip comments. So we're backed up. We're catching up now. And when we catch up, we can end. And then you can throw your trash away. Okay? But do not call this stream this effing thing or badmouth the stream or badmouth the channel. I'm not badmouthing the stream or the channel. I'm saying uh, I'm... I'm I'm. How, how, what's the word I'm looking for? I the, the the slang, end this fucking thing means like like end end the show, not end. Well, the, that's, the, a the, that's a that's a that's a terrible. Stream. First of all, it's not a show. This, it's a stream. That's a terrible way to articulate it. Okay. Moving on. Maybe it's my Italian attitude. Maybe. How many movies have you put Dan and you? Zero. How many wives have you hit? One. How many neck injuries have you faked? Two. Hashtag homeless skinny hashtag tips for two hash s dot t dot w. How much money has he given me? Zero. Perry. How much to have sex with the fish's mouth? When you reach orgasm, say, Oh, Randy, I see you are still the best blowfish in the ocean. Never happening. Not allowed. Not allowed. Hey, t-shirt tucker motherfucker. Clean your apartment. Also brush your teeth, your breath smells like shit and cum. Hashtag tip for tomb. After this stream tonight, the apartment's going to be cleaned. Yes. Thank you. Thank you for subscribing. And thank you for the gifts of the subscribers. That, that's thank not you. the first time my e -Girl Gamer has gifted subs like that. That's, that's a real That's very thing. nice. We, we that's really very appreciate nice. that. Thank you. Very, very nice. Thank you so, so much. What is that? 10 from that guy? Put the raw fish on the George Foreman. Put the George Foreman in the microwave. No. Put the microwave in the credenza. Put some firewood on the creedy. Stop it with my late mother's credenza! Well, getting back to the microwave uh, of the Rockstar DVD, the offer is now up to $75. It could be $7,500! And it's not fucking happening! Fucking A! You do the hokey pokey and you turn your microwave around. That's what it's all about. And that's not gonna fucking happen either! Mr. Curvell, did you get more pleasure out of choking your mom, your ex-wife, or Randy's cock? You'll miss your bisexual bones after December 12th, 2021. Bones. I didn't like any of these events. They were all terrible. Just the reminder of them is, makes me sick. Hi, baby. You look great. Go down on me like him. Mm -hmm. 
Love mm-hmm. me like blah, 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 blah. You know, look, I got Whitney Cummings. I got Scarlett. Well, Scarlett Johansson's really Colin Joy- Jost's, uh wife um, or girlfriend. Uh, I, I prefer sticking with one, and that's Whitney Cummings. If you're if you're going to be a part of it, uh, let's talk later. But right now, I'm really, really. Hi, Perry. It's Johnny. I send you a beautiful cake, and you say you don't like it. Eat him and show some respect and eat the cake. Italians rule. Oh, oh, oh. I ate the cake. I turned the cake down. It just it wasn't my taste buds. It tasted warm. And- How dare you blame for your behavior on Tuesday? I am not a demonic fish. You are evil. The fish and the rest of the fish in this apartment is disgusting. At this hour, it's getting worse as the hours go on. But last Tuesday's raw fish was absolutely disgusting and uh, very demented to me at that hour in time. Scarlet? Perry selfishly strangles his mother, the woman who created him, screaming, Mom, give me the fucking car, you demoned. Oh, oh. Brian is favorite. Not Brian's favorite. She loved all of her children. If I, if I, if Brian was her favorite, then why the fuck did she move me to Costa Mesa? Huh? Why? Wasn't it for my health issues? God damn it. Thank you for subscribing. Fucking motherfucking assholes. Perry, it's Wes most. It's true about me and Whitney. I beat that white pussy up. Whitney wasn't the only thing coming. You're, Get it. you're a fucking liar. You're a motherfucking liar. All I got to say is you're nothing more than a motherfucking liar. Period. You fucking liar. Great review of the fish sandwiches, baby. Now that you're done, let's get to my favorite segment, mailbag. Every mailbag you open is hot. Love, I would love to tonight, but you know what? There's so much fish in this apartment and trash in this apartment. I, I'm going to have to turn down opening mail items until Tuesday. Okay, sweetie? I thank you for everything that you've uh, done for me and everything you've said about me and all the loving loving remarks you've made on this stream and stuff. But, sweetheart, not this evening. We'll do it on Tuesday. Okay? Love you bunches. Thank you. Has donated five Subway sandwiches. Again. Again. Not tonight. I've got enough food sent here. I want no more food sent here. Not tonight. And especially Subway sandwiches. This is not an evening for Subway sandwiches. I don't want their tuna sandwiches tonight. Can you move to your right? Scoot over. You are in the comments. In and in. A little more. In and in. Nope, scoot a little more. In and in. Still too close. 666 and 7722. Thank you, Danko, Mighty. That's very helpful. I ride for Tom and you've been disrespecting him lately, guys. Fuck a bitch ass scary Perry. He'll cap you if you keep disrespecting Tom B. Snoop Dogg, I look, look about two about last Tuesday, uh that raw fish just made me fucking slip a disco, okay? Meaning slip a slip a disc or, or just fucking go off. Uh and last Tuesday was just not a good night for me. Okay? And tonight the smell of all this raw fish in here. Well, not, it's not that it's raw. It's just that it's it's been sitting around here for the past, what is it, three hours? And uh, it's just stinking up my apartment, as well as the fish that was out in front of my apartment. And my next-door neighbor uh, banged on my door about, and I had to throw it out. Um, 
It's just plain disgusting and gross. My my apartment right now smells like a fucking open open uh, uh, tuna can that's just going bad. Okay, so um, I can't wait till the night stream is over so I can get all this garbage out of my house. Is it safe to say that fish that fish is a triggering thing for you? What? That fish is it a triggering thing for you? It sounds like it's like a you know how there's like it's some triggering disgust- things for a, people. It's a disgusting thing for me now. It's just it's 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 making my throat gag and gaw because of how gross my apartment's starting to smell. Triggering thing. I don't ever want fish in my house. I got one hundred dollars on the fish in the microwave, but the microwave must be turned so the stream can watch it cook. No, Perry, do some no. chat. Oh, no. Oh, 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 no. Oh, oh. no, 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 God damn it, no. Tuesday stream was nearly impossible to masturbate to. For two hundred dollars, show us your butt crack for ten straight minutes. Do it for Pete Carroll. I'm not showing my butt crack for 10 minutes. I show that I show a body part lower than my waist and I lose my stream. So out of your fucking mind. Okay? Thank you, dumbass. And it's not the real uh In 1992 I dropped one of the greatest trap albums of all time and you were doing gay shit for movie roles. We are not no, the same cuz. Fuck you. I got in trouble. I got in trouble because of kissing a ton of women on a film set. And then kissing or, or trying to say goodbye to a girl on our way home from the film set. And then the, the publicist made the remark that that uh, she thought that I was going to rape her on the side of the freeway on ramp, which I say is a fucking farce. And, and that's what happened, okay? So nothing more said about what happened in 92. End of story. You're killing it tonight, Perry. Forget about Whitney Cummings. You can't be seen around with her. You're out of her league. Tom Selleck, that's an extremely polite compliment, and I appreciate that. Thank you. But Whitney and I are, are starting a, a friendship and possibly a good relationship. And I might be falling in love with Whitney. Who knows? Hey, bitch, I'm way too turned on by Mikey Wave. Grab him, let's hit the bathroom for a cold shower and hot sex. Oh, you're we can bang sick. him while we get wet. Oh, God. Never. Never. Tom, are we in agreement on the Perry penis emoji? Did you still want the Sheila Falcon father falling animated image? Let me know. There's not going to be an emoji. And stop talking about Sheila and her fucking and her father that way. You sick bastard. Fucking asshole. Perry. The hidden cam video of you and Randy in 92 is doing big numbers on Pornhub. I liked how you tugged his ears and caressed his cheeks. Hot. There was no cameras, and if there were, there better not be anything ever seen. I don't believe there was any cameras. This idiot once fish sent to 7,722 Reseda. Facts. My girlfriend drinks urine. No cap. Make Perry homeless. Hashtag homeless guinea. Hashtag impulsive. Hashtag tits wet. That's disgusting. Fuck Big Mike. He's sick. His girlfriend. If he has a girlfriend. Disgusting. Gross comment. Gross comment. $4.25 for Tomb. $0.75 is my offer on the credenza. Let me take it off your hands and the bones stay between us. Hashtag tips for Tomb. 
You're not, you're not, you're not allowed in my apartment ever, ever, ever. But thank you. That that was nice for the tips for Tomb. I I appreciate that. Asshole. Perry brother, love the stream and the food reviews. Can you give me a thumbs up if I can get you on the show sometime to blow some dudes? What about blowing dudes? No, no, guy, guy Fury. I don't blow dudes, okay, buddy? I do not blow dudes. That'll never fucking happen. Never. But but thanks for the nice compliment. California Rupkes and Nupkes want to make it clear we have no link to the plot to kill John D in Arizona to allow Mole to become your best friend. You're not doing anything with John D, so stop with the bullshit, you loser. Hey, my love, I can't believe I found you after all these years. Remember those wild Palm Springs nights on the beach? Miss you, Percy. Which which Terry in Palm Springs? Because there were like four or five different Terrys in Palm Springs. Uh, from junior high. I mean, God. Um, it, it could be Terry Lang. Uh, and if it was Terry Lang, uh, stop asking to end the stream. You ruined the one on Tuesday. This one is going to continue for hours and Correct. hours. You're not even halfway through. I'm sorry about what happened last Tuesday. Tuesday, correct? Yeah, today's Friday. Yeah, I'm sorry about what happened last Tuesday. Okay, last Tuesday I fucking freaked out over that wall, over that raw fish. That came in. It was it was it was scary and gross to me, and it freaked me I will, out. I'll say this, Perry. I, I I think tonight you you've handled it pretty well overall. I think everyone will agree. Thank uh, you. You you got fish. You got a lot of fish sandwiches. You got sushi. You got raw fish. You got other I things. I got everything. I got everything. You got that thing you opened earlier. Yeah. Um, you're handling it well. Oh, uh, thank you. Excuse me. It's West Most. The December 12th, 2021 Memorial Pool Party to celebrate Perry's murder is almost sold out. But Lucy Sushi is catering. Perry'spoolparty.com. There is not going to be a murder on 12 12 21. I plan on living for a long time, motherfuckers. I will give you $77.22 if you insert a butt plug that vibrates with each tip comment. Show me You're what that do. You're sick. That's funny, but it's also more, it's more disgusting than it is funny, but it is funny. Thank you for subscribing. I'd have to imagine that thing would be really uncomfortable, too. Yeah, I know. Your fake tracheotomy scar is just a handle for men to fuck your throat. You fat little fake who I'm going to make you homeless. Ha 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 ha. Hey, Satan! You've already stolen enough money and uh, furniture as well as a home from the family. Uh, listen here, Satan, you fucking cunt bitch whore. You are demonic. You're demented. The guy that you married is also evil. And I can't stand you or the motherfucker you married. So don't ever fucking come on my channel again. Or I will make sure you get blocked. You sick, perverted, psychotic, demonic cunt. Goodbye. And never text me or email me again or stream me again. You fucking bitch. Watch your Perry, it's what's most. Whitney and I are watching right now and laughing. We can't believe you licked this sandwich. She just blew me her sea style. Whitney wants nothing to do with you. You're a fucking liar, you pile of dog shit. For the fish sandwich on your bald head, you greasy cocksucker. 
Official poll, what's the biggest piece of shit? One for Kia truck, Thank two you. for shop vac. No, yeah, the shop vac will be used tomorrow. But I have a lot of garbage to throw out tonight when this is over. <laughs> You know, that brings up a, a, a question I have. Now what? If you're going to be using the shop vac tomorrow and cleaning up, could we just turn on the stream so people can just watch you clean up and use the shop vac? You don't have to interact with the screen or anything like that. Just, just let people watch the process. Maybe during the day. Oh, what? This little section of my apartment? No. Well, it'll just be like a special, we won't even call it like a real stream. It'll just be like a voyeuristic thing of just people watching you use a shop vac and tidying up. You don't have to talk to anybody. You don't have to, you know, sit down in the chair. I would prefer not. I would prefer not because I like to be private when I'm cleaning. Okay, well, if that's the answer, then that's the answer. But I thought maybe to make up for Tuesday, you'd want to give fans something a little extra. And maybe tomorrow, like I, I said... I thought I'm doing a little extra now by, by no. staying on all night long. No, you're doing a regularly scheduled stream. That's not going extra. Uh, I'm just saying, look, we got a stream on Sunday at 5 p.m. I'm saying tomorrow, you don't have to do any work. You don't have to sit down. You don't have to engage with anybody. You just... We just turn the camera on while you're using the shop vac and tidying up. That's it. And maybe it's five minutes. Maybe it's 20 minutes. Maybe it's a half an hour. It'll be a lot longer than that. Well, you know, we call it like the, the, the clean stream or something like that. You know, and people, people can send in tips if they want, but, but you're not going to be Let's interacting. Let's talk about you're it just in the be... morning. Let's talk about it in the morning. Okay, so you're, you're not saying no. No, I'm not saying no. Okay, so subscribers and followers, watch for Twitch notifications tomorrow because there might be a chance that this channel just goes on live to see Perry cleaning, but he's not going to be interacting. He's not going to be sitting down and talking into the screen. He's just going to be doing his thing. Maybe. Right? Okay. Yeah. We'll leave it there. But, but I think yeah. it's going to happen. Thank you for subscribing. You gave a guy nine four stars for sex? That's the gayest thing you have ever said and you say a ton of gay stuff. Hashtag homeless gag and he hashtag seal of fall cunt. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Randy Callahan, Randy Callahan sucked my dick so well. And the way he gobbled when I started to come, it was like a girl sucking me down, swallowing. Okay? He was he was a professional. He's done this way more than just me. All right? Nothing more said about that immoral, disgusting, gay garbage. Yuck. Neighbor Trevor, if watching, when you gave Perry shit about the smell in the hallway, did he offer you a blow job? He tends to do that sometimes. Oh, fuck yourself, you sick bastard. No, I'll never give anybody a, a, a blow job. I never gave anybody a blow job. Any man for that reason. Let's get the energy level up. Smash your head through your wall into Trevor's apartment. Look him in the eye and say, here's Perry, then blow him. Shut up, you sick motherfucker. Oh, God, this is just, it's, it's dragging me down. It's seriously dragging me down. Perry's script was written with you in mind. It's a sequel to a very famous movie. The working title is of right now Broken Neck Mountain. I'm sorry, talk to my publicist.
great fish Friday Perry. Way to give the fans what they want. Can't wait for the pool party stream. Lovable kisses, kissing face. Jag off! There's no pool party stream. God! How many fucking times do I gotta tell you fucking idiots? Perry, we are trying to get in touch with your brother Brian to award him the Nobel Peace Prize for his excellent care of your mother. Excellent care of my mother? There's no there's no Nobel Peace Prize for excellent care of my mother. If there was excellent care of my mother, he would have uh, she would have still be alive. But yes, okay, she was dying of cancer. All right. Yeah. Excellent care of my mother. Fucking ridiculous. Official poll. Which of these did Perry choke more viciously? Press one for his ex-wife, two for his mother, and three for Randy's penis. It's not an official poll. This is just a ridiculous poll. In, in, these, in these despicable memories, I'm done with. Get them off my fucking stream or I'm going to fucking stop the stream right when we're done tonight. Until the next stream. What is today? Friday. Till the next stream, which is Sunday. Oh, yeah. You, you caught yourself. You caught yourself. I appreciate I that. I caught myself. Yeah, I, uh, exactly. Very good. Very good. Baby, I hate Baby to see you angry. Let's relax. I am finishing masturbating right now. Open some more mailbag and we can both beat off. Love you. Baby doll, baby doll, baby doll. Whitney, honey, I love you so much. And I thank you so much for thinking about me. But it will be on Tuesday. I mean, look at all this shit in my apartment right now. I can't even, I can't even move to my right. And, and I have a lot of mail that I wanted to open up tonight, too. But all this food? I'll tell you what. Why don't we... No, we... do not even do not even have me open up one item tonight. No. Well, I was going to say one to close it. Not now. No. We'll, we'll, when we're done. Can we close it then? Well, we're, we're almost, we're, we're almost we Perry, we're almost caught up on comments. So once we do that and wrap up, I think... Opening one item wouldn't be the worst thing. Ay, 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 ay. Thank you for subscribing. Ooh. Tom, I am in NY on a movie shoot. Can I swing by your place? I brought some DRPs feeling really horny after seeing the picture of you. Hashtag tip for Tom. Thanks for are the. Are you in uh, New York, Whitney, or are you in California? That was Scarlett. Scarlett, Scarlett. I mean. Yeah, and thank you for the I comment. Think but... in, I think she's in New York. Because well, uh, that's what isn't she said. with uh, Colin Jost? I don't know. Is she, <laughs> is she trying to come by your place? That's what it said, but obviously I'm working right now. I'm doing this. <sighs> Boy. Perry, please show your bare feet. My wife is in defeat and I've heard Whitney is too. Not tonight. Sorry. Can you help me with directions, please? Where? Where do you need to go, Sh Sharon? Shannon, I mean, Shannon. Are you going home? Because you're not coming here. 20 dollars if you shop bought some fish sandwiches up on stream. You could shop not bought some happen. fish sandwich off your head. Maybe you not might grab the sandwiches first. If you're going to take the shop vac out anyway, why don't you just vacuum up some fish sandwiches? Make some money. I, because I, I don't want to deal with that loser. What loser? The fucking prick that wants me to fucking that, back him up. Don't the don't don't get caught. Don't get caught up in names. Oh, we're all yeah, caught yeah, up. Yeah, we're yeah, all yeah, we're yeah. all caught up. By the way, we're all caught up. By the way. 
Well, I'll, I'll see if it comes in. If, if it comes in, you will vacuum up one fish sandwich. $20 to vacuum up one fish sandwich. If it comes in, you'll do but it. But, they, but, but how the fuck am I going to record that? I'm not holding up this fucking camera lens to record no, 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 that. No, 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 no. No, no. Here, here's what you do. You move the chair to the side. You put it back where your kitchen is. You put a fish sandwich on the ground, and then you vacuum it up. That's it. Oh, my God. This, it'll re- is, it'll really... this is impossible. No, it's not. It's fucking possible. My place is too tight with all this shit in here. Those fucking pictures have got to go. Everything in here has got to go. It's Wes Most with a December 12th, 2021 pool party official poll. Who will Perry blow at the party? Press 77 for Trevor, press 22 for every new dude. Hey, Wes Most, I'll blow your fucking idea out of the water and everything you are saying out the fucking window because you're a demon and I can't stand anything that you say. So fuck all of you with all your stupid demented remarks. Fucking low life pile of dog shit. Get the fuck off my stream. Okay, okay. Why don't we end tonight with one of the boxes you got that you that you were really wanting to open? Then you can get rid of the box. Ugh, Quick mail. Fuck. Clear a path. This thing. What is that? I don't know. What's the return? It came a on? long time ago. Don't it open that Friday. Tonight. Don't open that tonight. It said, "It says open on Friday night." It's called Friday Night Mailbag. Perry's mailbag um, for Friday night. Did you get that today? No. No, I don't. Don't open it's that. Don't open that one. Long. Don't open that one now. I don't want to deal with that one now. Put it to the side. We'll open that on Tuesday. Okay. Another shit over here. Oh, Get one of the big ones that you were complaining about earlier. This one? All right, you can open that one. You know, you got that pretty easily. You made it sound like there was a, like a great wall preventing you from getting these packages. Because I got them all lined up over here. Yeah, I mean, that was that was a pretty easy grab. Because it's right next to me. There's a ton of them over yeah, there, though. Yeah, okay, okay. So you, you were selling it like it was impossible to get to. The other the other packages is a little a little harder than this one. Okay? Okay, okay. Everything after this is not easy to get to. The shop vac is hungry for fish sandwiches. There we go. We got the 20 bucks. How do you know? How well, do you know? Well, we're going to find out. 20 bucks. Yeah, we're going to find out. Now I got a fucking box here with a... What is that? It looks like a... It looks like a space suit or a, or a karate costume. suit. It's a costume. Yeah, it's a karate suit. Costume. Maybe you can wear that. Maybe you can wear that for a subscriber Sunday. Dragon Ball Z. Is there a Is note in there? Like, no. There, check. There, there, there must be. There is no note in here. Okay, why don't you just check instead of shouting? I'm looking at it. Okay. And all okay. I see is this. Okay. No note. Okay. So why don't we try that on, on Sunday? Yeah, that's for Sunday. Okay. A little teaser for Sunday. Uh, boy. So why don't we do this? Here. Put the box aside. Perry Tony Tony Hawk. Tony Hawk. Sending warm, lovable regards. Rad dude. Thumbs up if you blew Randy and force kissed Don. Never! Never ever happened! You should know better than to talk to me that way. Perry's neighbor Chico here. 
Just wanted to make something clear. All the apartments at Villa La Paloma have a fireplace. So please send wood. What? Do not send any wood. Not one apartment here has a fireplace. You weirdo. Please send wood. What the fuck are you fucking psychotic? I come down hard on Perry because he has no good home wrecking piece of shit that I'd like to say Tom B. I would be honored if you fucked my wife. This guy is sick. Colin Jost is fucking sick. Why, why, why would he be honored to have you fuck his wife? What a sick bastard. Uh, it's not for me to say. But hey, why don't you go over the schedule and the next time you'll uh, be seeing people. Tuesday, Friday, Sunday, 5 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. Okay? Because right, it'll still be daylight at 5 p.m. And that's when the sun starts flying in my uh, door over to my, my left over here, making me shut off all the lights in the apartment to where uh, the uh, camera looks like I have way too much light on in the background. Right. All right, now subscribers, please subscribe on YouTube at Perry Caravello. Join the Discord at Perry Caravello Official. Bonus content, patreon.com forward, forward slash Perry Caravello. Order a cameo at cameo.com forward slash Perry Caravello. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Scary Perry WCH. Listen to the Big Three Podcast at the Big Three Podcast.com. Exclusive Big Three content, of course, at wwwbig 3 And if you want to send Perry mail, send it to P.O. Box number nine. Of course, either Perry Carabello or Scary Perry. At P.O. Box nine. Canoga Park, California, 91305 forward slash 0009. So here's, uh, here's how we end things, Perry. Behind you, in that, you know, the, the, the corridor leading to the kitchen, you just drop a fish sandwich of your choice. It could be Popeyes, it could be Wendy's, McDonald's. Uh, you know what? Here's, I think it should be Burger King because that was the worst one. I think the shop fact should suck up a Burger King. Find the Burger King, drop it by where back there, and then bring the shop vac out, and then have the shop vac suck it up. Any top tip comments that come in after this point, I can't guarantee that Perry will react to. Because the stream's officially over now. This is bonus content. Do you have something at your door? People are saying there was a knock. Can you just check. Yeah. Can you check. Can you check real quick. Show it to the camera. Whatever it is. All right, bring it in. Hold on. Bring it in. Bring it in. A fucking pizza pan filled with fucking pickles. Bring it in. Bring it in. To piss me off. Bring it in. All right, let's bring it in. We got to show the camera. One at a time. One at a time. Okay. I know me, motherfucker. Grab them in my okay. So, this is take all the mask. Take the mask. You don't need the mask on, Perry. You don't need the mask on. Take the mask off. Is that a pizza? That's a pizza. It's a pizza box loaded with pickles. Okay. Well, you might get an offer for one of those pickles, you know. Tough shit. It's going in the garbage right the fuck now. Well, hold okay? on. What else did you get out there? You got to bring the rest in. fucking wood outdoors. Okay, you got to bring that in. Bring that These in. motherfuckers are out of their fucking minds. 
Son of a bitch! Bring it in, please. Ah! No, why do you need the mask just to go to your front door? Take the mask off. I don't trust people. Perry, take the mask off. You look ridiculous. What does it smell like in there? For when, when I was in there, it smelled like sulfur. Like bring it, bring fish. it, bring it, bring it closer because you also have a comment that came in. God damn it! Just come here. I want to throw all this shit out. Wait, stay there for one second. Stay there for one second. Pay attention, please. And don't fall over, please. <sighs> Dizzy as shit. Yay. Mom gave us little fines because we took care of her at the end of her life. She didn't give you shit because you choked her. You little homeless gay. Oh, fuck you, you fucking cunt. Get off my goddamn stream, you bitch. End it now. Okay, well, you still got to shop vac up the fish. So you can bring the wood back out. Now we got to do the fish shop vac and fuck then we're, we're done. No, you got the, no, you, you got paid for it. You got to do it. That's a professional light that he got from the uh, Twitch rep last night. No, turn that turn that dining room light off. It really screws the. Uh... Okay. Thank you. So what I think, mm, we, we want to see this happen. So maybe you want to move that chair. There it is. Maybe put the maybe put the shot here. Here's what here's what I suggest. Just so it gets in good camera range, put the fish sandwich on your new streaming chair, and then suck it up from there. That's an idea. Yeah, I, I like that. Yeah. Be a great way to christen the uh, streamer of the year chair too. For those tuning in late, Perry got a new chair and a trophy. Okay, so let's get the so let's move the chair so the camera can see it. Push the chair out a little bit, and then get. You know, I, I say we go for two sandwiches. Why not? Burger King and uh, one of the other ones of your choice. Just two sandwiches. Jesus. Oh, fucking A. I don't know where everything is anymore. It's all right. You just got to get two sandwiches. They're all right there. You're not here, jerky. I know. So let's get the sandwiches out and the shop vac on.
Can you see the sandwiches on my chair? Yeah, take the wrapper. Take the wrappers out. We just want the just the sand. Fuck that. Just the bear. I'll suck up no, everything. No, not the wrappers. Just the sandwiches. Otherwise, it doesn't count. Just the sandwiches. Um. We're not because you got to take the wrappers away. It's just got to be the sandwiches. It's gonna suck up everything. No, no, it's not. Sandwiches? No, I don't. No, not the wrappers. It doesn't count. It. Do, what you're doing now will not count. Take the wrappers away. Take the wrappers oh, away. Oh. Just the sandwiches. And now move the sandwich over in frame. Move it over to the edge. To the edge. Look at the monitor so you can see what we're looking at. We can't see the sandwiches. There you go. Okay. Let oh, Move it over to the right just a little bit. Dang. Okay. All right. Whenever you're ready. Yeah, that's great. Great shot. Let her rip. I don't think that's the right nozzle for this. The car nozzle. I think you're really an extra point for this. Okay, why don't you, why don't you uh, sit back down so we finish up? What? We're just done. This is, this no, is no. the end of the show. Like, yeah, it is, but just like another thirty seconds. You got to fucking kidding no, me. No, and then we're done. I promise. Oh shit! That I was a great. That, that was a great way to end Fish Friday. That was. A... If you could just sit down for 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 like thirty seconds, I promise I'll make it quick. That I sprayed a simple green. Clean my Beautiful. seat. This is why you're the streamer of the year. No, this is why I was the auto detailer for all over Orange County back when I was an incredible guy. Well, I'll tell you what, just, pay, just, just pay attention to the stream while I run the next couple. Okay. Chico here. Thanks for sending more firewood for the Easter pool party bonfire. We can also burn the disgusting chair behind Perry.
That is GR. Jealous bitch. Nothing disgusting about this chair. Twenty dollars to microwave an egg in a pickle for five minutes. Hashtag tips for us. Sorry, two. the show is over. You can handle that. An egg in a pickle for five minutes. An egg in a pickle for five minutes. Come on. Don't make me use my veto. An egg in a pickle. One of the pickles you got in the pizza box and an egg. And you can put it in a dish for five minutes. Hold on. There's one more. There's one more before you get up. Before you get up. Before you get up. Turn around. Everyone be sure to tune in tomorrow for Clean and Jerk starring Perry Caravella's Shop Vac. Hashtag suck suck suck. Hashtag suck it up. We love you, baby. Okay. Jiggly, if you're for real, prove it to me. That's the last one. Now let's get the pickle and the egg, and let's get that twenty dollars in. Where is the Yeah, let's get that twenty dollars in. Chair is obstructing our view. Don't do it yet. I don't see the uh, the money didn't come in yet. Faster blade's good for it though. Can you turn the? Can you just fix the uh, stream? The, the chair. The streaming. Your mouth now. What happened? Can you just turn the chair around because it's blocking the camera? That's all I'm asking. Hey, look! Look what's coming up. Hashtag Thank tips for tune. Oh, and this is for me, too. So I get the 20 bucks, and I don't even have to do anything. That's great. Thank you. All right, so before you put it in the microwave, let's show, let's show the dish before. And turn, that, turn that dining room light off, please. Pickle in the, the dish. And just crack the egg. You can crack the egg or leave it in whole. It's a dealer's choice. The egg is going to be in the... Cracked open the dish. Yeah, but you have to show it to the camera before you microwave it. I will. Okay. I will. And uh, I'm assuming there'll be a follow-up uh, offer for you to eat it, but we'll... That's out of the question. Cross that bridge when we come to it. No, I, I, I'm no fucking way. It's never going to happen. Never say never. Uh, never. I just said never. Okay. Okay. Never. Can you? Never, can you? Never. Never. Can never, you, never, never. Ever. 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 Can you? You got to bring the Perry. Hold on. You got to bring the egg uncracked and the pickle and the dish over here. It's cracked. It's in the dish. Okay. Here's what you got to do then. The pickle. Excuse me. Excuse me. The deal was for the a whole egg. So just put one. Just put it's one egg in there. No, 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 excuse me. An uncracked egg. So no, in addition to this, put it a crack, un uncracked egg in the bowl and then come back and show us. Oh, an uncracked egg? Yeah, one uncracked egg. Yeah, yeah I, I know. You had a tough life. Yeah, I do have a tough life. Okay. No. Dream. That's fucking, uh, hey, don't, don't say it's an effing stream. I said don't disrespect the channel. Uh, Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And turn that dining room light off, please. Not the, not the stream's fault. Okay, turn not turn that dining... Come on back, show us the whole egg in the bowl with the other egg and the pickle, please. And turn off that dining room light off. Do not microwave it yet. Come on over with the bowl. This is, the, this is what we'll call before. Okay. Whole egg in the bowl with the other egg and the pickle. Okay, in the microwave for five minutes, please. Gabish! Five minutes. See? Please. I don't know what, what the accomplishment is. Uh, do, you, do you want to just turn the microwave around to be a good guy and show everybody what the process? I have a problem here. What's your problem? Oh, there's crap on my 
my microwave. You're getting a lot of requests to turn it around so the stream can see the process. That's of never going to happen. That is never going to happen. Okay, five minutes. Get a plate. Can you just peek out by your garbage box and, you know, tell us, you know, thank people for coming by Fish Friday? Thank you guys for coming by for Fish Friday. What? I didn't say anything. Keep keep going. Hey Perry, guess what? We are we are one we are one subscriber away from six hundred. We're at five ninety nine right now. So Wendy! one. Call somebody, please. I don't I don't think Whitney has anything to do with it, but that's pretty amazing. We're one subscriber away from six hundred. So somebody tonight could be number six hundred. Is the microwave running right now? Yes, it's fucking running. Okay. Didn't you hear that pop? That was in the microwave. No, I, I can't hear it. Come on back to the screen and while, until that's done. Come here. Perry. Come on hey, back to the screen. There's eggs. Squirt jumping all over the place. It's all right. That's what it does. You got a couple more come in here. Holy Perry. shit. What's going on? No, no, you got to let it run. You can't open let it. It doesn't run. Go. Okay, so come on back. The second egg just exploded. Well, that's what eggs do. Come on back. Oh, Jesus Christ. We'll check on it when it's done. Here, I'm going to run uh, this. Five dollars to lick your lips, say bready or not, here I come and ejaculate into a fish sandwich and eat it. Shut up. No time for stupidity. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for subscribing, wherever you are. Hey, we reached 600. 600, good, 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 good. Hey, Clutch Canuck just put us over the top, 605. 605 subscribers, Perry, that's pretty awesome. Very good, very good. 605 subscribers. Very good. Oh, 606, Richard Heaney. 607. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everybody who subscribed. Subscribers are the lifeblood of the channel. Everyone. Happy birthday, Tom Beard's dad. Stream. This tip is for you. Thanks for raising a swell guy who brings us joy. Hashtag tips for Tom Beard's dad. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Graham. Uh, thank you very much to all you folks. That wasn't for you. Uh, Grandma Vello, thank you. Yeah, it is my dad's birthday. My dad turned 80 today, if you can believe that. And, uh, you know, of course, I had to work tonight, so I'm going to take him out for a nice steak dinner tomorrow night with my mom to celebrate his birthday. And I will use that $5 towards dinner, and I really appreciate that. Thank you. It's really, uh, really nice, and uh, I'll pass on. My dad doesn't necessarily know. Uh, <laughs> I, I told him I was working tonight. I didn't necessarily tell him what I was doing, but uh, I will pass along that uh, – those those well wishes. So thank you for everybody who's uh, passed that along. My dad had a really rough bout with the uh, second uh, vaccination shot. So uh, he's uh, looking forward to tomorrow. So that's uh, nice of you guys. That's an honor. No, I, I am not fifty. But thank you. Uh, how are we how are we doing on time? Thirty seconds. Okay, thirty second countdown.
But thank you, everybody, for the uh, nice uh, comments. I appreciate that. Can you count down the last 10? What? You know, count, are we at the last 10? 10 seconds? We're done. Okay, let's see the finished product. It's disgusting. No, I'm not eating it. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see. Ooh. I'm not eating it. Well, that offer hasn't come in yet. It goes in the garbage disposal. There's another offer for another 20 for an additional five minutes. It goes in the garbage disposal. Goodbye. Thank you for subscribing. This is for Tom's dad. Happy birthday. Tom, do you see yourself as Sean to Perry's Beetlejuice? Thank you, Belushi Sushi, and that is a great reference. Uh, I don't know. No, I, I, it's a little more than uh, Sean likes to do. I think Sean was slightly exploitative if that's a word it, 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 with Beetlejuice uh, for his own benefit um, and you know I don't know the ins and outs but I actually met him once but um, it's a great reference and I, I think it's I don't little... understand why you're still on the internet and this so, motherfucking thing well because Belushi excuse me Belushi uh, Sushi sent me a, a, a nice warm lovable tip for my uh, father's 80th birthday which is today, and it, it, that's very nice. Yeah, it is nice. It is nice. So thank you. But yeah, I, it, it, it's. Hmm. It didn't Sean didn't he die of like a heart attack or something like that? And then I I think that's why Beetlejuice kind of stopped, and then he moved. I think Beetlejuice moved with his family down with his mother down to like Atlanta or something. I don't remember. I don't remember the ins and outs. It's been so long since I've listened. Yeah, he had a stroke. That's right, he had a stroke. Yeah, you know that guy Beetlejuice? And he had a handler named uh, Sean. Um, but, yeah, I, I don't think it's... Not, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't think, I don't think Sean had to carry as much as I've had to carry. Happy birthday to Toom's dad. Toom, you are a saint and we love you. Give Scarlett Johansson a call. She seems really into you. Hashtag tips for Toom. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I greatly appreciate that. Uh, yeah, so uh, opening round drinks will be on you guys tomorrow night. Appreciate that. And uh, I don't know. We'll see what happens with Scarlett. Perry, you gonna, can you just come back for a second? I, th I think a lot of things just came in. Yeah. That's I think insane. we did, I think we just got a 20 gifted uh subscriber bomb and that's the most we've ever had. So I'd like to shout this guy out. Let me see it. It's coming up. Firewood Emporium will match all orders of firewood being sent to 7722 receiver you're, boulevard. You're, Half you're off all balance. Free your office with orders over $30. Do not send raw fish over here ever again. This fish day is it. There's no more fish days ever in my apartment ever again. Kabish, no more fish days. Hey, re re shout this guy out. Sh shout him out. Thank you, thank you. 20 subscribers gifted. Dude, that's an amazing gift. Gabe, wow. that's that's awesome. Thank you. That's the most that's amount amazing. of gifted subs we've ever had. That's amazing. Get the water running. Okay. Okay. That's amazing. That's amazing. Thank you. 
Yeah, Stern is is unlistenable now. He's just a complete. I mean, I mean, I stopped. Jeez, I stopped in like maybe early twenty fifteen. I can't imagine how bad he is now, and he was horrible then. That's six years ago. So we all love Gabe Horn. What's this about gay porn? Gabe Horn. It's the guy who gave the 20 oh, subs. Gabe Horn. No, Kevin Brennan is not my older brother. He's looking the, forward the, to Ralphus uh, Tuesday next week. Not really. Everyone send Ralphus to 7722 Reseda Boulevard. Do not send me Can't any more fish. Off the firewood. Or firewood. God damn it. Sorry, I didn't mean to talk over that. That was just running. We're done with the fish and firewood thing. Looking forward to Ralphus Tuesday next week. Everyone send Ralphus to 7722 Reseda Boulevard. Perry will eat it off the firewood. Fuck you. Yeah, somebody suggested that maybe you could take the firewood, put it on the patio, start a small fire, and then cook Never the fish over the fire. Never gonna happen! God oh fucking mighty! Put firewood on my patio and start a small fire. Yeah, so I can burn down my fucking apartment complex? No fucking way. Jagoffs. Okay, I got an important question now. Now what? Because I'm really getting fucking angry. What, what now? Okay, how are you going to clean? I mean, we're going to maybe do a cleaning stream tomorrow where you just tidy up and, you know, we just turn the I'm camera on. You right after we're done right now till no, I'm no. done. No, I know. I know we're done tonight. We are done tonight. But I'm saying tomorrow. But I'm just asking you, how are you going to address the smell in the hallway? How are we going to attack that? With simple green, very carefully. Okay, so can can I... Can I just run the stream and turn the ring cam on and just kind of watch you tidy up? Your your commitments are over for the night. Anything that comes on, you know, now is just kind of gravy. Turn on the ring camera if you want $20 to. $20 to knock on shit. your neighbor's door and when he answers, don't say anything and just do the robot until he closes the door. Oh, I'm not doing that. That's dorky. I'm not interested in doing something like that. And he even screamed, fuck you. We never want this to end. Just keep it running. We're we done! Watch Sorry, good Happy night! Happy Spirit Journey Formation Anniversary fuck Tombs fuck Pops. Fuck hey, Perry, you're being really disrespectful to the stream, and I don't like it. All right! That's perfect! Here we go. Here we go, right now. Here we go. Here we go. Tonight's stream is over! Okay, Thank I agree with that. Perry, out. just stop. Stop really one second. I appreciate it. I thank you so, so much for all coming out. See you, what is today, Friday? See you guys on Sunday. Good night, everybody. Love you all. Thank you all. We'll see you guys on Sunday. Good night. Okay, Perry, thank listen. Thank you for coming out. We'll see you Sunday at 5, but we might see you tomorrow when Perry cleans up. But anyway, I'm just going to turn on. I, I, want, I just want to see you. I think you should clean up the hallway just a little bit. Whoa. Thank you for the gifted subs. Thank you for the gifted subs. It's amazing. Ay, 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 okay, Perry, ay, your commitment wanna... to the stream is done. I'm going to carry on just a little bit, and I, I'd like to see your approach to cleaning up on the hall. I don't know if we're going to be able to see it, but I think you do owe your neighbors just to – do you have any aerosol, like some kind of Lysol spray to get rid of the odor in the, the, the doorway area? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's let's use that, and let's get some cleaner out there, and let's uh, let's clean that up because I don't want you to get in trouble – uh, for that smell. Uh, I'm afraid that might happen. Anyway. Well, it might, but whatever. But they also know what before. I do for a living, so. Oh. I'm going to let the comments run as they come in or whatever. I can't guarantee that Perry will react to them at this point. Thank you for subscribing. Ugh. Charge mine as well. Battery low. It's all right. Battery low. Oh shit. You can't stop me from posting. 
I will take everything you own and leave you homeless. Ha 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 Sister-in-law. Yeah, she's still here. Throw up my goddamn computer. I can't help who goes on the uh, screen at this point. Stream's officially over. So when are you going outside? Uh, as soon as I'm done with this dish. Hold on. I love you too. Clutch cannot. Thank you. You're awesome. Thank you. Thank you for the gifted subs. I, I feel like I feel like uh, Team Perry Caravella Live shares that award, but thank you. I, I think I think you go out there with the spray first, and then let's. You can make of... whatever you want. You don't know how you don't know how to clean like an auto detailer clean. Okay, but okay. It's not, you're not cleaning a car. You're cleaning. You're, you're trying to get the odor I'm out of the hallway. I'm cleaning when I clean. Okay. I, I know what I mean to clean up outdoors, and it's gonna be it's gonna be aerosol first, of course. Okay. So again, guys, if uh, you're tuning in later, whatever, this is all bonus content. Stream's officially over. This is just we're, we're, uh, Perry's gonna clean the uh, doorway area and get rid of that odor. Perry needs to take a polygraph about the '92 incident. The story doesn't add up. Uh, shut hashtag up. respect to him for everything he does for you. Hashtag tips for a tomb. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to use all that to uh, dinner tomorrow night with my dad. So thank you. Appreciate that. It being reminded about 1992 like it was yesterday. Fucking ignorant motherfuckers. How long until you go out there? When I get out there! Well, that's not an Fuck. answer. I'm draining, I'm, I'm throwing shit out in here. Do I like Yergi? I've never, uh... Drinks, okay? I've never had personal experience with Yergi. Five bucks for tomb. Happy birthday, Pops Brennan. Fuck Perry in his shine box. Thank you, Billy. Really appreciate that. That's very nice of you. Thank you. Sincerely, thank you. That's really nice. Can anyone with some craft skills make Perry a fedora that has LED lights on it for his streams? It would make him a legit streamer. This is for Tom. It's true. Where'd you go, right. Perry? I came over to my to my by my door. Okay. okay. Are you up? Are you outside yet? No. Let me know when you go outside, because that that rings me in. Let me grab my my garbage box. Okay, but you really outside. need to do do a nice job in the hallway, because just to be a curious neighbor. Well, bring the phone with you so you can hear me. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Don't I wish. Okay. 
It's Richard Heen. Chum, I'd love to get back into the storm chasing business. Would you consider representing me? I'd even work with parents. Boy, Richard, I don't. I Richard Heaney just wrote a thing said he wants to get back into storm chasing business, and would I represent him? Oh, hold on, let me put. What am I doing? I should put you on speaker, right? Hey, you doing this? We started storm chasing business. No, not you. Are you not you, Richard Heaney hey, wanted to get back. Well, he does contribute a lot to the channel. I'm not interested in this retarded business. This is not for me. Where did you go? I thought you were going to clean out by your doorway. This is not garbage throwing away time. I'm not the fucking dumpster. Okay, come back and do the hallway. Well, I am worried about it because your neighbors, every every person I see walk by gives your apartment a glare because of the odor and they're holding their nose. Come on back. So again, this is all bonus content. Don't blame me if it's boring. This is not my, this is not what I want out there. What are you talking about? I can't stand this bonus content. Big Fat Debbie here. Can I get it them leftovers, baby? Me and Susie can tug you and tomb off if you throw them pickles and fish over the gate. You throwing trash away is not private shit. Uh, Fat Debbie says, can she get some leftovers, baby? You want to dig through the trash? Be my guest. Like, can, can can you can you get back to your door, please, and let's just clean this area. I'm walking into my apartment. Let me scream in my fucking courtyard. Yeah, you do enough screaming. Shut your mouth. Wait until I get inside. Hey, don't hey, don't say G damn stream. I told you, don't bad mouth the channel. I'm not bad mouthing the channel. I'm just bad mouthing all the disrespect I get. Um, I don't know Chris. I, I don't know Chris Chan. Whoever wrote that in. Yeah. yeah. What, 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 does it still smell? I don't know why this keeps dying on me. Does it still smell? Yeah. Are you back in the apartment? Where are you? I, I can't keep track of you. Perry, look out. I saw a man in a wheelchair outside your place looking hungry for man meat. Looked like RC to me. Hashtag tips for tomb. Hashtag he blew me blew him. Thank you. That looks like pledge to me. That doesn't look like uh, 
That's not. Did you just spray? Did you just spray furniture cleaner? What? Did you just spray furniture? Is that pledge? What is that? It's called Lysol. Oh, it's Lysol. Okay, sorry, my mistake. Lysol, read the fucking can. Lysol okay. disinfectant. Got it. Spray. Got it. Hold on. Spray my apartment too. Got it. I, I didn't know what it was. Yeah. There's so much trash in the trash bins outside. I couldn't even dump the uh, big ass box. Could you? Could you? Did, did the did the dumpster still smell? The dump, but out, out back. I mean, out by the street. Yeah. They're so overly packed with trash. There's no way I could dump any more trash. So I have to wait till tomorrow to dump the rest of this shit. To dump the rest of this trash. Okay, what are you going to do to clean the outside? Does the outside of your apartment still smell? I spray it outdoors. But does it still smell? Huh? Does it still smell? No, no. Really? Yeah, it's, it's, it's clear. Okay. And you might want to, because I, th- I think it might have leaked on the ground. So you might want to just wipe clean that. it. I wipe that. Just give it a little spray and a wipe down on the floor outside of your apartment, just to, just to play it safe. I'm being serious, because I don't want you to get in trouble. Me doing these streams is going to get me in trouble. No, it's not. I already did. What are you talking about? Yeah, but this is something different. So just spray it down and wipe it up. Just, you don't seem like an effective cleaner to me. Shut up. Like, you're just cleaning with Lysol. That's not cleaning. That's not a cleaner. That's a... You, you need a spray. Like Windex or something. I mean, anything. You there? Yeah, I'm here. I'm just saying that's not an effective spray. Seventy-seven twenty-two Racina Boulevard is within the delivery radius of Guppy's Fishing Adventures. We deliver minnows and leeches. We will also deliver firewood. That I don't want over here ever again, you fucking assholes! What kind of cleaner do you have now? Simple green. Simple green, the can, Yeah, that's good. Give it a good dose. So, uh, spray spray your neighbor's door too, just to be nice, like by his walkway there, just just as, as a courtesy. So when he comes out the next time, he'll he'll smell something nice. I mean, the the girl that normally does this every morning with uh, my phone just said battery. The the, the phone just said battery low. So it's all right. If it's if it, if it died, yeah, okay. I don't need to spray inside. Inside doesn't stink. My side is inside. Just give him a nice rub down, you know, not, just you know, wipe down on the floor. Just, just like, just to be a nice neighbor. Auto detail his uh, uh, I know my walkway. Mind. God damn this ring. Perry, you gotta charge this ring later. What's that? It's really on uh its last leg. It just it just keeps shutting off, so just take it down later and uh, charge it up for Sunday. What the 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 ring, the, yeah. Uh, the ring? Yeah, you did, not now. Not now. What, what, you know, maybe, maybe tomorrow. Done! Then we should be off the fucking air! It's just but no. Is, you gotta have extra, extra Perry, time. Perry, there's like 500 people watching, so I thought we'd have a little bonus content while you cleaned up a little okay. bit. There's 500,000 people watching. Good. Thank you very much. Thank you to all the fans. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Subscribers and followers. I hear a piece is saying that it needs to be recharged, so I gotta go. 
Okay, you guys, I'm sorry that I have to say good night, but I have to say good night because my earpiece, including this one, says it needs to be recharged. Okay, so thank you guys for coming out. Can you do me the favor of when we're done? Can you just take the ring off whoa, the thing and whoa, charge it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Time out. When yeah. we're done, excuse me, we are done right now. Done. Ah. On November 7th, 1991, Magic Johnson announced to the world he had HIV. On November 6, 1991, Magic Johnson had unprotected anal with Perry Cavarillo. Oh, I, I don't know about Tom. I, I don't know how I'd get Tom Green on Perry's stream. I don't know if I'd want that. He seems a little crazy now. Do you know? Yeah, he's like, do, 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 do you... Really? When? How do you know Tom? How do you know Tom Green? Uh, really? Years. How? Uh, the only cabaret was when was where we you first suck met. You cleaning. I see and, why you're uh, uh, you talking over a tip. You're talking over a tip. I'm on my way over to seven thousand seven hundred twenty-two Reseda to help you clean. I'll bring wood. Terry. Your your uh, your girl Terry, Terry Bozio said you suck at cleaning. Terry is not a girl, you bitch. Terry is a drummer of the band Missing Persons. Who was also the drummer of the band Frank Zappa and the and the uh, and, oh I forget what, what Frank Zappa called this band other than Frank Zappa. But he drum drummed. He was a drummer for Frank Zappa. Drum for uh, the band Missing Persons. Drum for the band, uh, Duran Duran. Perry, you are getting free money. How can you be such a buffoon? You owe Tom so much. Hashtag respect tomb, hashtag tips for tomb, hashtag saint tomb. Thank you, MoCast. Appreciate Thank that. You. Thank you. Thank it's you. It's true. I know. I will say, I think you did a great job tonight, Perry. I really do. Thank you. It would be amazing if Perry's entire apartment floor had a two-foot-high covering of balls from a ball pit. Never gonna happen. What ball pit? There's no such thing as a ball pit in my apartment complex. Thank you, Belushi Sushi. I appreciate that. Thank you. So, uh... Yeah, that, that, uh, all my all all the tips that I, that I've earned tonight, I've kept track of, and they will go to uh, my dad's birthday dinner tomorrow. So thank you. How much to blow your neighbor, Trevor? And when he comes in your mouth, say something cool like "Community outreach is hard, but it's a living." Attention, new fans. This fat wannabe attempted to rape the Shannon Doherty lookalike, but ended up blowing a man. Welcome to Perry Caravello Live. And that'll never happen. I'm not gay. That'll never be. Garbage, 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 more garbage. You need an answer on lounge gate? Garbage. What does that mean? What? I'm, I'm just responding to somebody in the chat. What are you doing right now? Are you... I'm, I'm, I'm running my kitchen faucet so I can clean in here. Wiping up some shit that I spilled in here, okay? Are you really going to shop back tomorrow, or are you just saying that? What? Are you really going to... Hang on. How hard was your penis when you sped your mom's leg? He had struck into that Toyota Sienna van and pushed it into the bus stop. Let me run that one again, Perry, because you talked over it. Thanks for everything, Tom. Here's to help give your father a great day. Oh, that's awesome, Stu. Thank you so much. Seriously, that's really nice of you. I, I, I'm not, 
I w- wasn't expecting that. Thank you. That's really, that's really, really cool of you. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Perry's middle name is Fudge. Perry doesn't know how to clean. Perry wants fish sent to his house. Perry will die December 12, 2021. Perry kissed Don. Hash tips for Tomb. Thank you, Stinker. Thank you. Thank you. That's really nice of you. Thank you so much. I sound like Perry. I'm trying not to... <laughs> I don't want to say that. Uh, thank you. That's like something he says, like, thank you so much. But thank you very much. I appreciate that. How hard was your penis when you sped your mom's Kia truck into that Toyota Sienna van and pushed it into the bus stop? Are you are you listening to these, Perry, at all? Barely. I really don't care. I'm so busy. Okay. I, I did say it was bonus time, so I can't guarantee if he's going to acknowledge them or not. I mean, I got to say, uh, just, I mean, again, the stream has been over for a while, and you still have close to 500 people watching. For Tom and his dad, hashtag tips for Tomb. Thanks, Bill. They, Bill is one of my favorite uh, people. Thank you, Bill. Appreciate that. Does a lot for the channel. A lot of, Designs a lot of cool icons and stuff. Thank you, Bill. Really appreciate it. That's awesome. I was going to say, Perry, you know, um, oh. Perry, wow. Lots of views. Looks like things are going well. Keep it going for a few more hours and respect your fans. God a bless. few more hours? Hashtag tips for We're two. Clean up this shit tomorrow when at my house, huh? You fucking psychopath. You know who you just called the psychopath? I don't care. That tip, that, that comment was from Donald Trump. Anyway, my point was, you're close to 500 viewers. Sorry about things. that, President Trump. Sorry, okay? What, can you can, do me a favor? Come, come to the computer for a bit. Just turn your speakers up so you can at least hear it from the kitchen. We're loud enough. I can hear yeah, it. I'm going re- to replay that one, okay? I'm going to replay that one. And ju- just hang out here for a second. Happy birthday, Papa Tomb. Hashtag tips for Tomb. Thank you, Cha Cha. Appreciate that. That is really nice. Thank you. Oh, I got a headache. Hold on. Don't go anywhere. Here it is. Perry, wow. Lots of views. Looks like things are going well. Keep it going for a few more hours and respect your fans. God bless. Hashtag tips for two. Thank you, Donald. Donald Trump. It's a nice thing to say, but you know Throwing what? I'm, I'm way too cleaning exhausted. The hallway, cleaning the wave. It's way like it's exhausted. closing shift at a Waffle House, but twice as greasy. That's exactly what's happening in my life. Well, Waffle I was just House. saying Real the stream's easy. been the stream's been over. The official stream's been over for quite a while, and this is like we're in bonus area, and you still got close to 500 people watching. That's pretty incredible. Not not many streamers can say that their audience will still stay engaged when the guy is just like literally tidying up and cleaning. Perry $40 to suck a ball orange soda with shop vac and open it and throw the whole fish in hashtag tips for a tomb. Out of your fucking mind. That is fair and thank you Faster Blade. Um, $40 to suck up Forty dollars to suck up all the on, all the orange soda with the shop vac and then no open. Way. It. No fucking way! Absolutely not. Have a drink on me, too. You provide so much joy in what you do. Perry is getting better. This will pay off. We fans want it to succeed. Tips for Toom. Thank you, Dank. Um, I, I appreciate that. I agree with you. Uh, Perry is getting better. And I, this will pay off. I was not uh, sure of that when we first started. I am sure of it now because this uh, channel is, uh, like I say, it's a runaway train. It is, 
it's unbelievable the traction it's had and all, all the new people that are coming in. So thank you. And that's, that's super generous of you. Um, I, I, you know, I never, I never expected, you know, me personally to get tips from this, but thank you. I, and I will have a drink on you, uh, tomorrow. Um, and I'm glad if I, if I, if me personally outside of Perry provides joy for you and other people, uh, then it's worth it. You know, it, it makes me feel good. So, uh, thank you. Perry, you are my favorite streamer. I love your Italian who gives a fuck attitude and raw masculine sexuality. The better man won the award. Didn't hear that last line. Hashtag tips for tomb. This wouldn't be a thing without you. You're a legend. Hashtag tips for tomb. <laughs> thank you, uh, Richard. Uh, sorry. Thank you, Russell. Um, I, I greatly appreciate that. And uh, yeah, this would not be a thing uh, without me. But uh, obviously, Perry is always going to be the figurehead. And he, he's the uh, the namesake of the channel. And, you know, I'll be honest. I was a little, I told this to, uh, to Perry. I was a little worried after Tuesday. I was like, wow, maybe this has run its course. And he is just not um, going to be up for this. You know, especially three days a week. Three days a week's a lot. It's a lot on me. I feel. I mean, Perry, do you do you feel it? The three days a week thing. Like, are you into? Are you in a groove with it, or is it like kicking your butt a little bit? It's kicking my ass. Yeah, it's kicking my ass too. I, I, I'm not gonna lie, um, but it's worth it. And you know, it, it's it's if you treat it like like a job, it's you know, it's worth it. And um, you know, after Tuesday, you know, Wednesday morning, what's that? I hope it pays us right. That's all I can say. Yeah, of course. But uh, on Wednesday after his, you know, I mean, to say meltdown, I don't even know what the word would be. You know, demonic possession on Tuesday, whatever we call that. Uh, you know, phone rang. I was still in bed and I didn't answer it. And I was afraid to check the um, the voicemail because the voicemail could have gone either way. It could have been Perry saying... I am done with this bullshit. Don't you ever make me do one of these satanic streams again. Or it could have been the other way, where I am so Tom, I am so sorry for what happened last night. Please kindly forgive me. And uh, luckily for us, it was the latter. And, and I will say, Perry, you were very sincere and apologetic, and we had a long talk about it. Uh, and actually, you can hear that voicemail. I put it up on uh, Patreon. Can I, can I pause you for a moment? Yeah, I, 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 I was just about to, I was just about to plug your Patreon channel. So the, the voicemail Perry left me. Uh, <laughs> hold on, Perry, said, Perry, please, Perry. I'm just about plugging your Patreon, please. You, you, so the voicemail's on there, and then we had about an hour long phone call where we hashed things out coming into today, and you can listen to that uh, on Patreon, and also um, the video from last night where he got the award and the chair uh, will be up there uh, soon. And, uh, and uh, lots of other stuff. So consider joining that. What were you saying, Perry? I don't even remember what I said. In our, call, in our call or you, on Tuesday? Uh, Tuesday or Wednesday. I don't remember any of those calls. Well, we had a very nice conversation. Okay. On, on Wednesday, but... Uh, you know how you were on uh, on on Tuesday. It was very, <laughs> it was very bad. Yes. <coughs> yeah. The video. The, the vi by the way, the the video of Tuesday will definitely be up on the YouTube channel. I'm not, you know, I'm not deliberately like withholding it. I just, it's it's so hard because I'm kind of like a one man band with the uh, you know the editing of the streams and there's a lot that goes into it. I got to get like the ring footage for the sound. It, it is, I'm not going to bore you with details, but uh, you know. Uh, uh, I'm slowly catching up. It, it was a brutal, brutal week for me this week for a lot of reasons. And um, I, I just fell behind. Yeah, I know you, for you, Perry, but uh, just for me. So I, I, I fell behind in, in getting uh, some of the YouTube videos up. But the last Friday is up now. I'm going to try to get last Sunday's up tomorrow and then um, Tuesday. Yeah, so I, I'll get them up. 
I'll get them up. I'm, I'm not uh, withholding them. I don't know about this stuff. Like, I don't know if this is going to go on YouTube, but, you know, I'll see. I'll cross that bridge when I come to it. I don't know how interesting this is to, like, a regular... Like, this, this I feel, is, like, for diehards. I don't think, like, a regular person on YouTube is going to sit through this. But maybe I'm wrong. I'll find out. What's the food next to the mic? I don't know. I'll ask him. All right. Somebody asked what the food is next to the mic. I don't know either. I don't know either. And big thanks to uh, Faster Blade, who uh, sent me a, a PayPal uh, of twenty dollars that I will definitely use for tomorrow. Uh, you know, my dad's birthday dinner. So. Thank you, and thanks, thanks to all you guys. You guys are, you know, occasionally I see a comment that's like, like, hey, who's this Tom guy? He should shut the hell up, and I, I kind of agree. <laughs> but um, I, I really do appreciate you guys um, showing your the support. The food like next that. to the microphone is Rice Krispie Treats. That's the microwave. Microphone, microphone. on your desk. On the desk? Talking this right here? Yeah, what is Chinese that? Chinese food. Oh, yeah, we never saw that. Can we at least open that? It's, it's a fair point. We never saw it. Let's just look at it. it I forgot like... about that and all, and all the uh, chaos that ensued tonight. Uh, it's smashed. Let's just see what it is. That looks like rice. I don't know what this is. What is it? Show it. What is that? I, I, it, it's a, it's a, it's a plastic container that's oh, crushed. Oh, that looks like that looks like soup that got crushed. Yeah. Why don't you open that up? No. Okay. Good night. Hey and, Perry, and I, I'm sorry. I'm not turning off your stream when you got uh, close to 500 people. Uh, I'm, I'm just not doing it. I can't do here, it. And this dish in here is all crushed as well. So, you know what? I'm not Can even we opening just see that. It, please? God damn, motherfucker! Motherfucker! Just want to see it. Just want to see it. Rice! Fucked up soup in a fucked up bag that was wrapped up? Let's, let's take that out and let the ha sample some. Hey, didn't we talk about this kind of thing? Yes, and I don't give a fuck! Hmm. What's this? This you can show us. And there's the fish. Oh, you're, you're holding out on us. You're holding out on us. Hold on. It's Fish Friday. It's Fish Friday. Take that out. That's it. Take it out. Show it. Hold it up and show fuck it. Fuck you! No. Hey, hey, hey. That's, no, 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 that's no, no, a fish for Fish no. Friday. You're holding that's out. Fish. You're holding... Hey, that's don't... Fish. don't Take a bite. It's cooked fish. Garbage. You can take a bite. You have to take a bite. You haven't sampled in anything to this bag. Garbage. One garbage. bag. Garbage. One bite. Garbage. One bite. Garbage. One bite. Garbage. You goddamn Satan. One bite. The devil. Demon. Motherfucker. Good night. I'm out of here. We're done. Good night. All of it. Done. What are you doing? Shutting off all the fucking lights. So I don't have to see this shit anymore. Good night. Ah! Hey, we talked about this, Perry. We talked about this. I don't give a fuck. We yes. talked about this. You said you were going to behave. Say? What did I say? You said you no, were going to behave. Not. You said you said you were going to respect the stream and respect me. I said never again. Never again. You motherfuckers! Never again! Where are you? You sons find... of bitches! Never again! What do they do? Fuck with me! Fuck you! Where are you? I'm going to buy! I'm going to buy! Hey, remind me to charge that ring cam. What? 
I said a reminder to charge that ring cam when you get a chance. Might be completely dead. Where's the phone? Where did the phone go? I don't know. Yeah, it's dead. Sorry, guys. Oh, oh there he is. Where's my fucking phone? I didn't take your phone. Maybe you'd find it if you didn't turn out all the lights. A couple of weeks ago, I said I wouldn't to Perry anymore. This, however, is for Tom. Thanks for all you do for us, Tom. Love, Christy. Now I gotta turn lights back on to find my fucking phone! Perry, I like how you could just change Earth sleeping patterns, stay up later, and make money. Instead, We're you done. get up at 5 a.m. for zero Good reason. Night. Hashtag tips for Tom. Thank right, you, Belushi Sushi, and thank you, Christy. Uh, Christy, I'll say to you, uh, you shouldn't give up. Uh, you know, and, uh, you have a, you seem to have a very negative attitude towards Perry, and uh, I don't I don't know why you bother watching this if you do. But uh, he's a great guy, as you can see. Thank you, I'm a, and I'm a uh, you, you should uh, you should still guy. contribute to the stream, and uh, you know. I think this Perry was very nice to you. He sent you that charged. calendar and went out of his way to... Uh, this is getting recharged right now. Good night. Okay, great. That's fine. Um, the uh, calendar that you got from Perry, he uh, did a nice job for you, so I don't know why you'd have to be so nasty to him. But thank you for the tip. I appreciate that. I would like to get my hands on a puppy baby. How can I go about getting my hands on one? We'll pay big bucks. Hashtag half human, half dog babies. Hashtag tips for a tomb. Thank you. I don't know the answer to that, but thank you. Are you, take, are you taking the big garbage out now? Again. Yeah, the ring's dead. Ah, shit, the ring's dead. Please, the fucking garbage bin. please charge that ring. But I went sometime tomorrow. Thank you. Do you mind if I just hang out? Do you mind if I hang out for a little bit? Do what you want. Thank you. Idiot. Give a man a fish sandwich I, I, and hell yeah, eat for a day. Teach him how to blow dudes and hell eat forever. Fucking stupid. Fucking ridiculous. Yeah, again, I can't, I can't guarantee that Perry's going to respond to these. Mr. Brennan is this typical behavior of your client. He refuses to even sit down for this dream. The faster blade is easier to work with. Sorry. But I will say, does the faster blade have 500 people watching when he's essentially uh, quit and uh, is just throwing away garbage and is not even in his own apartment anymore? I don't think the answer is yes. Hashtag tips for two bones. Bones. Boner. <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate that. That's going to go to the, the drink funds. And, you know, Christy, I don't, you know, if you're irritated with Perry screaming and yelling, you are in the wrong place and on the wrong channel. And maybe you should find something else to uh, entertain you because uh, I don't think you quite get it. Uh, and yeah, he yells at fans, and that's what he does. Um, but you know, he does have moments of being appreciative. So the over, the overt negativity, uh, I don't I don't think is uh, is helpful. But you know, that's your decision. Yeah, I mean, uh, have you did you just meet Perry? By the way, like, did you just start this? This isn't how someone who just won a trophy should act. Ungrateful and unprofessional. This tip is for you, too. Thank you, Man Milk. Um, yeah, you know, I, 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 it's funny. The trophy thing came about kind of last minute because I think he needed uh, something to, you know, remind him. And it sits now on his desk that he looks at Um just to remind him of uh, the power of, of, of this channel and what he's doing, and I, you know, I really didn't like 
the way things went on Tuesday, but I think it, yeah. And look, tonight, I, I, you know, I think he was fine. I think he was fine. You know, he, he he's really uh, doing quite well. I think you know for all the amount of food he got tonight and all the deliveries. Um, yeah, I, I I think he did a a pretty phenomenal job. I mean, he's he's never gonna you know he's never gonna be nobody wants to see super happy Perry, you know the entire time. You know, I, I know people can't stand I can't stand it when he opens up. He's like, "Welcome to Subscribers Sunday." You know, he's got a big dumb grin on his face as if you know it's just gonna be, you know, <laughs> cruise control for the whole night, and then it doesn't take long. Uh, for that to change, but you know, it, it, Perry's Perry. It, that's who he is. So if I don't, I don't understand people like, oh, I don't like the way he, you know, <laughs> yells at fans. It's like what? I, I don't understand why why you're here. Yeah, you kind of are coming off as a dick, Christy. No offense, because I've seen you post elsewhere too, where you're like just bad mouthing Perry or the channel, and it's like, well, again you can tune out <laughs> you know it's like perry is perry that's why that's why there's close to 500 people watching this right now even though he's literally left the building um you know uh, that, that's what he is and that's who he is and uh he does get moments of, of appreciation you know he doesn't necessarily show it on the stream and why you know and, and if he did 24 7 if, if this was the appreciative perry stream for you know five hours uh, would you guys be hanging in for this i don't think so i wouldn't <laughs> i mean it'd be pretty boring <laughs> dustin hedberg this is my first time watching and i'm pissed yeah I, I for new fans i get it for new fans i understand why you would be pissed but yeah I came for Perry and I stayed for Tom B. Thank you. Um, yeah, so I, I'm going to wrap this up probably when he comes back in, just to say good night, because I don't know, <laughs> I don't know where we, we can really go with this. Because I, I and also I don't want to be a brutal taskmaster. He is doing three days a week, you know. I don't I don't want to be. Um, yeah, I don't I don't. I, I you know, not that he has any anywhere to be tomorrow, but. <laughs> I did want him to uh, do a good one tonight uh, to make up for Tuesday, and I think he did. And then you know, Sunday we'll do Subscriber Sunday, and then uh, Tuesday we'll try to catch up on some mailbag. I'm thinking of doing a thing for Fridays where we go on a little later because um, the 5 o'clock Pacific is kind of killing me. Uh, it, it's tough to pull off. So maybe I was thinking of doing it like, you know, six or seven Pacific on a Friday. Do you like that idea, Perry, starting later on a Friday? Whatever. Yeah, he's he's on board. So if you guys are cool with that, may, we're going to – I'm not saying right away. I'm not saying anytime soon. I'm just saying eventually, like maybe have – yeah, of course, Alice <laughs> – Alice the cat's gonna say way later because he's a West Coast dude, <laughs> uh, but um, I figure because most people have off the next day, maybe it's okay to go a little later on Friday. Um, so I, all West Coast people are gonna say later. I know that, but um, sure, maybe just on Fridays we we start later. Uh, I'm gonna talk because I want to get a locked in schedule. I think five. On Tuesday, Sunday really works out well, even though I do still want to do an international um, subscriber Sunday uh, eventually. I don't know when that's going to be and do it a noon one. Hey, Perry, you want to hang out? A lot of, lot of people are saying how great you were tonight, just like giving you a round of applause. I know it was tough. Well, thank you. That's nice. And you still got close to 500 people on here, even though like literally you left the room. By one person. One person. We missed off 600 people. No. No, we don't play those games here. No, no, no. That that wasn't it. One person. It was five ninety nine. What do you mean? What are you or talking was it four ninety nine? Uh, what are you talking about? The the the, the, the count. No, no, it's not one person. It, it's it's you have legitimately, you know, look, you're gonna get to seven hundred probably on Sunday. You you were knocking at that door tonight. I'm just saying it, it's cool. And, and when you go to when you when you're ready to go to bed, I'll I'll turn this off. I I, I don't want to keep you up. 
But there are people just hanging out saying thank you. Yeah, you're talking about the subscribers, I think, Perry, not not the amount of viewers. But that was awesome, too. We got to 600 subscribers tonight. It's beautiful. 637 subs at the moment. It's insane. Yeah, we're right on the cusp of 700 views. And I think once we get that, you know, we're going to we're going to get over we're going to get close we're going to get 1000 live views soon enough. I'd say sooner rather than later and then yes. once we get there it's going to be off to the rate. It's going to it's going to get really crowded. It's going to get kind of insane. I kind of do. Somebody somebody said, did I understand his rating system at all? I kind of do get it because what he's doing is he's giving a rating because he did this with movies. And Perry, is it okay if I explain your rating system? Uh. Yeah, because it's, it's, it's unique. So basically what he's doing is when he's, he's giving a rating of 1 through 10, a number rating. And then at the same time, He's also giving a star rating of one uh, of one star through five stars. So if he says this is a 10 five star, it means it's at a one out of 10, 10 being the best, it's a 10. And out of one star to five stars being the best, it's five stars. So not only is it a 10, it's also a five star. So and when he says this is in an eight, four star, it's still very good. It's an eight out of 10 and four out of five stars. So he's basically combining the star system with the number system. And if you think about it that way, it kind of makes sense. Um, but then he waffles, you know, and says, it's either a six or a seven, three star, and that, that does confuse me. Um, so, yeah, that, that, but that's, that's the rating system. And, and, I, and I like it. I like it. And I kind of want to try that Popeye's sandwich now because it looked really good. <laughs> yeah, I'm a ten. I'm a ten five star. Yeah, I'm gonna try. Like, I gotta go out there. In I haven't figured out the dates yet. It's either gonna be late May or June you have when to come he shoots out this thing for Adult huh? Swim. What's that? You have to come out here in just a few weeks, huh? Not a few weeks, no. But it'll be sometime late May or early June. When uh, we do the adult swim shoot and I'm going to try to install some things like get some some good lighting in there. He, he got a good lighting rig yesterday. You kind of see it in the background there. It's almost too big, though. Yeah, it's like really it's like a professional. Thing, I'm going to try to do some things. Yeah, like this. It's, 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 it's ridiculous. Can you turn can you turn it on and show people just how bright it is? Like it really that lights up the entire apartment. It's it's ridiculous. Try turning it on. Hang on. Plug in the kitchen wall right here. I'd love to do some road things with Perry. Like when you know when things get going again. Like there there's a legitimately like there's a Twitch convention I'd like to go to with Perry. I'd like to do CES with Perry. Yeah, look how bright that is. It's tough when it's pointing right at the camera. Pointing away from the camera. Just, yeah, There's it's like super bright. Ceiling. I yeah, don't have wasps like in my bright. apartment. What the fuck is that about? What? What are you? What's that? I got a wasp on my ceiling. Oh, no. First time ever. Yeah, you see? Yeah, okay, you can turn it off now. That's good. But yeah, like, um, like stuff like CES or uh, whatever. Um, would be great, you know, just like like road things, you know. Again, when things open back up and you know everything's cool again, I'd like to do that because you know, it, as much as this set is great, you know, Perry's apartment, you know, this you want to see him, you know, out and about. If you know anyone from Twitch, can you tell them that Dark Side Phil Doxpo dubs? What? Can you say that? Dark side Phil docks to Poe dubs if you know anyone from Twitch. I don't know what that means. Neither do I. Love when Perry starts a stream overly happy because then on YouTube you click to later on in the video and has literally a different human. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's that's a that's a fair point. <laughs> yeah. Oh 
Um. Perry Paul of Houndstone here. Quit stealing my act. The lesbian look is mine. Hey! You don't have an act! Not a nice word, Perry. I like fighting with Perry. He is a guy that deserves to lose because of what he is. Still, I root for him to be a better person. Someday. Probably no. Honestly, I think he, he is uh, um, become a better person. And I think he's a person worth, worth rooting for. And that's why when, when people come in, it's like, oh, I really, you know, like there's, like, there's people, like, whether it's like on, you know, on, on Facebook somewhere, like in, in a group or anywhere. And like, oh, I, like, like the people that legitimately hate, and there's people that like hate Perry. Like there's people that hate you, Perry. Like 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 viciously hate you. Right. And like hate, we don't want those jealous. people here. Like that that doesn't that doesn't work. They hate me because they're jealous. Maybe. And they 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 just don't get it. They don't get the they don't get the appeal of you. Are you going back out to throw that away? I'm not gonna throw this away. I'm gonna give it to Trevor. Yeah. For you, my brother. Oh, I didn't accept that. Sorry. I, you got uh, to. <laughs> it's a cake, and I have no room. I hear you. All right? I'm no, sorry. No worries. There's no fish. No, I, no God. I would, I would never do that to you. Yes, if there's a cake inside there. I only had one little scoop. All right. Roger that, man. I appreciate it. Very welcome. I hope you had a good scream. <laughs> you, you're hearing all the screaming in my apartment. Of so. course. Yeah, I'm not in your, uh, what's this? Your, uh... Not and I'm, and I'm the business partner. Oh, from Tom? Is yeah. there any Tom over the, to the wall right now? No, no, I, I just tuned in once in a while. To okay. See, like, what's You're not listening to the wall? I hear it through the wall. Okay. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, brother, man. Have a good night. You too, brother. Yeah. Another 20 for Tom and family for a day party. Oh. Enjoy. Stu, thank you. That's super generous of you. Uh, that's... I can't believe you guys. That's awesome. Thank you. I, I, I'm a little... Uh, I'm speechless. Thank you. That's really nice. When are you getting off my computer? In a minute. There's something that came... There's a couple of nice things that came in for you. Like? Where do Don and Mole fall on the love to genuine hate scale for Perry? That's not a question for me to answer. Um, Dad's got to get outside. So I don't know. Perry, hang on. This is for you. Perry, you were really great tonight, buddy. Keep your chin up. You are the only thing I watch on Twitch. I had to look up how to donate. Hashtag tip for a P. That's nice. Thank you. Here's a rating for you, jerky. Two and a half. The same size of your dick, you stealing piece of shit. What? Stealing piece of shit. Two and a half? The Faster Blade Live on Twitch today is $50 Friday while my fans are sending $50 bills. Love the new rating system, Perry. What will you rate my stream? That's a fair question, Faster Blade. Can you, uh, Perry, can, with your rating system, can you rate Faster Blade stream? No. What would you give it? I said no. Oh, no, I thought you said two. New fan here. Why do you yell at fans? Fuck this, I'm done fandom over. Dustin Hedberg, a new fan, wants to know why you yell at fans. I'm going out. Sorry. Tum, you are doing an awesome job, man. Anyone who hates Perry is a dumbass. BTW does he get many complaints from his landlord slash other neighbors? Thank you for the comment and the and the tip. Um, 
Yeah, he got he got like a little talking to last week. Although, like his apartment manager is a very nice woman, and I've spoken to her before. There was one time I think it was on the podcast where like he was in her office like screaming and yelling at me because I didn't pay his phone bill, and she was a little freaked out then, and she was new then, um, but. I forget her name, but she, she's super. She knows who he is. She knows about the stream. She everybody everybody in his complex knows who he is, and, and knows he has some kind of notoriety. And there was a thing, I think, last week where she she showed him a clip. She basically and it, she didn't like come to him. He she, she just he just happened to be passing by the office, and she's like, "Hey, can I just show you something?" And she had a clip from like YouTube of him screaming in the hallway. And he's like, "Hey, can you just like." You know, I get that you do a stream and everything, but can you just not like scream at the top of your lungs in the hallway after uh, you know eleven o'clock at night? And it was just like that. It was not like a big thing. Right. She was she was kind of laughing at it. You know, Perry, right? What are you talking about? When you're uh, when you're apart when the you, you, the apartment was it Denise the apartment manager? Yeah, what about her? When, when she was like just kind of laughing at what you were doing on the stream and like la- you know yelling, she just kind of said to keep it down in the hallway. Yeah. Yeah, so, and it was it was totally fine. So that's so like something like that, but not you know nothing like hey we you know you, we don't like this. Yeah, you know, she, she's she's totally cool. The guy that used to be the manager, that guy Tommy, he, he was kind of a dick. She's cool. Tom, Tom was also nice. He was nice to you, but he wasn't. He he wasn't nice to the the stuff that would go on. Like she, he didn't oh, get he didn't, it. He didn't get it. Going on with me. He liked me as a person. Uh, when he went back to Chicago to a anniversary of his uh, father being a, a Chicago Cub, or grandfather being a Chicago Cub, uh, he bought me a uh, he brought me back a T-shirt. From the event. No, I'm, I'm not. I'm not saying he was like a, a bad guy to you. I'm just saying, like, I know when we had to do stuff in your apartment or you know little things like that. Like the stream and, and the bullshit that happened. Well, you here. weren't doing. You weren't streaming back then. I'm just saying there was a couple of times where I dealt with him and he was kind of he was kind of a hard ass. I'm Yeah, but anyway, um, Denise is super cool, and I'll tell you how cool she is because this is like, God, this is like last September. And yeah, Perry, for whatever reason, Perry's phone got turned off, and I think it was because I had changed uh, credit cards. And you know, like when you get a new credit card, you have to like update all of your automatic payments, uh, things that get you know come off. And one of the things was his uh, phone bill, and uh, I, I just forgot to update my my new card. So something happened, and. Um, yeah, his, his phone got like disconnected for lack of payment, and he, Perry, went to D- Denise's uh, office, the manager's office, and you know just, I think left me a voicemail. Just was like unleashing on me, and she was a little freaked out by it. So her voice was on the thing, and I called her to um, get her permission to use that on a podcast, and she was super cool about it. And she was like, "Yeah, of course," and. Uh, so, we, and I've talked to her a couple of times, and uh, she's uh, she knows what Perry does. She knows who he is, so she, she's really cool. So, and, and that's why the one thing I will say is like people that leave like bad reviews um, about like the apartment complex is is never a good thing because like I think she came to him like a year ago saying, "Oh, why are all these bad Yelp reviews?" You know about like, like you saying stuff about you know your apartment and stuff. And that kind of stuff kind of harms things a little bit. Yeah, I mean, I think a lot of them are old, but that never um, that that that's never a good thing because it, that that that's the kind of stuff that not to get, that can get him in trouble, but you know can just shine a light on him that's not necessary. So I, I would cool it with the uh, you know, Bullshit. like if you Google Villa La Paloma, you know, you'll, you'll see what I mean. Is that by the way, that, that trash can looks like it's working out really well. This this trash can is awesome. Whoever got it for me, thank you beyond belief. This can, I love it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah. yeah and an I awesome thank you too. Can. And I think everybody thanks you. 
Here is a question for you. Uh, what do you do all day when you're not streaming? Uh, watch TV. I don't know. It it so it varies. It varies. Watch TV. Listen to listen to some of my old rock bands. Sometimes I go for a bike ride. Uh, it, it it varies. Yeah, I, I like to go for bike rides. Yeah. Or skateboard, but since the skate parks are closed. Enough with the skateboarding, for fuck's sake, dude. No, I'm not. I love my skill. Yeah, my I know sport. you do, but we gotta. You gotta get you in shape, and that's not gonna do it. That's gonna definitely get me in shape. Keep skateboarding. I when your moderators ask, what do you think of the first season of The Big Bang Theory? The first season. Hilarious as you cannot believe. That's one of the honestly, that's one of the worst shows to ever be shat out on television. It's it's one of the most garbage shows to ever. Uh, I, I mean, look, I know people like it, but that, it's really such trash. I, I'm really embarrassed Pen- that, that you like it. Penny is funny. Sheldon no, no, is nothing's hilarious. funny on that show. Nothing's funny on that show. It's 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 one of the worst things. It, it's one of the worst things that's ever come out. I mean, all those CBS comedies. Every, any any comedy on CBS in the past, Jesus Christ, maybe 30 years. I can't remember uh, the last one. I, I, in fact, somebody named me the last CBS sitcom that was any good. You know, and, I, and I'm going back. Fuck. Like, like all the family, Jefferson's, I remember, uh, you know, CBS. But pa- past that. Name me out. Name me anything on CBS. That's I really even the dramas suck. It's just like a. It's like a. It's like a network for uh, uh, the elderly. Yeah, Taxi, WKRP, Modern Family is fucking garbage too. Don't say Modern Family to me. That's ABC, by the way. Fucking hate Modern. Modern Family is like Arrested Development for dumb people. Yeah, it's always sunny. Is good. Big Bang is such trash. How I Met Your Mother is garbage. Everybody loves Raymond. Garbage. King of Queens. Garbage. Do you want to know something funny? I, I, I I'll end with this because somebody just mentioned Married with Children. Um, and I, I, I'm giving a little punchline. Don't punch ever to downgrade thing. Married with Children. No, but listen to this. This, this is actually a very funny story. It, it it relates to that, and I I don't know I I was it was uh I, I was watching an interview with uh, J J Walker, Jimmy Walker sorry Jimmy Walker who Jimmy played J Walker, J Walker. J J Walker. Uh, J J who is J what was, I think it was J J Evans on Good Times right, and uh, it was a great interview, and he was talking about the writers on Good Times, and how um, a lot of the. Um, the writers were like these old Jewish guys and they were writing for like a, a, a black sitcom and they were uh, Norman Lear who was the, the showrunner was like hiring out people to you know, hiring out like he wanted like black writers and there was there was a guy um, he was a college they, they put out this college thing uh, I'm completely um, paraphrasing this but anyways they sent out this thing to like college students to maybe pitch ideas for, for a, a script And uh, this guy, what was the name of the college? I forget. It it, it was like Howard University, I think it was, sent in a script to Norman Lear for good times. And normally when like somebody gets like a – and I've done writing for TV. And normally when you get a a script, you know, uh, pitched to to like an established show – uh, it'll go through different hands. Like they'll rewrite it, and they'll you know they'll give you some credit, and everything, but they'll rewrite it and they'll chop it up. But this one, this guy that this college student sent in, it was it aired as is. It was exactly as it is, and it, it, they they loved him, and they actually hired him on as a staff writer. And um, the guy went on to like pitch shows for networks, and he pitched this show that every network turned down. This is like the now in like the early mid eighties, pre Cosby, but it was like uh, he pitched this uh, this like black sitcom, and every network executive, like some CBS head of CBS, like looked at it like, wow, this is really great, but it's crazy. We can't air it. It's too crazy. It, it's it's yeah, you know, we'd get arrested if we aired this. Turned down by NBC. Turned down by uh, ABC. 
and those, those were the three networks at the time. There, there was no, uh, there's no Fox. And then like the Cosby show came on and all this like, and basically his point was all of these um, black sitcoms that come on, they're all like these milk toast, like everything's wonderful sitcoms. This one was like very acerbic and like crazy. And then along comes Fox, the Fox network starts in like 87 and they'll put any garbage on. Like they're, they're, I mean, aside from like the Simpsons and Tracy Ullman, most of their early shows were just trash TV. And Fox looked at it, looked at this guy's script for this, this, show that he wrote that conceived of that's been turned down for the past like five years or so and they say hey we like it we're gonna we know we'll do it but you know there's one one concession we don't want to we can't have this be a black show because we'll we'll come off as racist you know because th- these people are terrible this family's awful they're awful people um could you make them white and the guy uh, begrudgingly said yeah, because he knew this was this was the last stop. There's no other networks. It's Fox or it's it. And that show became Married with Children, uh, which was originally a black show. And if you ever see like the pilot or the first batch of episodes, you can kind of see it. I just thought that was that was fascinating. Um, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm very tough on. I I, I don't remember. The uh, the last comedy, the last sitcom show I ever watched. That was uh, I, I I like now I don't I don't watch any I don't I don't watch any. Can we hang up, uh, please. What's that? Can we hang up so I can jump in the shower? Yeah. Can you say? Can you say? Can we? Can we do a proper send off? Can you turn that light back on so we can do a proper send off? Yeah. TV talk with Tom B. Hey, can I ask you a question, Perry? Mm, I'm half dead. I know. Go ahead. <laughs> Turn on the light so I can see you. What's your favorite? What's your favorite spinoff? Favorite spinoff? Oh, sit down. Where are you going? I'm going to get my hat. Oh, okay. <laughs> he's going to see. He's, oh. he's back in show mode already. You might get another hour out of this. Fuck you. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I, I do want to know this. Uh, I do want to know the answer to this. Frazier's a good answer. Um, yeah, I, I didn't like Rhoda. I thought Rhoda was much better on Mary, Mary Tyler Moore. There's some spinoffs that are detrimental to their parent show, and I thought that was one of them. Don't like it. Uh, I, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't like it. Young Sheldon. If he says Young Sheldon, I'll, I'll murder him. Joey. I do have a fascination with horrible spinoffs, like spinoffs that like no one's ever heard of that like, you know, like, like Gloria was this. Sp- I think All in the Family has the record for the most amount of spinoffs and one of them was Gloria, which is, is horrible. I remember the Ropers. And it's another terror. That was another terrible thing that like. Hit, yeah, the Ropers the didn't show. work. Well, the yeah, Ropers didn't uh, work because uh, the Ropers were so good on me. Three's Company and as good as Don Knotts was. He just wasn't Mr. Roper. I, I can't watch those Don Knotts episodes. Yeah, after after uh, after Don Knotts passed away. Uh, well, Don Three's Knotts didn't Company. pass away when he was doing Three's Company. Didn't he pass during Three's Company? No, he passed in like two thousand. He, he like within the past oh. like ten fifteen years. Didn't Better who, who took his answer. place? I'm, I'm, I mean, spin off like comedy, but. Here's the thing with with the Ropers and the guy, and I'll I'll get to your answer in a second. Is like Norman Fell, who played Mr. Roper, legitimately, lo- and he's he was a journeyman uh, character actor. He's in loads. If you go back to like the '60s, he's in every episode of every show. Is like you know a, a criminal or something like that, and he he loved being on on. Um, Three's company, and when the producers came to him to spin his character off, he didn't want to do it because he saw the writing on all. He's like, no, it's not going to work. Mr. Roper only works in the context of this show. He didn't want to do it. He fought against it. And he had in his contract, uh, if this doesn't work, meaning the Ropers, contractually, you have to bring me back on Three's Company. Now, unfortunately, um, it didn't work. And they didn't honor his contract because the replacement they got for him was fucking Don Knotts, who is the, you know, the best uh, side guy you could, ever, you could ever ask for. 
and Don Knotts killed it. You know, it, now me personally, I love Don Knotts on Andy Griffith's show. And I, yeah. I do think Mr. Furley is a great character, but they were between, you know, the ratings went up with Mr. Furley and they had to pay uh, Norman uh. fell off. Uh, because they couldn't honor the contract for him to come back. But anyway, that's not, I'm going off on a spinoff tangent. But um, right. he, uh, your favorite spinoff, sitcom spinoff? Mine? Yeah. I got a couple. I got a couple up my sleeve, but I want to hear yours. A spinoff, like a show where wow. a character breaches off to, branches off into her own show. Um... I'm brain dead. Why? I don't know. Well, there's a couple. There's like um, Mark and Mindy is technically a spinoff of uh, Happy yes. Days. That That's actually an, uh, yeah, exactly. Mark and Mindy I love, but I wasn't thinking about the spinoff from Happy Days turning into Mark and Mindy. And here's, here's, a, here's a different question. This is more for the chat. Name me a spinoff that was better, superior to its parent show. Like the spinoff's better. The spinoff has a longer run. It is better. Mork and Mindy. No. No. Spin up. Mork and Mindy's garbage, and it's not better than Happy Days. And I'm not even that big of a I fan have to of. Say Happy Mork Days. and Mindy was garbage because Robin Williams was one of the best, if not the best, comedian that ever lived. I don't know if Simpsons counts as a spinoff, but maybe it does. And if that's if it does count, then you're right. Curb your enthusiasm. Not, is not a spinoff. I'm gonna. I'll, I'll give you one. I'm gonna say. I'm going to say Benson is a better show than its parent show, which is Soap. The character Robert Guillaume played on Soap, Benson, was like a butler house servant. And then he had his own yeah, show, Benson. Yeah, I, I, could, I, could, I could agree with that. I and could I think Benson that. was the better show. I could agree with that. I don't but think Fra- Frazier – there's Billy no way Crystal, Frazier is better than Cheers. No way in hell. Billy Crystal was extremely funny on Soap. He was. Yeah. Yeah. He was, but Soap is very – I don't know. It, I've not seen every episode. I, what I've seen is Soap. It's very 70s. It's very of its time. Um, right. What, Family Matters was spun off from Perfect Strangers, right? I think Perfect Strangers is a better show. All those AB show, a, ABC Friday night 80s shows kind of suck. Right. Yeah, that's someone. Urkel. Urkel. Fucking idiot! What what is what is your, what are your top three sitcoms of all time? Mine? Yeah. Wow. Uh, I liked Starsky and Hutch. Sitcoms, sitcoms, comedies. Oh, comedies. Um, Good Times, Three's Company. I mean, I mean, um, am I right? Three's Company. With yeah, uh, a, John Ritter, yeah, it's a, it's a okay. Home improvement, garbage, uh, and and um, all in the family. Yeah, okay, those are good. My apartment stinks. Let me spray it. God, can I spray it? Yeah, Jefferson's is good. Jefferson's was amazing. Yes, Taxi Odd Couple Honeymooners. Hard to argue yeah, with those three. I mean, really, you're talking show. like upper echelon of. Uh, uh, in fact, I think those all three were on. Like when I was growing, uh, like when I was growing up, like, God, it was like Taxi was on Channel Nine at like eleven, and it, it Taxi, went up it against the ABC odd couple. Show. And I remember I would watch one or the other based on how many times I've seen that episode, and then eleven thirty was always the Honeymooners, and I would always, and I, God, that was. Probably why I'm not president is because I uh, just stayed up too late watching that. Yeah, I, you know, MASH, I, I know people love MASH. I could MASH never get into good. it. I just never liked MASH. And it was weird. It's like there's two versions of that. Like, uh, I know when MASH aired internationally, it aired without the um, – the laugh track and if you get the dvd sets uh there's an option i remember uh, for whatever reason i had one of the dvds once years ago 
and I he's like somebody said, oh, you should watch this episode because like there was an actor in it that I liked. I forget what it was, and there was an option to turn off the laugh track, which I found fascinating. And the show played much better without the laugh track because I hate. That's why I hate. I hate British comedies because um, most of them because. I don't understand when like two people are outdoors somewhere and there's a laugh track coming from nowhere. And that's kind of what I felt like with MASH. Like, where are these people seated? Like, where, where's the laughing coming from? It's just, I, I, never, I, I can never get into the laugh track on that show. Other shows, it, it made sense. Because well, it was of the era. And a lot of shows, like, the laugh track is real. It's the real audience laughing. And I don't mind that. But then there's other ones that have just canned, uh, like, canned laughter which is horrible never get into yeah just yeah Monty Python I find annoying too never got into Monty Python I mean I don't like hate it and I don't judge people who love it I just it just was never it was just never my thing I never got it my favorite Monty Python film was Monty Python and the Holy Grail yeah that, I, I know that, that has its one of the that has its Monty following. Python movies I ever saw yeah, Monty Python I, I like and the Holy Grail Sam. was so hilarious. Yeah, I, you know what it is? I just never... And, and, and not only did I not like Monty Python, I never liked any of those guys. I never liked John Cleese in anything. Hated him when he was in the Bond movies. Hate, like, he was only in, like, two Brosnan movies. Couldn't stand him. Uh, Fish Called Wanda, I think, is the closest thing to Monty Python related that I liked. But I think it's overrated. But, yeah, I just... Man, I don't... Fuck, I... I I just never got Faulty Towers. Never got. Never got Life of Brian. I like Time Bandits, even though that's not technically uh, a comedy, but that's a lot of Monty, Monty Python people uh, in that. But yeah, never, uh, never got into it. But anyway, we can do TV we talk. Go to sleep <laughs> to the end of time. Best Bond movie. That's a good question. I'm going to answer that. For me, the best Bond movie Beauty is Casino Kill. Royale. Casino Royale with uh, Daniel Craig has everything. A, a View to a Kill or Diamonds Are Forever? Those are the two worst. A View to a Kill because of uh, Tom oh, Sims dude, being... By the way, I'm not, I haven't run tips. Steer. I got a, a couple of comments came in. I got to run these. Um, I like... I like... I'm just going to... I like um, I like Casino Royale. I like License to Kill. I like Timothy Dalton is a uh, very underrated Bond. I like... Uh, from Russia with Love and I, I, Roger Moore is uh, my favorite because I grew up with him and uh, of the Roger Moores I'm going to say uh, For Your Eyes Only Dr. No is another uh, awesome Bond film yeah I'm not going to argue with that hang on Perry I got. I, I forgot I had tip comments on pores I got to just go through these Good night. hold on Tim you get upset about snorting and air touching but never the greasy lounger hashtag burn the lounger hashtag lounger gate hashtag tips for a tomb <laughs> thank you uh they're bad mouthing your lounging chair. They're bad mouthing Bob's chair. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> All right, let's just wrap this up. We're almost done. We're done. It's 11 p.m. We should have ended it an hour ago. Perry, you should talk about DMT elk hunting and CBD oil. I don't want to hear you yell. I want a long form conversation. Hashtag Death Squad rules. Thank you Thank for subscribing. Thank you for subscribing, but I'm not on the show. I'm off. Perry, you were great tonight. Amazing job not peeing and being Thank open you. to things. Keep this attitude up, and I guarantee y'all be the number one by streamer. That's awesome. Already the number one Twitch streamer. Hey, you know what? That's a good point. I didn't even think of that. You didn't go up. You got up a lot, but you didn't go to the bathroom once. Once you snuck one. I went inside my shorts. Wait, you, you were using the diaper? Yeah. You peed in the diaper? Yeah. Re for real? I think so. You were wearing the diaper? Uh, yeah, I've got the diaper on. Wow. Diaper on. Well, you could have announced that. That's a big deal. Well, I, I didn't think about it. So it wasn't that bad, right? So we can use these going forward. Of course. So we'll do one on Sunday. Yes. That is a huge revelation this late in the bonus stream. I'm really proud of you. That's great. I don't like to make the announcement. Oh, I'm going to oh, taking a piss. Oh, so, it feels great. So here, here's, here's the drinking game for people 
that are going to watch the replay on YouTube, find the spots, find the screenshots where Perry is going uh, number one. How many times did you go tonight? I didn't. No, I, I mean, didn't no, you, didn't, you didn't go to the actual bathroom, but how many times do you think you, you tinkled in the diaper? I didn't. At all? At all. You had to have. You had to have. There's no way because you didn't go to the bathroom. You didn't get up to go once. Surprise, surprise. No, you're right. I didn't. I, I barely drank any water, too, because, yeah, the, 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 the water but is you are, right there. But, but, Perry, you are wearing the diaper. You want me to take my shorts down and show you? Well, not, not if you're not wearing anything. Oh, boy. This could, this could be the stream killer right here. Diaper. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I knew it. 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 Okay. Good. Good, good, good. No, no. You don't have to take it all the way off. Good. Good enough. So he was wearing the diaper. Diaper is for the streams only. Yeah, right. You're not going to pee in diaper. We're not going to make a habit of you peeing I don't need to wear the diaper for anything other than the streams Just now. the streams. You know what? That shows commitment. That shows commitment. That's why the diapers were bought for me. Paula Poundstone here. Perry, please stop talking about skateboarding. It's the lamest thing ever. Now watch me do a kickflip off your fat ass. Uh, let me fuck you in the ass first. I have to do a real for Perry woman. to come back as Ted from How I Met Your Mother talking to Christina about how he choked her mom. No longer. What? I had a deal in the works for Perry to come back as Ted from How I Met Your Mother. I don't know that reference. Talking to Christina about how he choked. Oh, I get it. How you, about, about you choking your mother. Look, I was sick back then. I was on the wrong medication at the time. Uh, and it was a mistake. Yeah, I know. I know. Hey, who's your favorite? Who's your favorite James Bond? Favorite James Bond actor? Um, uh, Sean Connery. Okay. Hard to argue that. Sean Connery, the first, Roger Moore, the second. Yeah. I, I got to go Roger Moore first because that's who I grew up with, but. Right. Uh, and by the way, I get really mad at people that badmouth Roger Moore the same way I get mad who badmouth Harry. I, I love Harry. Roger Moore and Sean Connery both in the same cat. I think they're both like number one to me. I think every other Bond after, uh, Roger Moore sucked okay ban this guy who says roger moore was garbage uh moore is not garbage uh but the era i, I think it's i think he, 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 he there's some clunkers there because i think the roger was moore bad. was uh a view to a kill so roger moore rocks a view to a kill is not a good movie a view to a kill is not terrible it's not terrible but it is a good movie i'll say this and the snow, and the snow skiing and the snowboarding where Tom Sims uh, went from skiing to snowboard. Oh, do not turn this That's into a Tom Sims conversation. That's the introduction to snowboards. Brosnan's that not better than Moore. That was the introduction movie to the snowboard. Brosnan's not better than Moore. Timothy Dalton, I'd say, is technically, technically on paper the best Bond because he's the closest to the books. Um, and I think it's criminal that he only got two films. And both of them are fantastic. But he's he, he's he's the he, he's the best, uh, as far as like capturing the, the bond of the Ian Fleming novels. Um, Brosnan, I'll tell you why Brosnan's not greater than Moore. Brosnan didn't have any good. Brosnan had name me a great Brosnan Bond movie. It doesn't exist. All of his, you know, every Bond that's played the character from Connery, Moore, uh, even Lazenby, uh, Dalton, and, and Craig, what of course, they Daniel all had Craig? one definitive. James Bond movie. Brosnan doesn't. The closest he has right. is Goldeneye. And Goldeneye isn't even that good. It doesn't hold up, really. I saw it recently, actually. It's, it's not okay. I'm glad I bought all three uh, box sets on DVD, but now now that I have uh, 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 Roku, I can see all the movies yeah, that I want. Yeah, you can see them anytime you want. And the thing about Daniel Craig is, as great as... Uh, as great as um, Casino Royale is, he never followed it up with a great uh, movie. Quantum of Solace is trash. I don't even remember seeing it. I saw it once. I barely remember it. And then 
the third one, Skyfall is okay. It's over the top. And they all of a sudden make Bond like this weathered Bond that's been in, in the field for years. Yeah, that, that, and like, well, that's hang on a second. Disturbing. He's supposed to be a rookie in, in, in Casino Royale. I feel like we missed like five movies in between. And then they fall into this like um, – co- like, Bond yeah, movies were never disturbing. known for their continuity. And, that was uh, disturbing. In fact, they were terrible at continuity. Like they never acknowledged previous missions, and uh, you know, the, the, char- the side characters are often played by different act- actors, and they were all over the Guys. place continuity-wise. And then all of a sudden, in the, in the Craig era, they're trying to be like the Marvel uh, movies, where they all connect to each other, and I think that's bullshit. The way Skyfall tried to link them all together, it's nonsense. It's and then the last one, Spectre, was just good night, ass, everybody. Atrocious. I want to go to. I want to get in the shower and go to sleep. All right. We can wrap on Bond. We can wrap on Bond. We'll pick this up another time. Good night. We'll pick this up on another occasion. (laughs) Good night, all. Still got three. Still rocking with three hundred and fifty viewers. Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah. No bullshit. There's more than four hundred on here. Three fifty. No, it's it's three fifty combined. I mean, it's behind. I mean, it's it's behind. All right. It's Unless crazy. you want to just go to bed and we'll just hang out and play comments while you uh, sleep. Lights off. All right, guys. Stop thanks for coming off. out. We'll see you Sunday. I don't. See you, uh, are you going to really shop Sunday. back tomorrow, Perry? Or is that you just saying that? Perry, Paula a- Poundstone here. The only one getting fucked in the ass is you by me. Paula is going to pound stone. In your dreams, you little fuck. I don't fuck. I don't. I don't get fucked in the ass. I'll fuck you in the ass. You fucking cunt. Uh, Good night. You know we were having a nice, friendly Perry. We were having a nice, friendly talk about sitcoms and spinoffs and James Bond. And you got to get vulgar right, like that. Volume to end off. It. Good night. It's not a good way. Oh, favorite Bond song. Favorite Bond song. Real quick. Favorite Bond song. That's a good question. Is it "View to a Kill"? Duran Duran. I am going to go with. Huh, that's a tough one. I know. I, I I like I like the Carly Simon. Nobody does it better for "Spy You Love Me." It's just it's the perfect Bond song uh, from that for that stage uh, in, in Bond. It's it just it, it's the perfect opening. Um, I I really I I, 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 there's very few I dislike. I hate the Madonna one for I, 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 I hate, uh, there's a couple of, I just really despise late living daylights is great. Um, gold figures, of course, great living let die is great. Yeah. I mean, there, there's so many that are great. Um, I've been in a real bond kick lately. Uh, anyway. All right, Perry, go to sleep, take a shower. Uh, we'll do a Bond podcast some other time. Uh, guys, thanks for coming out. We'll do Moonraker. I love Moonraker, too. Uh, Moonraker's unfairly maligned because I think Moonraker is a legit good movie. Up until the last 20 minutes when he goes into space, it's a pretty good spy uh, detective story. Uh, and then it gets a little ridiculous at the end, but I even like that. I, I flat out love Moonraker, and I don't understand people that who are Bond fans that shit on it. Um <laughs> Somebody said Perry was the spy who blew me. <laughs> All right, good night, guys. I'm going to end for real. We'll see you Sunday. I, I don't know what's going to happen to this portion of... Uh, I might put this on Patreon. I don't know what to do with these extra portions. because I'm not going to put them on YouTube, but maybe I'll put them on nothing. But yeah, thank you. Everybody that uh, donated, I, I am taking my dad out and my mom out. Um... Uh, for safe. dinner tomorrow night and uh, I am definitely going to use those stream donos so thanks guys um, we'll see you Sunday and I'm glad we had a nice rebound Perry good night I'm glad we had a good rebound I'm not going to argue with anybody who says Moonraker is the best Bond I think it's fucking fantastic and one thing I'll say about Moonraker and I'll make this the last thing I say um, all these special effects that you see in Moonraker were done in-house by Bond produ- uh, production people because ILM, 
who normally does effects for all those movies, they couldn't, uh, they couldn't do it in time. So they figured out all those space shuttle scenes and all the space scenes, if you watch Moonraker, that was all done by um, like literally like the, uh, the effects people that just worked on Bond movies. And they built all those models and stuff. So if you look at it now, uh, especially you watch it on like a big screen in high definition, it really holds up. And uh, so I, I think that's the stuff that really uh, impresses me that they did it all themselves because ILM couldn't do it. Anyway, <sighs> more useless knowledge from Tom B. Another night. Thanks, guys. We'll see you on uh, Sunday. Best Bond movie for a noob is Casino Royale. Casino Royale, two thousand six. Daniel Craig. It's 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 the perfect movie. It's got it's got um, it's got the girl. It's got a great villain. It's got a great story. Uh, it's action packed, but with an actually good story. The actors in it aren't. Uh, it's not. There's no stunt casting in that movie. They're all legitimately good actors. Um, and that's uh, the best Star Wars movie, of course, is The Empire Strikes Back. We all know that. Any other answer is wrong. Anyway, good night. <laughs>